Hello and welcome, my beautiful phantom audience, to yet another rather ook 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 eek lo fa stream. How's everybody doing today? Are you guys ready for some card hunter with my delightful get? Wait, hold on. Delightful get get uh get guest. My delightful guest. Hello. It's Bravi. We're hunting cards today. It Let sounds me... like probably I got offered a call, uh, offered a, uh, a sign in that didn't come through because. Oh no! I'm sorry. Because it, you, your your mic came through in the middle of you being in a sentence like Oops. my my guest. It's my guest. Hello, guest. <laughs> oh guest no. Yes. Ra wait, rabbit has low. Robot ha rabbit has low from broth news. What news do you have, yeah. rabbit? By the way, hello everybody. Boy, nihilism forty two. Rabbit expando. We're hunting cards today. How's everybody doing today? Oh yeah, I forgot to do the boss rush in Ocarina of Time three D. So I have to load up my normal save file and do that. Oh no! And I'm gonna have to do it again for Master Quest Ugh. once I've beaten that. I totally uh, forgot it was a thing. <laughs> boss rush. That sounds difficult. Probably, but the bosses in that game are relatively simple, with the mm -hmm. exception oh. of Vagia, so... Yeah, fair enough. Hey, my power-ups just showed up. Oh, and they're showed up... Oh, I see what you mean. They're showing up above the... Ah, uh, yeah, I don't like um, that either. $300 an hour. I gotta raise guess how much? Oh! Oh, that's right. We were talking about the raise yesterday. Um, I'm going to say. I'm going to be a little more conservative and say two dollars. <laughs> Welcome. Hello. Howard. They're going to get really obnoxious. Yeah, maybe. Um, the problem is, like, people don't really. Message effects. See, people don't really. Um. Spend a lot of bits on my channel anyway, so I think it'll be fine. Bum, 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 bum. Let's smack that in between broke and low. Four dollars race. That's the average middle of what we said. Yes, totally in between. Wow. Four dollars. Congrats. That's insane. Nice. It is. That's a very big race. That's huge. I'm so happy for you, Rabbit. Do, 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 do. You do be balling. You do be balling. I'd say you deserve it, but I technically don't know if that's true because I've never actually seen you do your work. But you oh, probably come. deserve it. Oh, we know that Rabbit deserves it. Come on, they're so great at everything. Well, this tea is really hot. In between on a logarithmic scale. Exactly. <laughs> Giant emotes. Pepe was. I mean. <laughs> I actually, you mentioned it in the Discord, but I was actually going to make a joke, or I was actually going to, yeah, I guess it would have been a joke, about how I could just make the, the power-ups cost like a million bits each. But I'd feel pretty bad if somebody actually used one. There was a $5 raise across the board, but me and one other got very big. Ooh, cool. Other guys are really good worker, and so must you be. Oh, 5% raise, gotcha. All right, let's get started. Do, 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 do. So I actually checked. I finally did it. I actually checked the yeah. daily deal for yesterday. Okay. Uh, there was nothing good in there, honestly. Yeah, I don't recall there being anything good either. Um, scatter. There was, however, there was actually a. Uh, there was actually a really cool laser warrior weapon, but it was like two gold, two yellow uh, gold power tokens. And I just wasn't sure about it, honestly. Yeah. Um, a pulsing laser thrower is There's pretty cool. Some pretty good stuff today, though. Yeah, mighty spark, scatter laser, double pull the trigger, inquisition bolt, and arcane feedback is pretty wonderful. But yeah. it's going to take forever to actually get to use it. Yeah, pull the trigger is fun, but I don't know if I'd say it's good. It's great. What kind like, of cards are we hunting today? Only the best kind. Um, I would say the. Uh... Probably some of the best stuff. The Infused Great Club is pretty good. Powerful Bludgeon is really nice. Oh, yeah. Trained Bludgeon. But, um, 
It's this this instance of royal air. It's one blue power token for a mass frenzy and two inspirations. It's absolutely weird. crazy. Wow. I'm liquidating some of my unused items in order to buy it. Are we hunting banned cards? Like, say, Yu-Gi-Oh cards? No! Yu-Gi-Oh has been banned! We're also, definitely they not, have an, they not have the allowed other, to talk about it while Brof is here. They have one of the other two Mimpo helmets today. All right. It uses a gold power token, but it doesn't have am amnesia on it. So. True. Draw cards. I'm going to buy it just so that I can craft, potentially craft the item that needs two Mimpos. Yeah. I think I'm going to do the same then. This is all of my money. Let's go. Yeah, the yeah, the other item the other item needs no power token, but it's two mimpos and a restless talisman. Restless talisman. Yeah, a restless talisman is obviously rough. It adds three to the damage you take, but then it shuffles itself into an opponent's deck. <laughs> oh neat. It also gives you immunity to bad. unholy though, so Okay, well that's neat. That, that's I good for like, PvP then. I don't know if something's wrong with my ears. I can't hear myself very well. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Because I just noticed you've been, um... Never mind. Um... Am I yelling? No, um... You've just been... Uh, there's been a little bit more, um... Crosstalk than usual. Oh. So, I didn't know if, uh... And maybe you were just in a really that. focused mood today, or sorry. what? What'd you say? I haven't noticed that, but sorry. Okay, no, you were. You're fine. You're fine. I don't know if I sound louder to you, so it sounds to you like I'm talking louder than you are, but to me, you're talking louder than me. So I just, mm. I don't know. Um, definitely something we probably should have uh, taken care of before the stream, but we're good. That's nah, fine. Don't worry about it. I can hear both of you just fine. Fantastic. Thank you, Borb. Thank Let's see. You. So I actually already have my gold power token allocated to my Whirling Flail, which in all honesty is probably way better than the Mempo Helm. Um, but, uh, especially because you this should be able to craft the double Mimpo Helm right now. I, do I have a Righteous Talisman? Restless Talisman. Do I have a, do probably? I have a, there's like a lot a, of them. Do I have everywhere. a, no, I asked if I had a Righteous Talisman. No. So that's not a thing. Well, then I can't craft it. Let's see. New recipes. There it is. I cannot craft it. Biakia's potent visor. Biakia. I do not have a restless talisman. I do have the two mempos. I don't have enough cards to craft this item, it says. Well, that's because mm. I have the... Yeah, I took the... Also, it costs 1,250 gold to make. Because it's a legendary. True. Oh, no. I didn't realize it cost half the buy value. Yeah, well, that is pretty rough. Mm, all right, then. I guess it's we'll... discounted based on the rarity of cards you put into it, but. Oh, let's see then. It's discounted by the sell value of the cards you put into it, mm -hmm. or the, the items you put into mm -hmm. it, it seems. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. not all that much, unfortunately. Craft, and then we put in. You and you. Oh no, it's five gold for the two. Oh no! Yeah, I'm putting in three rare items, so it reduces the cost by 15, but it's still cheaper to buy these three rare items and then craft the helmet than it would be to buy the helmet on its own. Yes. By like 800 gold. Well, they're yours. Uh, this items? is still the optimal way of doing things, but it's going to be a while before I can actually do it. Fair enough. Crafting, crafting your own items, items you would describe as being mined, so you're playing Minecraft? Oh my god, boy, oh, they're oh, yours. They're, 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 items. they're your items now. God, I haven't seen that reference. When was the last time that was referenced? I don't even remember where that came from. I we, don't either. That was, that was a, that was like a running bit we had for a while where it was like, um, where we Oops. were, where we were joking Oops. about ownership of stuff. Oh, so they're yours now. God, so old. Okay. So, okay, we've done a little bit of gavorting around. Looking at items and stuff. 
Let's set out on an adventure. <sighs> I'm nervous, bro. But... Because you know what adventuring means. Monkey. Nope. Oh, wait, no, we're doing Riddle of the Gnome Lords first. That's right. All right, that'll at least get us warmed up. I follow the age old rule. What's yours is mine. And what's mine is mine. Fantastic. Um, <laughs> it's still so hot. Okay, I need to go turn on my armor class real quick, and I'll be right back. All right. This sentence is false. The above sentence is true. Hmm. But. Wait, this sentence is false. Okay, ears back on. This sentence is false, but that doesn't. But if that's the case, then that means the sentence isn't false. Or that means it's true. Which would mean it was false. So. Okay. Now we are doing Riddle of the Gnome Lords. Are you ready, bro? You excited? Yeah. And yeah. now. And now. The above sentence is true. Hmm, that's even worse. Word of your mighty deeds has reached the Gnome Lords. They beseech you for assistance. I'm excited because uh, I don't know anything about this adventure. Do you know what we're going to be facing? I think I remember the gnomes being a very, very similar to goblin berserkers. Oh, the once peaceful gnomes of the mountain caverns have been pillaging the countryside with savage ferocity. Their High Council beseeches you to investigate this outrage. What could be motivating the diminutive denizens to commit this murderous rampage? Yep, sounds about right. Gary! Gary, dear, it smells of stale pizza down here. I brought you a nice sage candle to freshen things up. Uh. Um, we're not conducting an exorcism here. We're fighting mysteriously psychotic gnomes. Oh, Gary. All right. Um. <clears throat> And Gary's mom makes an appearance. Uh, <laughs> after carefully following the directions given to you in the Gnome Lord's letter, you reach the gates of the ancient underground gnome halls. You boldly call out to the occupants and the doors creak open. To your dismay, the gnomes that enrage are frothing with berserk fury and they attack your party with unnatural vigor. The riddle of the Gnome Lords. I have cold blood and my friend has warm. I'm a little egg and they're a little worm. What are we? Oh no. A reptile? Like Jar Jar Bink? <laughs> oh! I took my helmet off. That would have been bad. Alright, onward! You ready, Ralph? Not yet. Come on. What team are you thinking about putting together? 
Obviously, I can only do a warrior because I'm lame, a little bit lame. Correct. The <laughs> answer is Jar Jar Binks. He is both. Ah, true. Yeah, just give me a little bit of time while I set up my game plan. Do that. Okay, you've got you've got all the time in the world, and by that I mean sixteen seconds. That's not quite enough. You drowned. Oh, that's what that sound was. <laughs> Sonic music. Coming the Sonic drowning theme. Your yeah. Discord somehow. Yeah, because I had my face really close to the to the mic, so it was coming. Then my headphone noise was coming through. I see. Face mic. My face. You would love the <laughs> core memory. Yeah. <laughs> I need to decide what the best way to handle this is. Only one life left! Hold on, can I... The exact layout of the I'm kidding. Teams. I'm not gonna play it again. Exact layout for the... What, what, what were you saying? Sorry, I was being, trying to be funny. Uh, I'm just thinking about what the best way to approach this is. Okay. Start playing the Kingdom Hearts low. What's the Kingdom Hearts low health sound? Do that. Okay, Kingdom Hearts low HP sound, but I extended it to one hour. Fantastic. Oh no. <laughs> God, oh that's awful. Hey yo, up yo! How you doing today? Your internet's insanely bad, I'm so sorry. Give me a little bit of time while I set up. I'm watching the clip. Do that. Okay, you've got you've got all the time in the world, and by that I mean sixteen seconds. That's not quite enough. <laughs> 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 that was actually a really great place to clip it to. Wheel! Yeah, we got wheel! No, I don't know. I'm sorry. I was not prepared for this. Hey, you're totally fine. Don't worry about it. Loosen up a little. Don't be so don't be so nervous. You're all good. You're doing great. I didn't mean to I didn't mean to jump on jump down your throat earlier. You're all good. And Imagine doing a performance. None of this is really it. calling out to me for how I want to build Ugh. my team, unfortunately. Really? I mean, you've only got one person. Shouldn't that be... You don't really have to build a team. You just got to compliment my incredibly stubborn gameplay choices. Mm -hmm. Shoot, I accidentally took off an item and I got to find it again. Oops. You can always search in the search bar. There we go. Encounter. Encounter. Yeah, that um, that Pokemon Red thing sounds awful. Wait a minute. Oh, that's right. Pokemon Gen One Pokemon did have a low health beep, didn't it? Yeah, and it overwrote other musical cues, so it was slightly faster to have it playing all the time. Slightly faster? What? Yeah. Because the other musical cues were like longer or something like that. Oh, so it, weird. like it would overwrite like battle intro music and stuff. I think. So weird. It is. Gen one is weird. <laughs> Tall trees bring them to their knees. Or just one of the tiny terrors. But we are not trees. We are peoples. True. Well, as far as you know, Trixie, Pixie, Muxie, and Jollo. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Um, okay, what are we dealing with? These trees are blocking terrain. Difficult. Okay, so the grass is open. The thorny vines are difficult. The trees are blocked. Cool. I think we should just wait, yeah? I'm just gonna wait. 
I was just gonna move in. Yeah, I guess they are extremely far away. And we're both melee fighters, so... Oh! Oh, are you clear? Yay! It's Volut Grizzenbane! <laughs> Yay, everybody! Applause for Volut Grizzenbane! He's, they're back! <laughs> Streamer, can you add Spiral Orange to the retro wheel? Can no, we don't do it. <laughs> oh, come on! What could possibly be so bad about Spiral Orange? Everything. Everything is bad about it. It's a bad game. Don't do it. If you're going to put one of them, do uh, Crash Purple instead. That game is actually playable. <laughs> Was it worth the wait, Expando? <laughs> <laughs> Expando! So you set this up. You set, you set me up. You... <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> Dude, like me, I think it was like two days. I think it was on Wednesday. I think it was on Wednesday. X Band that was like, hey, could, uh, should we add Spire Orange? Oh, it was Sunday. It was like, we should add Spire Orange to the wheel. And I'm like, I don't think Brof's in chat. You should ask that when Brof is in chat so you can get a really <laughs> great reaction. <laughs> or when Brof is around on Friday. Ask on Friday so you'll get like an actual live reaction. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, he's gonna lose his mind if you do. I'm so, I'm so glad I called it. I know you well enough. That game was bad. Yeah, I forgot about that little year. Yeah, I I wa I mean I I watched some of I watched some of his gameplay and it was <laughs> it looked awful. Let's see. Um. Oh, I I don't want to burn my thick hide armor just for one movement. I guess I'm just gonna sit still. I have lemons, I have water, I have salt, I have sugar. It's time to make unhealthy amounts of lemonade. Baby, yes! Lemonade! Oh, I knew I was forgetting something. Hi, Ray Redeem! I had the sinkingest suspicion that I was forgetting something. Oh, that's a good hand, bro. Lunging drain. Ooh. I don't think we can use power to coins in this game. Because... No, we can't. Did somebody ask me to? No, but you have the redeem available. <laughs> right, right, right. No, um... When did I decide to do that, then? <laughs> Excuse me. Um, I've decided to leave the power coin redeem up permanently. That oh, way, okay. that way, it's easier for people to just. That way, it's not like, because I've noticed that people kind of just forget to do it on Saturdays because it's so infrequent. So I get. So if I leave it open for people to do it whenever the whim strikes them, and the fact that I've made it so it's a lot easier for me to just uh, turn my coin counter on and off, um, <clears throat> it's easier for me to do it now. And I have a little, a little sound effect and stuff too, so it's easier to do it off, off retro stream. Um, I have to discard stuff. Yes. Arcane feedback and that's beans. That's pretty beans. Uh, and block. Powerful bludgeon is insane. Uh. That's mean beans. Yeah, Sonic reference. Oh, ouch. Oh, nice. Never mind. Empty body. God, the scars. Let's see. You five points of unholy damage if you're on victory train. Oh! But if you have the talisman, you're immune to unholy damage! Oh, yeah. I didn't think about that. <laughs> Sonic Speed! Let's see. Um, I want to block Soldier U. What do you think? Yes, please. You're in the Vanguard, so. Imagine the East Pass! Go uh, pass. Yeah, that's annoying. Imagine thinking Spyro Orange is a bad game. Couldn't be me. Yeah, I don't understand what's in the brophy either. Seems um, absolutely. I played it, so <laughs> that's, that's that's why I think that if I played the game. So. Oh boy. <laughs> I forget if I had Spyro Orange or Crash Purple. I believe I had Spyro Orange. I think Brof had Crash Purple. <laughs> Yeah, something along those lines. <gasps> Jeez, I can't get close to the gnome berserkers because look at all the attacks they have. Yeah, look at that crazy, uh, crazy power. Oh no! They have an obliterating chop and a strong chop, so their obliterating chop is eleven. 
Yeah. Two Berserk spins into every adjacent square, regardless of facing you, take one slide. Okay, well, that'll actually attack... That'll attack their allies, though. Yeah, but it's still better to just not... <laughs> but I need to hit them. All right, fine. Wait. Oh, that's a that's a two range move. Yes. What did you do? Oh, hey. The gnome insider. He can curse us. Yes, it looks like it. He it can is. also frenzy them. So <laughs> that guy right there has frenzy four, and he gets plus three because the unholy curse. So he could potentially be doing like eighteen damage with a single attack. Probably shouldn't get close to him then. Um, yeah. May have been Crash Purple. Which one is the stage called Tanks for the Memories? I think that's Crash. I think Crash Purple at the tank levels. I not think that's it. the Crash one. Mm -hmm. I don't. Yeah, I think I think that's the Crash one. I'm not sure. I remember the name of the level, but that's it. I don't know which one it, it was. <sighs> oh, because you did play both of them. Right. Yeah. I forgot you played both. I don't think that armor is going to be doing very much yeah, here. I don't think so. Neither either. is the investigate, investigate, to be perfectly honest. Mm -mm, yeah, I was thinking this, I, I was going to get rid of them anyway, but um, you're right. I hadn't thought about the fact that they're not very helpful here. <gasps> Inquisitive Strike! Oh, well, that's it's fine. So much HP. I plan on. Oh, no! Oh, no, oh, no. that sucks. Oh, that's fine. Vicious Thrust is a good way to get in. Bum, 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 bum. They have so many attacks. They do. Um, the absolute worst case scenario is for both of us to be adjacent to the same one. Mm -hmm. Their chops. Mm -hmm. Um. I think then I am going to stab. I think I'm going to stab the 24, the unholy wellspring guy. All right. I want to try to inquisitor strike him and vicious. I want to kill him off. I want to do something. I want to try to kill this guy off. Okay. Wait, he, he's doing what? What are you doing? He got ouched. Oh. Then they refreshed his thing, which is dumb because it's not really how that works. Mm -mm. <laughs> now we just have to wait for him to get close and I can kill him. True, yeah. God, this is a tough choice. Corporal. Yes! Okay, there we go. I, I mean, just kill him. I think you know? I want to go, but then that leaves me. I could vicious thrust away. That they leaves can me... only attack you once. Yeah. You're part of a group. So. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Just kid him. Well, I mean, you, it's easy for you to say. <laughs> You've just got a nine health guy over by you. You can barge away. By Rorange. Hmm. I'm gonna let you kill him. Well, yeah. That way you'll be safe, because you only have 19 health P. Yeah, but I could heal back the damage he does to me. I'm just kill him. I already passed it to you. Uh-oh. Just um, unload. Should oh, I wait, no, run after the I insider. I was about to say, I should, should I go after the insider instead? Yeah, get rid of that jerk. Boop, that boop, guy boop, can boop, go boop, be boop, not boop. here anymore. Right? But. Unload! <laughs> Alright, now they've got their support gone. Okay, well that wasn't as bad as I was expecting so far. We've only got one yeah, guy left. They we kind of decided not to try attacking us. Convenient. But. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, they kind of threw, I think. Oh, come on. Ah! Thank you. No! Wait, oh, did he use charge? Yeah. Okay. Yuck. I mean, I can't do anything. All I have is arcane feedback, and you... 
Yeah, just run. Can then. already, yeah, you can already kill. Rude. All right, time for you to shine. Bye, bye. Huh. I mean, all right. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a zombie now. Yeah, I'm a zombie now. Yeah. We probably just use arcane feedback so you don't take damage off of it. Oh, true. Or you can nimbus me. Yeah, whatever. Doesn't work that way. Oh, no. Right, well, I have Curse of Amnesia. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All nice. part of my plan. All according to King Kaku. Oh, come on. He didn't draw any attacks off of the zombie form. It's really annoying. It is. Oh, you cannot infamous to the retro wheel as of May 26th. Interesting. Was this May or? The as May in like the May that passed? already happened? Yes. I infamous assume, game. I assume they don't yeah. mean next May because that's a wild. That's, yeah, that's future. a weird. That's a weird way to say it too. Um, May twenty sixth, two thousand and nine was the first infamous. What about infamous two? Obviously later. Obviously afterwards. Actually, infamous two was released first. <laughs> two years. Two more years. June seventh. Two June seventh, twenty eleven. So we've got two more years before infamous two is retro. Dang, I would love to. I would love to play Infamous Two on stream. Curse Hornet. Ooh, they can't curse me anymore. At least. Do you want me to go first and just uh, just wail on this guy? Or I'll do it anyway. Yeah, do your best. <laughs> do do your worst. I mean. You probably could have let me impenetrable Nimbus you first. Oh, yeah! Well, then why didn't you say anything? Oh, no, I couldn't because of Stoic's Blade. Oh, yeah, true. Play Infamous 2 on stream and then stop. There were no sequels to Infamous 2. Now... I am... begrudgingly inclined to disagree with you. <laughs> Because I did actually kind of enjoy Second Side. I thought it was pretty cool. I thought they could have handled the systems better, but I thought it was pretty cool. Um. Um. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say about that. I liked the game. Mm -hmm. I thought the I thought the inclusion of a uh, gauntlet that lets you swap between your swap between your powers pretty like quickly and uh, incentivizes creativity and kind of is reminiscent of like a Devil May Cry combat arena like the the uh, Blood Palace or whatever they call it in DMC. Uh, I don't think Shimmer Aura is very useful. Well, I'll keep one. Oh, why? I thought this I still had the curse of your niche. Huh? These guys don't use magic. This guy does? Not not damaging magic. Hmm. I'm going after him. Uh oh. Alright, you can go after him. Uh oh, yeah, okay. You win. Second Son felt like Sony Force that I have to make a sequel and they didn't really want to. Mm. Which is interesting to me, of course. Yay, we won! The crazed gnomes lie dead before you. You feel a great sorrow as you empty their pockets. What terrible force could have perverted these peace-loving folk? The answer surely lies within. Aw, poor gnomes. Maybe they're just in a bad mood. They might be, but now they're dead. Maybe um, they were just in a bad mood. Oh, that's horrible. I got tan boots, which has quick run, run, and lunging hack. Ugh, agreed. Three strong stabs and three lunging thrusts? It's actually a really good... Oh, never mind. It's a gold and a blue. It's a major minor power token. It's awful. Um... 
uh, it is very interesting because everybody has bad days. Yep. Everybody feels that way. Everybody knows what, what I'm talking about. Ew. That sage can't. That sage candle might send me into a rage soon, too. Dang it. Sorry. I heard you chuckle after I did that. Ew, that sage candle might send me into a rage soon, too. I love Karen. Sage candle. I've never... I don't really know what sage smells like. I don't buy a lot of candles. You appear it's not a very timely scent. Oh, it's not timely? Is that a... The pun. Wow. 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 Oh, time! Wow! Wow! Oh, wait, hold on. Do I have, like, a... <laughs> God, that's so I gotta cut it short. That's such a loud boo. It's such a long boo sound clip. Just kidding. I make bad jokes all the time. That was a pretty good one, actually. I liked it. You appear into the murky darkness of the once great abode of this diminutive people. The shadows conceal disrepair and unknowingly guttural screams echo from the hall's depths. The patter of tiny, murderous feet heralds the arrival of a crazed contingent of gnomish guardsmen. You must defend yourselves. Your booze mean nothing to me! I've seen what makes you cheer! Is that a reference? <laughs> Love doesn't buy candles, confirm? Yeah, yeah, I don't buy candles. They're smoky, and I don't like... I don't like, like, having them lit in the building, and because, yeah, they're, yeah. I don't buy candles. But anyway, um, what I was going to say about Second Son was that um, it's interesting that they would feel that way because um, they actually abandon they actually abandon us like well they they said they decided they they didn't want to do any Sly Cooper anymore because they wanted to focus on Infamous. I don't know they I, that's that was the that was the um, oh yeah. That was the, what's the word, interview that I heard of was that they were like, yeah, we didn't, we were moving on. We decided to just drop Sly Cooper because we were in focus on Infamous. Not because we think we're done with the story. They didn't say that, but at least not from what I remember. But they might have been. They probably should have been. <laughs> and they were. I mean, they. I say they should have been. They were. Sunsider Games was the one that took the story further. Rolf? You there? Yes. Okay. You ready? Yeah. I've already I've already clicked I've already clicked onward. Oh, okay. I didn't I didn't notice you reading it, sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, no. Encounter. I think you said that you didn't finish Infamous 2, so Oh no no I did. I did. I did finish Infamous 2. I finished I've I've I did not finish Infamous 1. I did not beat Infamous 1. I started with Infamous 2 and later got Infamous 1 and only played a little bit of it. Snickersnack, chop and hack. The insider urges his crazed companions. Incomplete one, yeah. Hey, Viral. Let's see. Okay, so we've got an insider and now four berserkers. A lot of berserkers. It's only four? We just fought three. That's only one more. Nova, you gotta take the shimmering auras off. These guys don't use anything that they block. Okay, I forgot. I'm sorry. I wasn't thinking. I forgot I needed to maybe change my setup. <laughs> I'll just discard it. It'll be fine. I'm gonna run up. Bomb bomb. Ouch. Literally. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> what? It's not the greatest deal you in the history of mankind. Probably shouldn't be doing that, friend. Um, I don't want to get close, so I'm just gonna let them approach. Wait, they can't approach. They're done. Huh? Hmm. They might have one more move, but it's unlikely. I could do I really a little want bit. Want to of... try and hit these guys while they have that raging strike in hand. But... True, I could, I could try, but if I move close, it's I'm gonna. Too dangerous. I know, I know what I need to do. I'm gonna healing dash here, and then I'm going to, or no, and then Let's I'll go after the right side first. I was gonna take out the insider because he's a big problem. 
Oh, fell very far you away. don't have nearly enough damage for that, though. No, but I can do some. The endings of Infamous 2 both fell very final, and the retroactive changing of certain plot points aggravate. Yeah, yeah, that's a really good... Yes, I, I will say I didn't... I, there were a lot of things about Infamous 2... Uh, sorry, Second Son that I did not agree with. All right, I'll healing dash over to the 15 then. Or do I just end the, end the round? Do I just give up? I don't know. All right, well, I'm going to take... Um, I'm going to take point then. Okay. You could have. I know. Stopped. I'm aware. <laughs> you didn't want to give me any advice, so I'm doing things my way. <laughs> Ugh, whatever. I'm unreasonably sad. Wait, why? It's. It's just like. A lifestyle choice. Not everybody likes candles. Sorry. I'm just not a huge fan of them. You said whatever? Yeah, I know. Well, now you can only attack the insider, so I have <laughs> so now you can go after your original game plan again. Oh, does he have me taunted? Yeah, yeah baby, let's go! <laughs> mm. <gasps> you joink. Oh, I have an idea. I'm going to move here and you can team shift me oh, over. Hmm. All right. Sure. All right. Well, now I'm completely useless. No, you're not. You can still do that plan. Oh, no. I Wait. Oh, I guess I can. How so? Oh, because I can take the path up. Gotcha. Yeah. Except I'm pretty sure I'm- Oh, you nimbus me! You're so clever! <laughs> You're so much better! You're so good at this! Uh... Oh, guys! Alright, now you have to team shift me. Bludgeon! Now I'm completely useless. Welcome to the club. I'm in charge here. You'll find drinks somewhere, probably. Ah, oh, fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I didn't bring any. Yeah. <laughs> Energize. Who did you use that on? The guy behind you, who is now able to attack you again. Oh, that's what it does. Okay. Cool. I'll. We'll see you later, Borb. Let's see, um... Well, they Stop did use a lot of me. damage on you. What'd you no, say? you want them to attack you. Well, I don't like it! It may bounce off my skin, but it still hits and leaves emotional damage! Emotional no, damage! No, God, please don't. I... I... <laughs> <laughs> I just can't stand it. It's okay, never mind. Anyway, um, um, all right. Well, you can probably no. You cannot take out the take out the insider. I'll take out the insider. Yeah. I will try to take out the insider. Ah. Inquisitor strike. Yeah. He just phased through the wall. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. I'm literally dead. There's no way I survive. Yeah, just chop them. <laughs> I'm gonna. Yeah, I might as well. Nose. That's what I was gonna say. Is I might as well go down swinging. Clip. <laughs> hmm. I'm trying to decide if I should lo let you stab them for three more damage, or no, I'm gonna reposition myself so that I can block. Good idea. Rip Flupledorp, yep. Goodbye! What? Okay, now can I stab them or 
Yes. Should I? I mean, should yeah, I stab him? Yeah. Nice job. Oh. That's actually really funny. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's like, yay, blood no, to get booted! <laughs> What'd you say? No, it is very funny, yeah. <laughs> Cough eye. Cough eye. Nice job. Only I had one more damage. Now, if only I draw. If I can draw a massive chop, I will go out in a blaze of glory. Wait, you should have let us pack. Because if he gets. No, it was already going to end the round anyway. Ah, okay. It was already too late for us to get priority. Okay, good. At least I didn't draw it. Oh, now they're blocking my escape route. I think you should honestly pass it to me. Yeah, go for it. Um. At least you can vicious thrust one yeah, of them. Yeah, to get away, yeah. Yeah. What? And then I can sundering strike him too. Uh, I think you should just run instead. But... I only have two health. Yeah, but if I frenzy you first, then Sundering Strike would be lethal, but if I do it, they'll just damage you now. So. Yeah, you're right. Womp womp! Yeah, and also... now you can actually use Arcane Feedback to kill the 1 HP guy. Yeah! I think about until just now. Good job on that. Thank you. Blocking my escape route? Yeah! My yeah. escape carrot! I went to a cool to be potato. Escape potato, yeah. Oh. Escape turnip. I keep forgetting that's too range. I went to a cool LGBTQ plus focused FTC server, and of course everyone plays Strive, so I gotta learn it. Yeah, I of course everyone plays Strive. Strive is like the biggest fighting game right now. It's wild. What do they have in hand? Gary doesn't want to attack, so they must have something that doesn't actually work. But Welcome what on back, earth is Mark. it? No idea. Today's curse, by the way, my internet. Yeah, I'm so sorry. I saw earlier you mentioned that your internet was bad. The things were fritzing out. You said something about 720p, and I don't remember what you were saying. How are we doing, 05? We're doing great size. Yeah. I'm scrolling back to see if I missed see the 720p comment. I think maybe that wasn't you that said it then. Oh, fantastic. I'm actually going to do the ultimate disrespect and just arcane feedback him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yay! I could actually mempo him. That would have been funnier. Yeah. Oh, a few things in card hunting can match the horror of a horde of becrazed gnomes. <clears throat> the gnomes attacked you without rhyme or reason and without any regard for their personal safety. Despite your pleas for sanity, they threw themselves against you and you were forced to slay them. This is quite the sad story. I wonder what's going on. Yeah. So, gotta put the lemonade in the freezer because the peppermint probably infused now. And peppermint lemonade sounds interesting. <gasps> I got a cheap idol that sells for two gold. Looks like it's made of like copper or bronze. Uh, Scarlet Staff is kind of interesting. I guess it's like a spear because it has a piercing attack on it. It has a lunging strike. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, it has a lunging strike, two short sparks, two penetrating bolts, and a mighty spark. So, not really useful for anything I can think of. Because it's a it's a yellow and a blue power token. Oh, I already had one! That's awesome. <laughs> Whoa! I appreciate that, Borb. Let's see. I gotta buy salts, more lemons, and a big jar. Mm. Feeling a little lightheaded. I almost used pixie figures for this battle instead of gnomes. Just put out the sage candle! Yeah, guys, come on, please. It's not that hard. It's not that it's not that important. It's making you guys sick. You Your mom is not going to kill you if you don't want to let, let her candle stay. I mean, probably. I don't know yeah. that much about Gary's mom, but Yeah, she's uh she's like an anti she's like an anti gnome berserker. Like, uh if, unless there's sage in the house, um, Constantly, she will go into a murderous rage and kill everyone in sight. That's why they have to keep sage burning. 
You press on into the depths of the gnome stronghold. You pass the bodies of slaughtered innocents, evidence that terrible crimes have been committed here. Before you have time to ponder this, you see some feverish gnomes up ahead trying to lock down the passageway. If allowed to complete their task, the door may never open again. You must seize the exit before it is too late. Oh, this one's dark. <laughs> it's like, are you, are you sure I'm voicing the right project? Like, let's see. Maybe I should just stop talking. No, not, not in general. No, just be a little, I don't know. I don't know what to say here. Uh, All right, battle time. And I'm going to leave my shimmering ore on. Please don't. <laughs> no, I should because it's a great. It's a great armor. It's really powerful. It's not even a very good armor. It's very fantastic. Yes, it is. Shimmering it's a very so decent good. low level armor, but it shimmering does not. Shimmering aura is so powerful. Mm -hmm. <sighs> no. <laughs> Bong, bong, bong. Hmm. Okay. Alright, bro, I am ready for battle. Just let me know when you are. How did Gary's mom allow Melvin to happen? I mean... It's a good question, actually. She seems like she spoils her kids a little, so maybe that's what happened. <sighs> She's not very using my power tokens very efficiently, but I'm not really sure what I should change to make that not true anymore. I'm so sorry, Borb. Me a little bit. I hope maybe time. you start to feel a little bit better, and then you can come back, and we'll have a wonderful stream together. Just give You're me. Fine. When Melvin used Winged Dragon of Roz to say, "Oh my God, yes, he would. He absolutely would. He'd, <laughs> he would, he would hold so fast on um, Winged Dragon of Raw Is this because we need a Mel we need Melvin today? If we don't get Melvin, yeah. it'll be bad. So um, such a um, weird callback. Winged Dragon of Raw is what? What do you mean? Because we were talking about the deck masters right. the last time we played this. True. So. We in Dragon of Ra is actually the best of the Egyptian god cards. Uh, Merrick said so himself in episode uh, 68 of Yu Gi Oh! Battle City. Alright. Now I have to check to see if that's right, because I think. I was going to look up what episode 68 of Yu Gi Oh! was, but I don't even think it goes that far. It does. You gave oh, episode 68. Wow, Mind control! Oh my god! Early, early in the. Wait a minute. Oh, he doesn't mention Raw this early. Is episode 68 is Joey versus Mako called Legendary Fisherman Part 1. Really? Same. So why did it say Mime Control? Weird. Okay, yeah. Episode 68, yeah, okay, no worries. Legendary Fisherman Part 1, neat. That's Joey vs. Make That Tsunami Part 2, I think. Uh, no, that's, that's episode 69. Let's see, um, okay, now let's look at what we're dealing with. We've got Lingo, wait, did I read the- Wild gnomes, yes, I think so. You read something and were like, this is really dark. Are we sure we're reading the right thing? Yeah, right? I was. Yeah, it was a little bit. And then, like, I don't remember what I said, though. Let me let me roll the stream back a little bit to make sure. Because I feel like I didn't get a... I don't remember what the actual setup for this, for this encounter was. <sighs> the Japanese title of the episode is Invisible Enemy Sea Stealth 2. Oh, I like that. That's fun. The Japanese titles were generally more serious than the mm -hmm. English titles. Yeah, the Japanese the Japanese version of the of the anime was really really interesting and good. You 
If you don't know the deaths of the known stronghold, you pass the bodies as long as it is. Oh, right! They're trying to lock down the passageway. I remember that now. My bad. Oh, so there's one victory square. We gotta go take that guy out. Oh, this is gross. What is this thing? Uh, wild gnomes. So two gnome berserkers and two wild... Sorry, three wild gnomes. Don't know what their deal is, so we'll just have to proceed okay. with caution, but not too much because we need to get to that victory terrain. Yeah, within six turns. <laughs> um, uh, I think I'll take point. I have armor, I have yeah. life drain, I have a healing move. Good idea. Oh, oh so it's good oh, you did that because I actually... Mm -hmm. Oh, it's so much damage. It would have been so good to block that. Yeah. There's a dating thing now for gamers. Date play. Well, Loaf, we have reached Speak Stupidity. Date player two. Wait, is that. That's a dating site? Ugh. I thought you meant it's like a dating game. Mm -hmm. A dating site called Date Player Two for gamers, because gamers need all the help they can get. <laughs> they do, but that's not going to help them. Ugh. Reminds me of, uh, like. Oh, jeez. Like you have to make you have to make a dating site that appeals to more than just like one category of person, because otherwise you're only going to have like, it, for example, there was like a dating site that some internet morons made that like only guys signed up for. So it's like, well, you can't. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's for heterosexual. Find any women because. It's a hetero. Yeah, it's a dating site for heterosexual heterosexual males that only, only men were allowed. No one else was allowed on, basically. Yeah, that only allowed men on the site. So that was a mistake. Only that heterosexual seems, males. No that seems else. like a bit of a, a bit of a lack of foresight. We're getting distracted by Yu-Gi-Oh again. Getting back on track. Wait, why did Mako give Joey Fortress Whale, but not the magic card needed to actually play? I always was confused about that. I'm like, yeah. Fortress Whale is a ritual card, and he never plays it. He never it, plays Fortress Whale. He can't. <laughs> exactly. Uh, technically, the rules is they have to give him the rarest card, and I guess Fortress Whale was Mako's rarest card. I feel like that's why he also gave him Legendary Fisherman, so about... he could give him a card that's usable. Uh... But I'm using usable very liberally here. <laughs> God. We can we go back to the good Without a legendary ocean, legendary fisherman is really bad. Mm -hmm. Or just <laughs> you really Umi. need the cost reduction from legendary ocean. They wagered two cards in that too. Oh, did they? Oh, I didn't remember that. I don't. Um, did they? I don't think that was the case. They wagered two locator cards. I thought they wagered three as locator cards. cards. Though, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure Mako's just like. Also, I want you to have the legendary fisherman to inherit my will. Yeah. Because I don't even think... I think it's illegal to wager more than one card. Because I, I think, think so. one guy tried to do that and Kaiba like, kicked him out of the tournament or something. Mm. I know. I, I think he wagered three locator cards, actually. Because if you look at the thumbnail oh, yeah. for the episode, he's got three... He's holding up three. Unless he's just bragging. He's like, oh, I'll bet it's all with two of these. I don't know what to do here. I'm just going to weak chop the 23, I guess. Uh, arcane, yeah, sure. Uh oh Ow. Well, now we know what those guys' deal is. Ah, uh, they're they're rogues. Yeah. Oh come, come on, on! Please, just pass one of the fifty fifties. Oh my god. Um. Bubble. Oh yeah. If, of course, you have your greater heal, so that's good. It probably differed based on subject. It might have. They wagered two cards in that yeah. duel, huh? Okay, we need to push. Yeah. There we go. Thanks for the health. They're not attacking me, though, is the problem. Will you please? Yikes. You want me to pass it to you so you can do something? Oh, wait. Uh, you no, can't attack. You need so. to take priority. Yeah. You can't attack. So um, just go. Go for broke. <laughs> yeah! Uh, <laughs> These rolls are brutal, man. <laughs> Clip. Uh, 
you're killing me. Like literally. Yeah, literally. According to the Waco, to the week, to the Waco, Jiki, Jiki and Mako wagered two locator cards each. I, anyway. Yes, because I believe it was he got one Esp one from Esperoba, two from Weevil, and two from Mako. Mm -hmm. But Mako's like, I have three, so I'm not going to get removed from the tournament from this. Oh. So, be so like that was. But then he does anyway because he never shows up again. Well, he didn't get removed. He just didn't make it to the finals. Uh. There were not. There were. There were only eight spots in the finals, but there were more locator cards than that. It was just the first eight people. It, uh, teleports. What in the world? Uh, these guys are terrifying. Guys teleport. These guys are terrifying. There's a Cell Games parody where Yugi goes to battle Cell, and Cell stops him almost instantly. He's like, "Yeah, that's against the rules." Yeah. And then Flash call Yu Gi Oh. Yeah, oh. It was on. It was part of the Cell versus thing for that, team four um, star right for, yeah that's filler for when they were setting up for the finale mm -hmm. and I then like uh, the, Kenshiro like, shows was up Fist, Kenshiro from Fist of the North Star that one was my favorite yeah but, was... <gasps> okay but why though <laughs> <laughs> yeah and then, like... yes, you needed six locator cards I'm uh, pretty sure and I believe Kenshiro didn't even canonically lose to sell in that one cause... no he he, were, he annihilated them. Of course, because Kenshiro cannot lose because he's awesome. Well, that's not true, but you know what I also, mean. Also, we're, we're totally we're, we're going to lose this because I cannot roll to save my life. Oh, totally well, that's fine. Screwed. I can figure something out. We're totally, uh, we're totally in trouble. Hello. Probably should have passed so that we'd have priority on the next turn. Nah, it's fine. It's not like you're gonna die or anything. No, 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 no. You're fine. It's not like you're gonna die. Why would you die? That's not gonna happen. See? I'm gonna die. Um. <laughs> what should I do here? Oh. Let me frenzy us. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. I was gonna say powerful bludgeon the guy. Yeah, frenzy's a better choice. Oh. oh, good job. Now you can now you can powerful bludgeon him, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Fantastic. Victory zone victory square is saved. Is is We are up. alive. <laughs> Should I move on to the victory square or do you want to? I will. You have more health than me, so you're more suited for handling these guys. Right, I think I'm gonna mighty hack the the Lingus. Lingus? Yeah. Lingo. I think I'm gonna mighty hack and go. Jobo, Banjo, and... No way. <gasps> oh, thank God, I forgot you Nimbus yourself. Jobo, Hixie, Banjo, and Hixie. That's insane. Please, can't... I, I've rolled this ar I've rolled this armor one time. 50-50 is a lie. It's always a lie. Uh oh Get on that square, baby. And now time for Mimpo to do its thing. Yep. As long as you move so that you can hit the guy with it mm -hmm. anyway. I'm going to try to hit everybody except for you. <laughs> yeah. Because it goes, yeah. Oh, what? I didn't notice he only had like two health left. What? Four. He had four. Uh, how's going? It's going great, TLBG. Hi, TLBG. How you doing today? We have. Uh, great is a bit of an overstatement. Both had a bit of a scare, but as we all know, I always carry this team. So I have the ability to turn any bad situation <clears throat> around. And um, I can totally make sure we're not going to die here. So explained. Uh, okay. It's not super helpful. Uh, here. As long as we kill this guy, we win. Oh yeah. Or as true. long as we don't die this turn. As long as we, we don't win, die this but... turn, true. And you have Nimbus. Just if Nimbus we kill yourself. This guy, we instantly Just win. Nimbus yourself, and we literally win. True. Yeah. No, Nimbus just. He's way too far away to attack me, so it's. Oh fine. right, that guy's the only one who can attack still. I finally got past that awfully designed kill, Ginza kill fight. Twelve HP guy. Huh? Do it. What? Kill the twelve HP guy. With what? Oh, so oh, Jesus! Yeah, got plus four damage. 
<laughs> Goodbye. Yay, we won! See, that wasn't hard at all. What are you talking about? We did great. Can I be? Of course, you're sorry for making a mess again. I appreciate that, boy. Yeah, of course you're allowed to be in here. <laughs> Wake up, Lufi Lady! Were you overcome by the sage fumes? <laughs> what? What? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I had a grand adventure where there were crazy gnomes everywhere. Looks at the table. No, God! <laughs> <laughs> See, you breathe, a, you breathe a sigh of relief and hammer in some iron spikes to keep the door open. You will require additional provisions to go further into the halls, but at least the way will be clear upon your return. No assessors reward you as you leave, wishing you good fortune for your journey back. What are assessors? Oh. Don't know. Yeah, losing time off is the worst thing. Oh. And it's especially bad that you can't even enjoy the time off that you have right oh. now. That's they got me enough for, the worst. They got me for another job of time, but I thought at least I could have enjoyed the evening. But no, my inner... Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I got a really good item from this. Oh yeah? Yeah. What is it? It's the Polar Cane. Ooh. Cold Snap, which is six range, four damage, encumber two. Okay. Uh, three Frost Jolts, which is eight range, four damage, encumber two. Jeez. And two Frozen Cores, which is four range, three damage to everyone within line of sight, encumber one. <gasps> oh! It's a full Ice Staff. Oh my god, I wish I had gotten that instead of you, because I'm mean and <laughs> greedy. <laughs> I did, however, get trained frigidity, which is funny. Two winners and braces oh. and a chilling rhyme. Nice. Which is funny because I actually have a focused frigidity, which is a gold, a gold power token instead of a blue. Trained frigidity is a blue. Focused frigidity is three winners and braces. So if I can get that polar rod, I will be set for cold. Not really, because I'll need the a polar rod. Stuff. is a gold and a blue, so. Ugh. Well, it's worth it. Good stuff. Yeah. Because. Ice Mage is hard to put together. I got an Amulet of Inspiration. Can you guess what cards it has on it? <laughs> Three Inspirations, it looks like. Of course! Uh, nice. It's pretty good. Inspiration's yeah, a good card. It's not bad. Alright. Oh, and um, oh, I thought that was a Mushroom. It's a Lieutenant's Cap. It's got Weakened Armor and two Run Teams. And yeah. Yeah. At Renown Up! Nice. All right, Secret of the Gnome Lords, which apparently we're going to be doing for Caverns of Whoa. Chaos. Whoa, Lil Fat Lady, we just unlocked oh, a special adventure. The Caverns, uh, judging by your special reaction. Special in the sense that it's terrible. <laughs> the Caverns of Chaos is totally different from other card hunter modules. This adventure is full of twists. It's infinitely replayable. I just hope I can GM it right. It seems kind of complicated. I'll do my best whenever you're ready. Oh. Yeah, so here's the thing. Making something infinitely replayable is not as beneficial as making something that is fun to replay. <laughs> Yikes. That's <laughs> quite the scathing indictment. Roguelike dungeons? Yeah, it looks like it. Uh, it is not a roguelike. It is bad. Um, it's just, I believe it's yeah, eight maps locations. in a row. Yeah. That are completely randomized. Eight of them? Oh, yeah. Completely randomized is not great. Like, you don't... You bring in your team for the first map, and from that point forward, every single map, you have a random team. Oh, what? You have no control over what kind of attack cards you have or what your team composition is, and the enemies you fight are also random, I believe. What the... It just... It's bad. It's not fun to do. It's really, really hard to win. It's just bad. I don't like when the game keeps generating content. Personally, good things come to an Yeah, I suppose. Yeah, that's yeah, that's like, an okay stance. It, it curated curated maps will always be better than random garbage, mm -hmm. pretty much. Yeah. Like it depends on the game, of course. Like a roguelike, a well designed roguelike, is good at random generation because it's curated to be that way. Like, they don't need to personally oh. design each individual map because they personally designed the items instead. And you build your run like they balance the game properly to. But this is not like that. This is just a just a bunch of random maps to suck away at your time. Garbage. Sorry, I, I was looking it's up sort a... of it's the. It's the computer-generated Sudoku of, uh, of oh, Card Hunter. Oh, no! 
fear, and you'll hate Dark Cloud 3? <laughs> Dark Cloud 3 is not randomly generated. It is intelligent design. <laughs> Dark Cloud 3 came into being... Came into be Came to be through intelligent design. Cloud we have no idea who made it. Dark Cloud 3 is the library of Babel. What'd you say? Dark Cloud 3 is yeah. the library of Babel. It's the library of Babel, exactly. It has all the... All the the video game knowledge of humanity in it all forms of gameplay it does but they're put, put together flawlessly there's no they, the game is perfect like <laughs> actually i think it would be better i think it's like the game is an imperfect but in, in such a way it is now perfect because it is it, because the, our world is not perfect so Dark Cloud 3 is literally just a small universe. <laughs> you get to play around in it. Reminds me of that Call of Humor video where it's like Omni. It's like, you know, those restaurants that have a menu that have like what, like three or four good dishes and uh, other restaurants that have a menu the size of a Bible. Yeah. Guess which one Omni is like? That's right. Both. <laughs> oh, oh, no. <laughs> Whoa. It's like, is Dark oh, Cloud 3 it. randomly generated or hand curated? Yes, to both of them. <laughs> oh, no. This is... I don't know is... how they did it, but they did. It is both of those things at once. Ha, try our tr trout au chocolat. It is trout covered in chocolate mayonnaise. <laughs> okay, I think the stream can end now. <laughs> you said randomly generated, so I just thought of three random things. Ew. <laughs> yeah. How do you even get chocolate mayonnaise to work? <laughs> I think the chocolate wouldn't interact well with the eggs. Let's see. Um Intro into the Black Forest or see Yeah, we gotta do Secret of the Gnome Lords, obviously. Secret. Secret. And now Secret. <laughs> you must return to the gnome halls to cure their madness by killing them all. This seems a little I don't know if I like that. What has driven the gnomes insane? Your journey leads you back to the great gnome hall to which you were first summoned. Beneath the thrones of the gnome lords lies the answer to this deadly riddle. Brave, brave the horrors that lie in the dark and learn the secret of the gnome lords. Two battles. That makes me really nervous. <laughs> Two battles. These are going to be huge. Don't you think it's odd that people put gnomes in their gardens? They must really love Card Hunter. Yeah. <laughs> I'm hinting at this, but explain yourself. I get widely misinterpreted a lot at the point where starting game versions when you learn. Okay. I, pre I appreciate that. Yeah. Because I'm. Because I've mentioned this before in the past, but I have a bad. I, I'm not perfect. And I misinterpret people sometimes. So. I. But I'm not. But one thing to remember is that I'm never doing it on purpose. So. Like, I understand that it stinks when it happens, but. Um. As long as we can communicate with each other, uh, misunderstandings can be nullified, and uh, we can uh, we can move forward together. It'll be great. Trust me. Let's see. Cold, moist air greets you as you return to the gnome hall and travel back down to its lowest depths. Uh, you're perfect the way you are. Ugh. Oh wait, where's my dagger? Hashtag no. Ugh. All right, I'm fine now. So let's see. Cold moist air greets you as you return to the gnome hall and travel back down to its lowest depths. A once great chamber lies shattered by some kind of primitive excavation, the stink of which is even stronger than before. The now familiar bone-chilling howl of incensed gnome warrior splits the gloom. You must seize the breach before reinforcements arrive. Let's go. How bad could it possibly be? Yes. Oh, they have spears. Uh, uh. Well, hey, getting... at least you don't have any attacks. <laughs> yeah, limbs get locked, heads get cropped, screams out one of the murderous gnomes. How do you know they don't have any attacks? No, you don't. Oh, I don't. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> no. Well, uh, you, you, so, uh, you, you can take point. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Just dash up and nimbus yourself. Oh. Dun -dun. Huh? Oh, it's victory terrain. Oh, come on! Oh, he has to, he has to hold it for so many turns. 
Because um, there's so many of them, they needed to give them a handicap. True. I really wish that guy would have chosen to attack me instead of running away like a coward. Weak javelin toss! Wait a minute, ranged attacks? That's not okay! I have so much That's armor. That's cheating! That's cheating! You're not allowed to do that! No, you never did. Thank you, boy. Let's see. Alright. Yeah, I was like, burn your investigate! Live dangerously! Live dangerously! <laughs> I don't know if I'd call it dangerously. I mean, I can't really afford to. I can't really justify moving at all. Because I can't. I don't have the attacks anyway. Yeah, but you can only keep two of those cards anyway, so you might as yeah. well try and get close so that when you draw attacks, you can use them. Yeah, all right. <sighs> Here we go! Stop it! Thank you for the health. <laughs> I'm gonna vicious thrust this 22 guy. Well, it makes more sense to vicious thrust the 12, doesn't it? <laughs> um, I don't know. Give me a sec. Mm, the math just doesn't really work out on this 12, no matter what we do to him, pretty much. It's the Piranha Sleeping Song, because I'm waiting so long for you to decide I've fallen asleep! Bro, I mean, that's my decision, is that it doesn't <laughs> really matter what we do, we're going to have to overkill him. I know, I'm just being rude and sassy. <laughs> just shoot them? Alright. <laughs> Let's ricochet the shots! We're suddenly playing SteamWorld Heist! Let's go! Um, <laughs> I'm going to attack Soldier you then. Okay. 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 Ha 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 ha! Blam! 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 <laughs> oh, that's not good. Good thing you didn't have any armor. Yeah. I'm surprised you didn't. Why didn't you Nimbus yourself? Are you saving it for later? Yes. Good idea. Hmm. <laughs> We're in a little bit of a hurry, but these guys have huge HP totals, so... Well, okay. No, That weak no. javelin toss kind of feels like a... If that's all these gnome spearmen have, they kind of feel like filler enemies. <laughs> that's actually a good point. At this <laughs> point, this, like maybe, maybe like five or six now. levels ago, the three damage would have been annoying. But at this point, we have so much HP, the three damage is barely a nuisance. So says you. I. It's really scaring me. There's so many of them. Oh yeah, run away. Good. <laughs> Go over yeah, there. That, that we works. don't need you. Yeah, we don't need you. We don't need to fight you. Wow, that was impressive. Don't worry, I'll just be over here dying. Um, <laughs> do you want to go in lunging bash, or do you want me? Yeah, I think so. But if you lunging bash, oh, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna run over to that location. I'm gonna get out of here. Since we have to. Since we're not gonna get priority anyway. Yeah. If we can just get these guys off the victory terrain, take it for ourselves. Yeah, I mean, if I move. Game. If I move here, I don't think he has any attack. Well, the gnome berserkers might have attacks. Yeah. But the spearman definitely doesn't because he would have been attacking you otherwise. I don't think it's a good idea to purposely take damage. All right. Well, I'm not going to purposely take damage. I just want to move there to try to step over into the victory square at the start of the turn. Oh, hey, he was burning. 
this. I think I want a mulligan on my day. That is totally, totally feasible. Welcome to the morning. It's me and Brofi. Brofi's still rewinding. He's been here longer than I have. Um, we're having. This is a bad hand. We're having a good day today. <laughs> Let's see, just shoot them. Oh, look, we unlocked guns. Never mind, that's a great hand. Yeah, baby. That's fine, I'm still alive. <laughs> still alive! Take this! Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, that's a space back there? Ow, what was that attack? A, a halting, pinning spear, pinning spear. It makes it so I can't move anymore. Oh, I see. Not to worry, um, because I can still kill him before I die. Or do you want to heal? Do you want to Nimbus me? That would have been better earlier. Do you want to yeah, heal me? Yeah, just kill the 10 HP. Yeah, let's just guy. kill the 10, because all of the spear throwers are, are uh, exhausted. Yeah. Go for it! For one that's a million miles away. Yeah. Bop, bop. I thought I heard a dog barking, so... Bop, 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 bop. Um, do you want me to arcane feedback this guy? Yeah, I want to arcane feedback this guy. Gizzy, gizzy, gizzy. Um, no, no! Oh, come on! No, no! Um, <sighs> streamer, can we add spiral orders? Okay, fine, God! Well, that's all right, because we were on the day. <laughs> oh, I see. Oh, what the heck was that? Reactive trip? Finishing the places. Oh, what? Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, I don't like that. If he has a chop, we're dead. Hey, I take it back. These spearmen are not filler enemies. They're weirdos. They're yeah. weirdos. Yeah, they're very Have weird. Have you ever seen them without those long spears? They're weird. <laughs> <laughs> they are kind of weird looking. <laughs> yeah, without the spears, they just trip everybody who walks past them. They're bullies. Uh, how could you say the fire war is the pinnacle of game design? Oh my god. It's not. Not again. All right, See, just... Misha knows. Misha played it too. Both me and Misha are the only people here who played Spyro Orange, so we're the only ones who know it's not good. <laughs> I'm gonna. Do you wanna. Hold on. Um. Uh... <laughs> I oh, don't I believe you, x -Bando. I played it too. I can't. I, I've already mass frenzied, so I'm just gonna. I can't take damage, so it doesn't matter. Thank you for noticing yeah. me. I appreciate that. No I can't play Vicious Thrust because it is a movement. It is half of a movement card. So because oh, it's more than one turn of halt? It's two, Jeez, it's two those turns guys are of annoying. Halt. Yeah, it's really, really nasty. All right, well, All right, the good news then. is that. Uh, you could purge me. I could, but then you'd be vulnerable to damage again. Oh, true. But he can't attack us anymore. True. And I'm going to lose the Nimbus next turn anyway. Yeah, all right. Cool. Let me see. I will purge you and then re-frenzy. Oh, good idea. Okay. <laughs> You're lying, Xbando! There's no way you played it because it's not good game! <laughs> the best of many games are the gate opening ones where you have to mash your button so hard it feels like your finger will fall off. Yeah, they're so cool! <laughs> Don't you mean the best of the mini games are the robot ones where you have to do uh, frame perfect inputs and get the. and get missiles at the right exact times? I hate that game Those were so the much. best! It's so bad. I hate that. <laughs> I think we basically just won this. Yeah, we're pretty good here. Oh, I cleared the frenzy off of you with... I forgot about how holy presence... Oh, darn good stuff it. Off you. Yeah, Whatever, we got this. It's yeah, fine. It's fine. We're Watch good. this. Oh, you're so clever. Oh, you're so clever! I forgot you can, <laughs> you can like, it's it's barge, but like you push him and he just goes Bwoof, like in the wrong direction yeah. <laughs> through you, and you're like, whoa! <laughs> 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 
I don't think these guys have the damage output to finish this off. Mm -mm. Neither do I. Okay, well, that's a good start, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> not bad. Not bad at all. Still, it's nowhere near. They yeah. have to kill both of us. Yeah, they have to kill it because we we wait. Did we get two stars? I'm confused. I thought we were we three rounds. One from the guy and one <gasps> from the victory terrain. Right. I was about to say, I'm like, I thought we only. Hello, Warp. Hi. Welcome to stream. Hope you enjoy having a good time. Hello. Hi. Nice to Hello. see you. Hello. Welcome to the stream. No, the best of the minigames are the flying ones where you have to pick a path and one of them leads to a dead end and you have no way of knowing beforehand. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thankfully, only one of them actually does that level uh, of badness. Like, so many of them. <laughs> no, you see, the best mini games are the ones that are just bad breakouts. But you have to do the... There are three levels, and you have to do yeah, each okay. one three times. Uh. So each gate is nine levels long. And there's one in every world. So you have to play their bad breakout clone 45 times. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> 45? Oh my god. <laughs> no! <laughs> I mean, it's just the number just kept getting bigger. Yeah. As you collect valuables, the hairs in the back of your neck stand on end. You are clearly approaching the source of the corruption and pray to your gods for protection against evil. But unfortunately, your cleric didn't prepare that this morning. No, no ad libbing. Okay. Right. <laughs> Jesus. You guys are no fun sometimes. Let's see, um... <laughs> okay, ooh, what is this? Cloak of Instinct? Rushing aura, thick hide armor, and reflexive teleport. Never mind, I just didn't recognize the card art for reflexive teapot. To... Mm. Oh! Mantle of Lingering. It's got hover, reliable mail, and... Of course. Boo. The best card in the game. Oh, that's actually really good. Is it? Robes with reliable mail are incredibly rare. Oh! Oh! <gasps> You're right, I didn't even notice that! No, the and best- Boo isn't a terrible <laughs> card, as long as it isn't accompanied by two prestidigitations. <laughs> it was? <laughs> oh my god, I didn't even realize that. Let's see. Uh, yeah, the haunted bucket is Boo and two prestidigitations. Oh god, no, the best minigames are the ones where you have to throw Molotov cocktails in an opposing castle and make the other people fall, but they can do frame-perfect inputs. It's fine because the fray it's fine because all you literally have to do to beat those mini games is stay exactly where you are and mash the button. And if they ever try and move in front of you to throw a Molotov at you, they'll instantly die. And if they <sighs> so they'll stand, the, the space will be gone, so they'll have to immediately start fixing the space. But the second the space is fixed, you just break it again until their AI misses the frame to fix the spot and they just die. It works 97% of the time and instantly wins you the game. Yay! We <laughs> saw it! It's the easiest mini game in the entire game because if you know what you're doing and the know what you're doing is just don't play the game. <laughs> oh, that weapon is really I good. I noticed. I noticed. Two flaring torches, three mighty bludgeons, and a nightling. Like, it's really, really good. I was thinking That's it was so a staff strong. Person. It is. Um, <clears throat> Wait for it. What am I waiting for? The screen. Oh, darn. <laughs> yeah, I know. Doesn't it stink? <laughs> uh, that's why I've stopped looking at the club rewards, but, like, I really shouldn't. I just, like, I was like, ah, oh, it's a cool-looking weapon. Let's take a look at it. It is, like, one of the best weapons we've ever found. Even though it's, like, yeah. gold and a blue, it's such a powerful weapon. Yeah, it's, it's uncommon, so we can probably find it in a shop without too much difficulty. Good point. Good point. It's an uncommon gold blue, so it shouldn't be too hard. It might actually be, I mean, to be honest, it might actually be in the goblin market. Um, they sell a lot of uncommon weapons. What level is it? Uh, 14. Uh, Which means goblin I, market. It's 14. Does that cover up to 14? It does. It says it's a level 14 market, so we, okay, we yeah. it might be there. I hope it, it is, because I want to grab it. Huh? Um... We are there. No, Sounds I didn't me. enjoy Spyro Wars. <laughs> Sounds to me like Brooke really enjoyed Spyro Wars. Sounds to me like you haven't been listening. <laughs> I enjoyed Crash Purple, but that might only be because it was 
after Played Spyro right Orange. After Spyro Wars. Mm, yeah. Crash Purple felt like a much better designed and much more fun game than Spyro Ugh. Orange did, despite the fact that I assumed they'd basically be palette swaps. Okay, but, Melvin. Um... Oh, Melvin's here? Yeah, I love how I love how this uh this is so tough. Ugh, I'm choking on the fumes down here. I hope your kids haven't been smoking. Um, I'm sorry. D it's supposed to smell like sage. <laughs> Do you not understand what? Never mind. Not even gonna go there. Not even gonna go there. The musty stench is at its strongest in this deep cavern. The source of the foul miasma can be seen in the distance, gibbering to its gnomish thralls. A vile fungus warrior, too messed with mind-controlling spores. He signals to his psychotic minions, and a great rumbling is heard. You must dispatch this abomination quickly before the cave collapses and traps you forever. All right, and uh, yes, we are in fact card hunter certified. Stream hunter, Thank you stream for asking. I have concerns about your qualifications. Are you and your party uh, street hunter, sir? Sorry, card hunter certified. Yes, we are. I'm not forklift certified though. <laughs> Maybe one day. Okay, let's go. Fungus War. Oh, that guy's kind of scary looking. I do think I had more fun with Spyro Orange than Zelda 2, though. Oof. Uh, Jesus. Yeah, now you've got to do a. Uh, now you've got to do a. Uh, a cross playlist where you compare the Spyro Every games. Every game I've ever played. Mm -hmm, yeah, you got to compare the Spyro. Somebody actually. Somebody actually did. I believe uh, it was Prozy D has a. Uh, has a spreadsheet of every game he's ever played, and I was like, oh, it's genius, because I forget <laughs> about all sorts of games that I play. You're not forklift certified? How do you eat dinner without a fork? Well, obviously I do it mm. without lifting it, because I'm not allowed to. Mm. I either I use a spoon or I just take the plate, because it is a it is a, a very a not well-known loophole. Awesome, I love the Fungus Warrior figure. Why is it only used in this battle, though? Uh, good question. Um... Basically, the uh, basically the loophole is that you take your you you have you kind of scoot your your fork starts on your plate, obviously, because that's just how that's just how nature works. And you take your plate and you put both hands under the plate and then you apply an upward force to the plate to bring it up off of the table. And thus you have lifted the plate and by extension the fork, but it was not directly lifting the fork, so you don't need to be certified to do so, thankfully. Okay, but how does that help you eat? You then take, you then maneuver the plate with the fork on it towards your mouth, and you kind of just go like, and you like eat the food off of the fork. Cause you can push the fork into your food and stab it, and then you can like shift the fork around and like bump it around and stuff. But you can't lift the fork, so you've got to be... Are these plates forklift certified? The plates should be. I'm, every plate I've ever met was forklift certified. So let's see. Wow. Um, wow. Love I just out here making huge generalizations yeah, yeah. based only on what she's... On, on plates that she's met. Oh That's, my god, do you, listen, do you wow. know how many plates I've met in my life? They're all forklift certified. Come on. Wow. <laughs> Tilt the plates so the food falls in your mouth. Genius. All right, let's just get these guys. Let's get these guys. That was a fun bit. All right, so very, very my brother, my brother and me, honestly. Um. All right, so no berserkers anymore. We phased those guys out, I guess. Thankfully, now we just have these weird spearmen and one single rogue and whatever this fungus warrior does. He only has 20 health, but I'm a little worried. Yeah. Oh, I drew my honorable attack. Oh, I can't. Use he only any of draws 1.5 cards per turn. That's... Are we sure he only shows up in this one battle? Yeah, mm, that's weird. Maybe he shows up in a treasure hunt or something. Oh, maybe. All of the VTubers with invisibility hairpins I've met in my life are cute, adorable, certified. <laughs> oh, well, look at what I've got. Invisibility <laughs> pins. That's me. I don't know what to do here. Oh, you, why'd you make me draw a card? Well, because I was hoping that you would draw a move card. Uh, you did. I did. You did draw a move card, just not a very great one. Uh, you should have at least used it. 
Well, thankfully, yeah. Well, why, why? did they move on to the victory terrain to move off of the victory mm -hmm. terrain? All right, fine. I'll use it. I was gonna save it so that I could possibly attack with it next turn. You have so many <gasps> attacks in your hand. Yeah, but it's a good card for getting close without letting them hit me. Except these guys have seven range or whatever, so... <laughs> Time to cancel off on Twitter. Wait, she's not on Twitter? So we have no power? Well, what are we supposed to do now? <laughs> What's Twitter? What's Twitter? I only know before. I only know of uh, Keyblade. Let's see. Um, <laughs> discard Arcane Feedback, and I guess I'll discard Honorable Attack. It's technically better if I can get in front. I only know of that site that you get to post X videos on. <laughs> X videos? <laughs> Keyblade! <laughs> I'm not calling it X, no. Elon Musk is half Xehanort? Confirm, yep. Definitely half. No, Xehanort wouldn't debase himself. Xehanort wouldn't even, Xehanort wouldn't even bother. I'm gonna discard an Inquisitor Strike. Mm, right. Oh Flea no! Mortal. Flea mortal! Go for it. Oh, I was gonna say you should move so that you can uh, avoid getting pinned down if they have that. Oh yeah, that would have stained, bro. Oh hey, I drew my other vicious thrust! How did he use reflexive trip? You weren't trying to move. It's also an attack. Oh, okay, hold on. It's Let me look at this. actually kinda cool. It's not a very good attack, but it is an attack. Shield block. Reactive trip was canceled. Whoopsie daisy. So three attack at one range. If an adjacent enemy plays a move card, cancel that. That's a really cool card. Yeah, I agree. Point. <laughs> 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 All right. Let me honor. Let me Inquisitor strike. Uh, actually, hold on. Yeah, Inquisitor's Strike. Are you frenzied? Him. Okay, I was about to say, are you frenzied? Because I can let you invigorating touch him. Oh, hey, thank you. Thanks, Gnome, Gnome Slasher Man. Well, now he's, now you don't get honorable attack on him. Um, <laughs> watch this. Hit him with invigorating touch and watch this. I don't want to hit him with invigorating touch. Wait. I'm not damaged enough yet. Oh yeah, okay, well then, then pass your turn. Or heal, yeah, heal works too. Spore cloud, uh oh. What does that do? Pulse. Well, good thing you blocked it, I guess. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's when we passed, so we get to. Oh, wait, no, you into the. Wait, no, we we get to go first, yeah. Yes. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> Magic! Now he's facing me. Squishy. That's who's that damage? It's just vulnerable, but with a different name. Now I can kill him. Honorable attack. <laughs> See, I told you it would work out. Oh, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> no! Oh, that's you. I don't care, though. Ugh, that's annoying. Um, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go pin in. I'm gonna go try to box in Mango. His name? Oh, Mungo. It's like his name is Mango. We don't know what he does though. We don't know yeah, attack do. wise. He uses spores. Yeah, but we we saw one attack. We don't know. Like maybe he has like he has like a spear in his hand, so maybe mm -hmm. he has that nine damage spear attack. So we mm. should at least be a little bit careful. Well, you don't care about your. I was kidding. I was kidding. In game. In Minecraft. In Minecraft. Uh, you don't care about your brother being attacked? That's not very nice. Yeah, you're right. Mm -hmm. I should be nicer. I'm a very mean person. Oh, oh yeah, he definitely has melee attacks. There's no reason he'd get that close to you if he didn't. I'm definitely just a very nasty person in general. Ta-da! Oh. I may be gone, but I can still be very nasty. Does not that lady have a brother? No. What'd you say? Is that a quote from something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. it was from, uh, it was from, uh, Wa, uh, 
Mad Dog McCree. It was from Mad Dog McCree. There's one of the bounties you can go after is Nasty Dan. And when you shoot him, he's like, I may be... Or no, you get him arrested. You don't shoot him. You get it. He's like, I may be going away, but I can still be very nasty. <laughs> <laughs> I watched the Game Grumps play it, and uh, Dan, Dan said, like, he, he was like, oh, I was so hoping he would say that. <laughs> Great moment. Not if I lady is the mean one. Yeah. Look well, how many stars they need. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's ever gonna happen. Yeah. Um, like if it was a long corridor, maybe. Mm. Oh no, I have amnesia. I have amnesia. <laughs> Bro, help me. No. <laughs> I'm cursed with Amnesia! Who are you gonna- Oh no! Everybody has Amnesia! We might not even need to kill Mungo. No, you might. Since I didn't draw any attacking cards. Yeah, I mean- Hold on, I, I can go steal this! I can go steal this! Yeah. Oh, jeez, he does have it! Oh no, that was four. Okay, cool. <laughs> Ooh, also, scared. you're invulnerable again, so... Oh, yeah. Oh, no! <laughs> but the emotion... But the mental strain, bro. Okay. Yeah, I almost got stabbed. Mm, oh, thank good you luck. for coming over here. Uh... Um... Hmm... Probably should have blocked Soul 3D yeah. first then, sorry. Nah, it's fine. What is that? Noxious. Noxious. Poison 3, cone, range 3. Yeah, that's pretty mediocre. What do you mean it's mediocre? Fine. That's a lot of damage. Oh, and you also can't move, I didn't notice. Oh. What's that? Blocks can't play it automatically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No vital organs. I remember this one. Yeah. I remember this. No vital organs. Block any draw card. That's not great, honestly. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's just a very, very bad shield block. Yeah. How you doing, no Elphias? We're attack one more time. We were doing great, Abio. How's your internet feeling? Is it got over its cold? Here you go, everybody. Get on my back. I just need a bit of a. Yeah, I totally understand. No worries at all. Discard block, soldier, and block. Because I'm facing away anyway. Nope. I misclicked. I wanted to keep that. <laughs> Ugh, what did you discard? My armor. Oops. Have fun. I'm gonna keep a secret locker. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Come on! Um, well, I gotta use it now, so... Yeah, just run up and punch I'm the... I'm going for it. Punch Mushroom Man. Uh. Number two, perhaps. Yeah! Mushroom Man, number two, pass it to me, pass it to me, pass it to me, pass it to me! I don't want him to run away. Oh, my God. Also, it's kind of funny that uh, No Vital Organs is a block, which means that you can only not have vital organs if they're attacking from, from in fr front of yeah, you. Yeah, all my vital organs are on my back, so... <laughs> a bit better, I think I had a shower, and while it is reinstalling Grand Blue super slowly, it seems to be stable. Yay! Oh, it just broke again. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, well, you can use Lunging Bash if you'd like. Huh. Yeah, I don't think they're doing too super well at this whole victory terrain thing. Yeah. I don't think it's in the cards <laughs> for them. I don't think it's in the cards. <laughs> you know what? The whole you can digest cortisol with physical activity is true, but it's also a bit of a scam. I wish I felt worse and gave up and called them a ball to cry in bed. I was really counting on having wakes week off. I'm so sorry. I totally understand. That's really, that's really nasty of them. What's cortisol? Um. 
Well, if I consult my brain palace, <laughs> it's an essential hormone that affects almost every organ and tissue in your body. It plays many important roles, including regulating your body's stress response, helping control your body's use of fats, proteins, and carbohydrates, or your metabolism. <laughs> you know, I thought being an organ donor would be cool, but the nurse was all, where did you get all these livers? <laughs> I hate it when they constantly question me where I get all my livers from. Oh, I see. I'm for Turtles, hey! The stress chemical. Uh, yeah, I, I. now that you say, uh... You're nearly um, dead. What happened to me? Yeah, I have no idea. Let's look back at the battle. Uh, Holy Grizzlebane Frenzy Potent Stab. Any damage? Suffers pain? Ah, you took the unholy damage. What? And you got hit with the javelin. How do I go from 19 to 20? To one, you mean? To, or to one. Yeah, wait, what? I took three piercing damage. And cortisol, totally understandable. How are you doing today, Viral? Eight We're playing piercing damage. Card Hunter, most thinking. Four damage, 11, 15. I guess there was 16 health. Jesus, Prof was punished for not praising Spiral Orange enough. Yep, yeah, it's the it's the ancient curse. Dude, they hit me so hard. All Good right. question. I'm just going to walk onto that victory square and win the game. Oh, okay. <laughs> Unless it's in the round. In the round, we win. Alright. <laughs> oh, you! <Google>. Orange. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Finally, the sage candle, I mean, gnome threat, is extinguished! <laughs> Finally. With the mushroom man infiltrator exposed, and we use mushroom man! Number two! <laughs> With the Mushroom Man Infiltrator exposed and put to the sword, the vile fungal infection has been expunged and the gnomes are now safe. The gnome lords are deeply grateful and reward you with an ancient chest filled with riches. Now that half of their population has been... ...culled. Yeah. Hey, oh, I, I got another it. yellow token! Nice. I just got an item called St. Banesh's Prayer Box. Oh. A swarm of bats. Neat! I got charismatic that teeth. Is cracked. What does it do? Swarm of bats is a move forward oh, teleport. Yeah. So when targeted from an enemy attack from the front, move forward, teleport. Yeah, but it doesn't <laughs> keep. It doesn't keep. No, it doesn't. But, like, there's no roll for it either. Oh, true. So, oh, really? God. It's basically a flawless Purple. block. Purple. We've actually been talking about Sporange and Purple for a while, and you use the exact. Um, Poor Bantos. There is a fungus among us. So I got myself a little Cthulhu statue. I'm going to sell that. I got a Medic's Cudgel, a Sturdy Rapier, and a Charismatic Teeth. Charismatic Teeth has Vampire's Kiss and two Inspirations. Pretty good. Uh, yeah. And I'm not to going to look at the, the Clever game Lord. Wrong. What? Flippador leveled up. The These characters wrong. aren't meant to level up this much. You're playing the game wrong. Melvin, probably. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Melvin's just the worst. Okay, we did it. We cleared the secret of the Gnome Lords, and now we only have two choices to pick from, but we know which one we're going for. We have to, right? We Into sure. the Black Forest. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. I mean, do you want to do... Okay, so it took us two hours to do two adventures. So do you want to... We could probably... If we do Attack of the War Monkeys after Into the Black Forest, we probably that probably won't even be the last thing we do this stream. But I believe both of these adventures have a second half to them, similar to the Gnome Lords thing. Oh, uh, then we should do Attack of the War Monkeys, I right. think. Cause, Let's do it. Yeah, the next adventure will take four hours. Uh oh, <laughs> that would be bad. You're playing the game wrong. Mm-hmm. Number five. Number five. <laughs> Burglar King Food Lettuce. <laughs> Let's see. Um, Attack of the War Monkeys. Only if we talk about that which we cannot talk about. 
Yeah, war monkeys rule. It's so awesome how they can steal cards out of your hand. Oh no! <laughs> right, the top ten nuggies. Yeah, I was actually gonna look that up yesterday to watch it. <laughs> <laughs> number seven. And one of my honestly, one of my favorites is um, top ten numbers. Number ten. Number five. Number nine, number four, <laughs> number eight, number seven, <laughs> number seven, number ten. <laughs> Let's see. Um, well, uh, after decades, of, after decades of peace, the Afridi jungles once again echo with the baleful shrieks of furious martial primates. Local farmers are being torn apart as their fields encroach on the jungle edges. The hour is upon us. Beware the attack of the war monkeys! Ain't no way it's, number seven is number eight. Yeah, you're right. This person definitely doesn't know how to make a list. It's been a long time since I've done this, so I don't really remember too much about <laughs> it, unfortunately. <laughs> Have you ever seen top ten days of the week? <laughs> I have not. You said monkey, so I'm a lab cham cham and Sam, sh Sam show six while I lurk. Fantastic. Well, I guess let's give it a shot. I heard the rogues are going to get the seal ability too when Blue Man 2 finally gets around to releasing them. No, they well, won't. They won't. They won't release them. <laughs> nope. And Blue Man 2 doesn't exist anymore. They nope. sold the game <laughs> yep. before rogues are released. <laughs> Maybe this, maybe these guys will, um, will, uh, Knights of the Round or whatever will release, um, mm -hmm. rogues. May I link in a chat? Of course you may. Absolutely, thank you. I would love to see it. News of a caravan bearing rare goods attracts your attention in the local tavern. With cheer in your hearts, you set out to sample its wares. Your good spirits turn to dread as you draw sight of slain merchants and fleeing horses. <laughs> Excuse me. Wicked primate warriors, huh, pick up. Uh, wicked primate warriors are ransacking the caravan and making off into the forest with the goods. With an angry cry, you leap to the attack. Yeah, that's really sad. Caravan bearing, bearing rare, rare goods has been slaughtered. Do you oh. remember what these guys do? Um, they have an attack that steals a card from you if they attack you from behind. Oh. Uh, they also have a reaction that causes them to move too whenever they're attacked from the front. Oh, that sounds really nasty. Yes, catching them is very troublesome. Let's see. In that case... Sounds like mages are a good bet here, but I can't really do anything about that. Yeah. Um, hold on. I got a new gold, a mages new yellow Mages are too card. fragile, though, is the problem. They also have a lot of damage from what I remember. Um, wait, what weapon would I replace? These are all so good. So I don't know. What what should I bring? Oh, good grief. Wait, I thought I had a gold um, power token weapon that I just got. No! The, we were going to, hold on. I wanted to go check and see if the Goblin Bazaar, oh. Sorry, Goblin Bazaar. Been... Goblin Bazaar is 13. Okay. I was wrong. Kyber's Market is seven. Scarl's Seconds is the second hand shop. Does that just have stuff you've sold? Yes. Mm. All right, never mind. Let's go back in. LMAO, I knew what number one would be. Oh, no. Okay, hold on. Oh, it's of course it's Jack Fil Jack's Films. I don't think I can play that on my stream. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Just in case. Oh, let's see. Um. Oh, Ronin, Ronin's cask. Right. That's why I wanted the gold. Was the rare helmet. Um. But now I have to find. Hmm. I've got a downgrade. So they really do just turn one of your tokens into a gold? Yes. When do you start getting new blues? Uh, 19. Blah. 
So you get you get eight blues in a row, then four of your blues turn into golds in a row, and then um, they alternate between giving you a new blue and giving you a new gold, I believe. Oh, okay. So I came across a new genre of videos. Uh-oh, this could be either very good or very bad. I'm excited. <laughs> um, let's see. Well, I can't afford to... I can't really afford to move my stuff around in a way that I can give the... that I can give the yellow token to the Careless Helm. Because my, my stuff already uses power... All of my stuff that uses power tokens is really kind of non-negotiable. So, that's unfortunate. Yeah. Cause I've got my I've got my rending axe, obviously need to keep it. I've got the acrobat's blade, which is a just a really good weapon. It's the one with the two mighty hacks. I've got the whirling flail, which is just an amazing weapon. And uh, I've got my cautious shield, which is a jump back and two blocks. I might be able to find something. Just non power token shields aren't very good in general. Yes, none. That is correct. That is a very astute observation. Thank you. Non-power token shields are really, really bad. And then, uh, <laughs> and then I have the the healthy gum shoes, which are investigate, big hide armor, and healing dash. But um, hmm. Didn't I have like a different gum shoes that were really good? Disintegrating boots. It was no. Was it the? I thought it was the gumshoes, but I thought they had a, uh, I thought they had a, um, a bane on them so that I could use them with, ah, here it is, cursed gumshoes. Sprint, investigate, and demonic revenge. I could use that instead, but I really don't know if I like that as much as the healthy gumshoes. So I could swap out the healthy gumshoes for the cursed gumshoes and get a bigger sprint thing. I lose the thick hide armor. But instead of Curse of Amnesia and Quickness Aura, I could get Armor Practice and War Cry. My... Do they have any blocks? Are those are the reactive cards blocks? No. Mm. They might Gumshoes? have blocks, but the reactive cards are not blocks. Sorry. Gumshoes? Do people actually use that Pokemon? I feel like probably no. Rabbit, you can't mm -hmm. leave me hanging. What new genre of videos did you find? Draw a card. Discard that card unless it is an armor card. Oh, this one. Yeah. There's like one for every every class of of card. Gen Z, Gen Z discovers taxes, which I like not because I'm a censored hole, but because I feel it. Man, them taxes that are taxed after the tax taxes are BS. We are not supposed to pay taxes on something more than once. Wasn't there a war wage for an increase of like five cents of taxes? I mean. Yeah, well, kind of. I believe the war was actually waged over the fact that they were being taxed without any representation in government, which, uh... <laughs> anyway, let's see. Um... Ah, whatever. I'm just gonna go with the build I have. Forget it. There's a time when I didn't make enough money, so they taxed me because of... What?! You're kidding. That's evil. No, that can't be real. I've never heard of that before. Yeah, that sounds. Oh, I hope I'm not. <laughs> I hope <that's... laughs> um, anyway. <laughs> um, let's see. Um, Jesus. Let's try. You don't do my ah. That's fair. That's totally fair. I had to struggle through that this year, and I was like, "Yeah, taxes are a little more complicated for me this year." And I was like, "I don't understand." <laughs> Come on, bro. Sorry, sorry. No, no, I'm just, I'm just being playful. You're fine. Come on, let's go to Candy Mountain. <laughs> Everybody sure, knows about that video, Charlie. I have absolutely no idea if this is going to be any good at all here. I couldn't get away from that video even if I tried back in the day, Charlie. 
You have 16 seconds left yet. Do that, do that, do that, do that, do that. Do okay. that. Let's see. Yes. Oh, I forgot to change my... That's fine. Whatever. Okay. Best viewers. Oh, hey. Welcome to TK Fortnite Gaming Awesome. No, it's TKF Fortnite Gaming Awesome. Welcome to this. What is that even? What is TKF? Anyway, it doesn't matter. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> Goodbye from the stream. Have a nice day. So long. Farewell. I'll see you say goodbye. <laughs> we just totally messed that up. Uh, I want to be your Ben Hammer. Ben Hammer to your heart. Let's see. Gen Z discovers Charlie the Unicorn. Yay! Now they can be saddled with the curse as well. There was also a second war in America. Well, war during the Third Presidency where a state revolted took up arms over being overtaxed. You talking about the Civil War? I don't. Probably not. <laughs> Gen Z discovers Cactuar and Tonberry. All right, let's you mean like the shoot enemies? these guys. No. Okay. All right, all right. Well, I mean, I gotta listen. I gotta entertain my peoples a minute, too. And I gotta stall because I'm scared. <laughs> yes, these monkeys are... Yes, these monkeys are totally cute, but don't try to pat them. They're not here to play. They're not here yeah, to play, actually, have... with her face. They're not here to play. Oh, <laughs> you guys look scary. Yeah. Well, let's start with Curse of Amnesia, I guess. Okay. I think we... Mm, I think we hold off for a second? Scamper. Oh, jeez. It's free move. Wait, that just means that they... Okay, that just means they can go anywhere. Like, flying, basically. Oh. Oh, Difference you're a mage! Surpass blocking terrain. What'd you say? They can't they can't ignore blocking terrain, so they still have to go around stuff. Lie lets you pass through blocking terrain as well. Hello, I'm back on my computer wrapped in a blanket of fizzy water and I'm ready to watch my favorite stream. Hello boy. Welcome back. Enjoy your fizzy water. As long as you don't wrap your PC in a blanket as well. Is that bad for it? Yes. Just asking for a friend. I'm kidding. I don't wrap my PC in a blanket mm. anymore. Uh, let's see. Um, I don't know what to do. I can't step uh -oh. and get close and they'll just attack if... Hello. Um, you are currently in danger. Should I let you do your nah, thing? No, I'm fine. Yeah, oh, okay. but let me do my thing. I'm going to try and shoot these oh. guys. Ah! Whoa! Good shot. Oh. Ow. Cowardly fashion. So this is increasing number six. Ah, yeah, that's the one. The uh, the gnome chanker guys use that on us too. Yeah. Unless we talked about the original Xbox 360, then it could very well save it. Interesting. I can't get behind these guys. So, but you attacked them and you were fine. Yeah. I don't know if their thing only works on melee or if they just don't have it right now. <sighs> Should I? I really kind of want to move in, but I, I am a little worried. Let me fish a little bit more on them. Sure. Aha! Laser bolt. Heliacord Labasse. That's a good name. Jesus! That's where all your die rolls went. <laughs> all right, yeah, you try and kill them now. They ran off into the future. All right, powerful bludgeon! <laughs> So far, so okay. After the 13 one as well. What'd you say? Go after the 13 one as well. I guess. If I have to well, burn my hide armor. Time. Yep, because I have to. I have amnesia too, so. Yeah. I've heard people are using water to help pull their computers. So I put my computer in the bathtub and it stopped working. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, um. I, I, I'm so glad I had my water bottle closed, but I normally when I pick up my water bottle, I tilt it away from my computer just to be safe. But I accidentally picked I had it like upside down. Oh, no. So instead of like tilting it away from my computer, what I ended up doing was like pointing the, oh, the, the mouth of the bottle directly at my computer. Oh, no. <laughs> so like. <laughs> Yikes. So if it hadn't been closed, I would have just dumped an entire bottle of water on my computer, oh. and it scared the heck out of me, even though obviously nothing happened. But. Oh, jeez, that's awful. I didn't, you didn't tell me about that. 
which was caused by something being soldered directly to the board, which would bend. Okay, so save it from the red ring of death, which was caused by something being soldered directly to the board, which would bend. Blanketing the 360 would semi-melt the solder, giving it a little more time? Weird. That's so weird. Was this an intent? Was this like a deliberate choice that ended up backfiring and causing problems? You know, iPhone is a feature that lets you change the battery by putting it in the mic. Charge the battery by putting it in the microwave. I can't wait to test it out. I'm going to go ahead and recommend that you don't do that. At all. <laughs> oh, Simeon Reflexes. Whenever you can see attacks, you draw a card, you may act again this turn. Ugh. Seems Good job. fine. Good job, Path of Niving, that guy. Yeah. So I was... I was watching the uh, the Undertale, to the paint on some letters thing. Uh, <laughs> I had forgotten about this part. But after the paint on some letters bit, Sajbot had said, um... Fun fact, this game has has multiple hours of gameplay. It is highly uh, you can you can play this game for multiple more hours. It is highly recommended that you don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the choice was made for money. It was cheaper, but they didn't realize that this was a defect caused by it. Ah, shame. I'm not frenzied either, so I can't uh, come close. Yeah. Block melee, move attacker, move one. Oof. Oh, he's behind me now. Okay, never mind. You're behind the target, remove a random card from the target's hand and place it in your hand. I think we're dead. Nah, we got this. After all, I'm about to pull the trigger. Oh, I'm sorry. No, wanted, no, you can move I wanted first. to not be behind them anymore. <laughs> Pull the trigger! Bang, bang, bang! Pull my devil trigger! <laughs> Go for it! Cooling laser! No! They just get to keep doing stuff. It's such an awful card. I think that's, I think, I think that's what I'm thinking of. It's not that they move away when you attack them. It's that they just keep getting more and more turns. Boo. We need boo. No, Who's not boo. The other one. The other one. The one that just discards the oldest card. Yeah, yeah, that could work. Here come oh, I'm out of water. I'll be right back, bro. All right. Enjoy listening to the crickets. Uh, crimkets. Uh. I refuse. I will be leaving now.
Then it's time for a hydrate redeem. Blech. Okay. And now for a stretch redeem. Everybody up off your seats. Stretch your fingers up to the ceiling. Dig your toes down to the floor. Let's get ourselves nice and limbered up. We're going to be here for a while. <sighs> Twist and turn, stretch and stretch all around. Make sure you're getting nice and uh, stretchy, I guess. Okay, as soon as you're ready, go ahead and slowly bend down and touch your toes. Really feel those calves and hamstrings opening up. Hair combo, yay. Also, if you smell water on your PC, it should be turned off immediately, and you should take each part of the PC out, allow air to go through, and wait a month or so. Afterwards, if you want to eat one, use 99% ice bubble alcohol to wipe connectors if it seems like they're dirty. Hopefully, it works without any problems. Hopefully. My patience is waning. Is this entertaining? What song is that? Can we sing? No, never. No, you're fine. You're totally fine. Hey, bro, if you back... Insecurities are pretty, are pretty nasty. So I'll just say it straight out. No, I'm not. Let's see. Um, hmm. That's understandable. Come on. Sorry, I'm looking for something specific. There you are. Okay. Whatever, let's watch on phone data while I pet Kitty. Kitty is here. Hey, look, Kitty. Bones. Imagine dragons. Feel it in my bones. Oh, 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 yeah. Have you guys... <laughs> Have you guys heard um, the best version of that song? Where is it? Yeah, here it is. Can I? I don't think I'm allowed to play it because it's too close to the original song. Don't worry, boy, but I didn't say yeah. I think it's just gonna play the whole song as a thing. Give me, give me, give me. Yeah, it's uh, <laughs> it's called. <laughs> I'll actually hold on. I'll post it in the Discord. It's called Bones, but actually, you know what? I'll leave it as a surprise. I'm gonna post it in the Discord under Felony Memes, and you guys can watch it. I think somebody already did, actually. I feel like this actually already got posted in funny memes. No, I believe you. <clears throat> actually, once again, once... <laughs> there he is! Ralph! Ralph! Yu-Gi-Oh! is out of the question. So how about comics? As a topic Ralph can annoy, annoy Loaf with, I'm reading the Sabretooth 1993 solo one, because MVC YouTuber recommended it. Oh. I don't know uh, very much about comics. I probably know more than he does. And it's still not very much. <laughs> um, So I was actually talking about... A, we talked about Bones and from My Imagine Dragons. And so that reminded me of quite possibly one of the funniest... <laughs> YouTube videos ever. And now there are so many. Uh, bones, but every noun is Bones. Uh, <laughs> So Sounds it's so silly. It's very silly. I posted it in phony memes. You guys can watch it later. <laughs> All right. I so could react to it, but the problem is that it's just the music, but like a goofy version of the music. So I, I'd have to IEO over the whole thing. 
Mm. What if we talk about this little known game called Card Hunter? That's a great idea. I was just thinking about playing that the other day. <laughs> All right. So what were you saying, bro? Uh, from what I have deduced, we should not be using AOE here. <laughs> Why? Because if mul if I hit multiple monkeys that can all see me, they'll all refresh and draw cards. Oh, uh, wait, they refresh? No, the opportunity. Yes. Draw a card, you may act again this turn. No! Yeah, these are scary guys. These are really scary enemies. You should set up a looping IEO on your stream deck. I could. Also, their acrobatic flip block is very dangerous because they can use it to get behind you. Yeah. Because they can move so, you and then and then move yeah. themselves. Yeah, so I would recommend keeping that in mind for what attacks you're going to bring along next time, I guess. Okay. Oh, I have amnesia. Sorry, I didn't realize. Um, it's all right. Ah. Oh, jeez. Oh. Bye to your magma spray. Why didn't they just steal your walk? Why couldn't that happen? Why couldn't that be a thing that happened? Uh, <clears throat> These monkeys are question. rude. They are! They move you around, they steal your stuff. So, yeah, um, I didn't give it the proper introduction that it deserves. Uh, I gave it the proper introduction at the end of the last stream. But this is considered by many to be the most difficult adventure in, well, the biggest, the biggest roadblock adventure by far. Like, so many people get walled at this adventure, and uh, there, are so, there were so many forum posts like, HOW DO I DO THIS?! <laughs> um, but Brof did it, apparently Brof didn't have much trouble with it because of his build, and uh, when we did this in co-op together, uh, Brof warned me that it's gonna be scary, but we did it just fine the first time we played this this is that's i remember very few things about our playthrough of this game this uh, this is one of them let's see um i guess i'm gonna inquisitor strike him and he can just do that uh oh did i just cause a problem no. did i make a mistake no you didn't okay good yay I'm doing fine. Regus. Good. Oh. Run. Run. Get more than five squares away from me. Five. <laughs> okay. One, two, three, four, five, five. I cannot. Is it blocked by line of sight? No. No? One, two, three, four, five. I, I just... Just barely not able to do that. I'll go this way then. No, go for it. No, no, I'm not gonna do it if you're in range. Dang it, alright. Oh no! I'm not in me. I'm in Misa anymore. Alright. Uh, Monkey punch. Send me a puzzle with Dominic. Just... to me. Oh. Don't you want me to move away? No, pass it to me. Whoa. Oh, because they're going to go after you. Strange choice. Now pass it to you again? Uh, yeah. Not like I can do anything. So I haven't kept up with my Emerald Nuzlocke. I forget everything that happened. I think I'm going to restart it. Probably a good idea then. I'm going to try and bank on the idea that they do not have an attack in hand. We see Scamper, um, semi reflexes, and one mystery card. Okay. I'm going to try and bank on that not being an attack and prepare for that. But they just drew something. Yeah, like, I didn't think about that. My kin will avenge me. Should have just. Well, you got this. It's fine. No, I don't! I've got 19 health left! Yeah, that's almost full. <laughs> oh my god. No, it's not! You just gotta stab stab the two HP guy, and it's a one v one, and he has a path of knives attack, so he's gonna take a ton of damage. Oh my god! Also, that mystery card was scamper, so they drew him into an attack. Oh my god! Is Brofest Simpsons lacking his loaf? 
Cheer oh. 100, cheer 100, cheer 100, cheer 100, cheer 100. Oh, yeah, I don't have, have very much free money, Lafila, one love. Oh, oh, thank you, Borb. I'm very appreciative of it. You're so sweet. <laughs> Just make sure not to let Gary keep passing the turn, because otherwise Path of Knives will fall off and my sacrifice was in vain. Yeah. Okay, it doesn't do much, but I can still stab him. No, I can't. He's still a little too close. He's a little too far away. Um, I can Just arcane move. feedback. Move. Why? So that you can stab him. Well, but he's going to move. They're going to move. If you stab him, he will die. But that guy, I want that guy to chase me. I don't want that guy to. All right, fine. See? Now you can, like, vicious thrust away and hit the 2HP guy with that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Why did it do that? Let's see. I'm going to bank on it not being an attack. That's I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm not going to do that. I mean... You won't instantly die. Oh, it was just another simian thing. Yeah, that's rough. That's not good. I think I need to stop attacking him. Yeah. I just need to get lucky and draw, um... You just darn. need to get behind him. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Sure. <laughs> I mean, but if I attack him now... Yeah, don't attack him. <laughs> yeah. End round. Just just fish for one of your attacks that deals nine or more damage. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, I should not have kept the arc. Sorry, I just wasn't thinking. Curse Harden, Master Chop. Nice. <laughs> Goodbye! Wait, that's right. I forgot that he could have that. That's unfortunate, but... Guess you finally Recognize made a monkey! Charm. Honorable attack, baby! <laughs> What'd you say? Oh, yay! Guess you finally made a monkey! Yes, you finally made a monkey out of me! Dr. Zayas. Mm. So you guys don't know about Planet of the Apes the musical? No, I don't! Oh, oh isn't my... that from... I thought that was from Futurama, not Simpsons. Oh. Oh my god, I was wrong, it was Earth all along. All you have to do is redact but it, it's I, really I easy. Of, I have seen clips from it, at least. I don't know if it's like a full musical they did, but I have seen the clip of the... Mm. Ooh, Dr. Zayas. <laughs> Ooh, Dr. Zayas. <laughs> I guess all honorable attack. Doesn't matter. Yay! I beat the moon Yeah. Yay! <laughs> oh, I'm so good at this game now. Thanks to Brof's tutelage. <coughs> As you sift through the remains looking for treasure, you take a moment to pause and consider the plight of Cartuntria. Everyday monsters are one thing's thing, but intelligent, violent monkeys are a worrying development. Are our times more dire than ages past? <coughs> My fave line is, I hate every ape I see, from Chimpan A to Chimpan Z. Oh, yeah, you said that earlier. I thought you were just That's making a fun. joke. What? That's fun. It is. I got the splintering cudgel, which is really... Mm, I'm not going to say it's bad, because it has three bashes and three simple bashes. Now, there was a weapon yesterday in the shop... That was just six bashes, which was so funny. And a very, very good weapon. Um, yeah. If you can get three of those, your deck is just the goofiest thing imaginable. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Bash, uh, bash, 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 bash. <laughs> yeah, it's like, this bash deals 14 damage, and this bash does 12 damage, and this bash does 10 damage. Let's see. Um. Ooh, Unholy Wellspring, Touch of Death, and Armor of Faith. Touch of Death is good. So our goal is to maximize as many high damage cards as possible. He's not we want to, to we want to kill the monkeys in two or three shots maximum. Mm. Well, I've pretty much already got the strongest 
the strongest stuff I could go for. I guess this Asta guy is pretty good. Two impaling stabs, two vicious thrusts, a fumble, and a heavy weapon, and a large weapon. Uh, yeah, step moves are also quite good here, so... Yeah, but I already have two vicious thrusts. I'd be replacing my whirling flail. I don't think it's a good idea. Step moves are good, you said? Yeah. Three strong stabs and two lunging thrusts. Oh, hold on. What is this hefty chopper? Three strong chops, two chops, and a weak chop? What do you think? Chops are bad here. Uh -huh. It'll allow you. It'll allow multiple monkeys to draw and refresh at the same time. We can't have. We can't survive that. Um, minor. Okay, so the acrobat's blade is the one that gives me my mighty hacks, which are great. But this excellent rapier gives me nimble strikes, shifty stabs, lunging hacks, a fiery stab. Uh, step moves or like thirteen damage or eleven damage attacks are what we need. Four. Okay. That means I can wear Obviously, my... a step move that does 11 or 13 damage is not a thing. <laughs> yeah, God, that would be incredible. Um, all right, so how many do we have oh. left? <laughs> Three more battles? No! <laughs> Bro, if we can't do this, and if we have to do we another... Can. Believe if, in yourself. If we have to do another one, it's going to be so hard. Hey, Karen, it's awesome jamming with you, but I can't stop worrying about you losing your job. Oh, that's sweet, Gary, but don't worry about it. Dad will hire me back when he calms down. <laughs> well, that oh! explains how she got hired. What'd you say? Yeah, what'd you say? It explains how she got hired. Dad will hire me back when he calms down a bit. Uh, she's a Nepo baby! She is! <laughs> but it's in a pizza parlor. <laughs> she's a pizza parlor Nepo baby. She's a pizza parlor Nepo <laughs> the baby. The silliest kind of Nepo baby. The most, the goofiest kind. Oh my god. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> the caravan is picked clean. Many goods of value have been carried away by the evil war monkeys. If you're a speedy, you can follow them headlong into the dark forest that lines the ill-fated road. You crash through the underbrush in hot pursuit. Now, I would say there's no way these are evil, right? I would say that these are just animals being chaotic and destructive, but have you fought one? <laughs> you can you can only say that if you've never fought one before. I say they're evil. Battle. It's time for battle! Sorry, I'm trying to revamp my build again You're now good. that I know more about how the monkeys work. You're good. I'm not You're doing fine. super well at that. Here we go. This should work. You're fine. Do not stress. I have upgraded my helmet. And considering that they do actually have a really obnoxious block card, I have one copy of Warcry. So. Oh, that's hold a good on. plan. <laughs> this is an arcane item. Do you happen to have the? Do you happen to have forgetfulness? Never mind. They're mad. It needs. It discards ma magic cards. Yeah, um, perplexing ray discards a random card. Right. And I actually, I think I got so I no, I guess I didn't actually get a short perplexing ray. Um, what is this? Target at me. Oh, melt armor. Okay. Let's Counter try spell. this. I think this is good. Oh, cruel dharma is really cool. It's, it's got drown. Awkward. <laughs> it's got it's drown. Good. You're fine. You're fine. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't be be frustrated. Uh, you have Drown, it has Drown, Counterspell, and Curse of Hunger. And also, it's not important because you don't have it, so whatever. Um, mm -hmm. let's continue. Alright, what were you saying? It'll be a bit awkward? Yeah, I think this build is gonna be a little bit awkward, but I think it's, I think it's what I can do. Okay. Let's go fourth. Hopefully, not come fifth. <laughs> Whoa. All right, there's six of them, and there are two different teams now. So. <laughs> no. Okay. Um. Uh. 
Okay, so we've got... So they are kind of in a... Oh, there's a victory train. There's, there's two, two victory trains. Corner. Oh, jeez. I will attempt... Oh, this is really bad for moving, trying to get around them. But it's also really bad for them trying to get around us. True. Because they can move us with the um, with the block if but it succeeds. But they have free move. They can huh? ignore our zone of control. Oh, you're right. They can just jump behind us then. Can they move through us? No, I don't believe so. Okay, well, I can trap them in this in these little hallways then. They can get around the brambles, but I can trap them in these little hallways. I think I'm going to run first. What do you think? Do you want to go first? Sure. I don't have any good plan right now, so... <laughs> Baby, see you soon, Borb! Alright, so that guy's going for... Oh, boy. I think you should probably do something then. I don't think you want to pass it to me. Cooling laser! Oh, jeez. Um, I'm thinking about shifty stabbing. What do you think? Uh, pass it to me. I want to try and focus these guys down. Sure. Especially since they don't have their defensive cards. Now you can go. Well, now... Hmm. Okay, sure. And now they can't get behind me, so... Ow. Do you want to go for the hot spot or do you want to? Yeah, like... I'm gonna try and do hot spot. It's probably not a good idea. They probably have a pocket move, but probably. oh, they don't. Nice. But they might have. They might have the activatable thing. But I'm not attacking that one anyway, so I'm not attacking yeah. that kind. No, they don't. Wow, they drew really badly this turn. <laughs> Yeah, we might as well, since <laughs> since we're not going to have priority regardless. So. Right. <laughs> hey, whoa! How much damage does that do? Jesus. Yeah, Lava Terrain is quite good. Oh. That's two damage. Four damage, I mean. That's two instances of two damage. Yeah. Um, I have two blocks. I'm just going to Inquisitor Strike this monkey, then. Okay, we All have right. to be really careful. They only have to they only have to be on the squares for six turns. Yeah, I know. Ah, that's the song I was thinking of. Okay, cool. No! Oh, that's evil. I didn't even think about doing that. It does turn you around. I hadn't thought about that. I need to, I think I need to move because, um, they're gonna hit me from behind, steal my stuff. Yeah, currently they can't because he's deactivated. Oh yeah, never mind then. Go for it. Evil like Greville, the best evil villain character in all of video gaming. Yes. Right, perfect. This is great news. Now you should probably do something though. <laughs> yeah, I'll try. I'm currently stuck. Oh, good. You had two of them. Fine. Wash or flash flood. Target three unoccupied. Water train is impassable. Can't they just free move over it? No. No, they'd have to fly over it. Yeah. I had to leave that stream early. I did beat the game. I finally beat it. I finally beat Greville in the most frustrating battle ever. I ended up having to use Shadow Lugia. It was brutal. I ended up master balling XD. I ended up master balling Shadow Lugia, and then um, and then just using Shadow Lugia in the actual fight against Greevil. It was the worst. All right, so and it's like it's so funny because it's like the ultimate Shadow Pokemon that can't be turned. They can't be turned back, and you're like. Oh, I wonder what that is, except for the fact that I've seen the box art, and I saw the opening cutscene where it was very clearly a Lugia that looks like it's all dark and purple. 
I wonder what this Pokemon could be. It's like they didn't even it's try to. It's Pikachu. What? It's Pikachu. It's Pikachu. <laughs> Shadow Hole! Now that would have been an interesting plot twist. The Lugia is just like not even... It's just like a thing. You you fight a rando that just has it. Let's see. It's like, it's right. my baby! His name is George. We just had him <laughs> carry the ship. Let's see. Your I'm, go. I think I'm gonna honorable attack. What'd you say? Your go. I know. I think I'm gonna honorable attack him and he's gonna have the card, isn't he? No! No actual way! Excellent news. Yeah. Uh, I guess I, you could try and push your luck with an attack soldier so yeah, that you don't just, waste as much damage on him. Yeah, I was going to empty fist the 20, actually, because he doesn't have the card, so... True, yeah. Um, yeah, go for it, then. Uh, <laughs> right, Even it? without their gimmick, they're still doing a lot of damage. They are. And I, we don't have any healing, and I don't. I haven't drawn any of my armor. I can't move. You can't. Oh, you can't. You're still halted. No, they triggered my hit. The I had two. They triggered oh, one last right. turn and one this turn. <laughs> Welcome so I can't back, move. Boy. Whose go is it? Me go. Oh no. Yeah, it's, it was my go. Why are you? Hmm. I don't know. Interesting strategy. Just annoyed, so I figured I could use it. Fair. Any idea what you're going to play on Wednesdays now that you're done with Gale of Darkness? I don't, actually. I'm still thinking about it. Also, I finished Steam World Heist yesterday as well, so oh, I've also got... I've also got... There, whoa! I've also got, um... Uh, Thursdays cleared up. Dang it. Dang it, dang it, darn it. Cred, gosh, deadly darn do. I could have <laughs> massive chopped you. He pushed you away, though. He did. And now or, I'm on... Well, rather, you jumped away yourself. But now you can still do it. You have oh. nothing but move guards. Right. There. I forgot he's deactivated. Please don't have that block. It feels like such a waste to... Don't die on me, okay? <laughs> I'll be fine. I can't do this without you. Because if you die, yeah. I think he immediately wins. Yes, he would. We'll find out when the next schedule is. But yeah, I guess we will. Dark Cloud 2 three times a week. Mm, nope. No, thank you. <laughs> I mean, it's a, it's a fun game, and we do need to finish it eventually. So I guess it would make sense. But I don't like... Uh, I do I do Dark Cloud, on two, Dark Cloud 2 on Sundays for a reason. Because it's easy for everybody to... It's easier for everybody to make it on Sundays. I think I'm just going to massive chop him. It's a bad idea, because yeah. I know he has it. I was wrong. All right, let's go take out this one, this victory strain monkey. At the very least, I need to try to. At the very least, I need to try to. Um... Oh no! At least you got them off the victory terrain. Yeah, that was the plan. Ah. Uh... Well, if I use jump back, I can't protect myself from his attack if he hits me. And I don't know what he has. Should I just pass I mean, them? You're not going to kill him this turn anyway, and you can retain him. Yeah, true. We'll find out when the next schedule is posted, and it will, of course, be Undertale 2. Of course. Mm -hmm. Yep, definitely. So that we can finally get out from under the specter of of Undertale 2. Uh, pass it to me. Oh, he's on the acid. Sure. Oh, Warcry! Warcry is going to be helpful. Plus, we can get rid of that monkey armor with my Sundering Strike. Please don't die. I'll do my best. No promises. Pass it to me, please. Yep. And one more time. Yep. Full snap. <laughs> oh my god, bro. I know. 
You're scaring me here. I'm doing oh! the best I can. I didn't realize he jumped off the victory tray. Okay, well, uh... <laughs> Whoa! I just look. I look back, and the monkey's right in front of me. Like, whoa! Yeah. Monkey jump scare. I'll He's do like, the best I can here. <laughs> the just monkey's like ten feet away from me, and I'm like, all use, right. Use use war cries so that we can start with priority next turn. Yeah, use yeah. war cry is the very last thing you do. Ah, uh, okay. Um, but yeah, I was thinking. I was thinking it's like <laughs> the monkey's ten feet away. I'm like, okay, that's fine. You stay there. I look back. I'm like, don't mm -hmm. worry, bro. If you got this. I look back over to the monkey. He's just right in front of my face. Oh. Some horror movie esque nonsense. Yep. 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 I'm gonna say Sandrin Strike. Yeah. Yeah. You said Strike. Oh. And you're dead. <laughs> yeah. No. Not necessarily. In fact. Oh my God. Hold on. I might be. Wait. I can run past him now. Don't attack him. Huh? I said don't attack him because he can use That's simian fine. reflexes. <laughs> That's fine. Um, I've got to war cry him. No, don't bother. Just move on to the victory terrain. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. All right, that's one. That's one more star for us. It's too dangerous to work I am because it would re-energize him. Please don't die. I I'm alive for now. Pass it to me. I'm working on it. Short perplexing ray. That's nice. Perplexes Zyra. As long as you can like run away. Oh god! He's passing it to me, please. No, because he's gonna kill oh, me. No. He's gonna kill me. Oh god! Oh, we're all dead. Then we've lost. It's over. It's Jover. Oh, he didn't have an attack. What? Are you kidding? Don't attack him. Don't bother attacking him. Oh no! Uh, just, 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 just turn pass. around and face him. No, just wait. turn around and face him. Wait, he already passed, didn't he? Yes, he did. But if he takes priority and draws a cowardly strike or pickpocket, you're just dead. If I war cry him, does that work? Does that turn me to face him? Yes, but then he'll draw and re-energize off of Simeon reflexes. But it doesn't matter just because... Use, oh, right. Just, uh, just use run to face him. Don't do anything Wait, else. What do you mean he'll draw and re-energize? Because he... It's an attack. War yeah, but like attack. he's already energized. Well, it doesn't matter that he's energized. Yes, he's energized, but he's not. He doesn't have an attack right now. He'll draw two if you use War Cry on him. All right. Still fine. That's fine. Just, just pass it. Greetings from the future. Yeah, I'm like a minute I in the past. Oh no! It. He'll probably kill me. I mean, you could. Try to silver bolt and cold snap him, but he's one of the ones that has the two the reflexes. simian reflexes. Yeah. You could hit the war monkey, and then we literally just win the game. If you hit the war monkey, you can't you can't see him. No, I can't. Dang! If you killed the yeah okay. If we pass the turn, get the star. The war monkey moves in, and you kill him. We win immediately. But if he attacks you and kills you, we lose. <laughs> Guys, this is so terrifying! I can't even interact with streaming properly with all this delay. She probably already aced the most difficult campaign. No, I haven't. <laughs> Alright, let's pass. Oh, Jesus. Let's do it. I'm just relying on him not drawing back stab. As long as they don't draw cowardly attack, we win. We're fine. We got this. Yeah. Yeah. Just keep your reliable hide so that you don't die to a five damage attack. Yeah. And and you don't have Frenzy, matters. so Powerful Bludgeon doesn't really matter either. Yeah. Uh, Cantrip, Warcry. I guess I could use Warcry. No, I'm just going to keep Powerful Bludgeon, just in case. Yeah, go for it. Uh, no, that was a terrible idea, because if they have the block, whatever, that's fine. Oh, Pass. we had priority somehow. Yeah, because he, we passed, yeah. Pass oh, this card to yourself okay. when you play an Asuka card. Oh, okay. So, um, can you reach him? No. Not him, but... <gasps> I only have one. Oh, no, 
no way. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay. And that is why you needed to keep the reliable eye. <laughs> sure, no. Uh, Ask it to me. Yeah, well, he can't hit me again, so I'm just not going to yeah. touch him. Die. No oh, way. Okay. Yes! <laughs> we did it! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my god! You know the feeling with mobile and putting Brof to shame with her insightful tactics? I am. <laughs> no, I am not. I am not. Brof won that one. Oh god! I'm sorry you're so far in the past, Abiel! <laughs> Man, I was trying to do some utterly worthless and situational links in a game almost nobody plays with a character I'm not even that interested in, and I slam my thumb so hardly against the side of my pad. Ouch. Probably not really worth it. Ouch. I am so sorry. <sighs> Hopefully you didn't have any attack cards in hand. And of course it does significantly, <laughs> significantly less damage than the simple cancel from the same starter. Yikes. Okay, after a fierce and protracted struggle, you overwhelm the war monkeys. They're a cunning and agile foe, and it is only with a supreme feat of martial endeavor that you are victorious. You examine their tiny backpacks for loot. Tiny backpacks. <laughs> I found literally two adventure. No, it's adventure. There's no D there. Why do they keep doing? It's because these are from an adventure. <laughs> no, it's not how it works. Oh, I can it's finally a use pun, this. Lo-fi. I can it's finally. I can finally use the sell all button. Ta-da. <laughs> Yay! Okay. Um. Ooh. Well, she no, it's terrible shields. Two desperate blocks and a missile block. Well. No, that's actually pretty good. What's it like having Papa Man Chew as your dad? He's famous! <laughs> well, we have to eat leftovers from the pizza store. Last night we had mozzarella and anchovy stir fry. Ew. I... I don't even know how to react to that. how stir fry works. I don't even know how to react to that. A stir fry with cheese in it? That's... It's more like a skillet dish. Ugh. <laughs> that it's more like a bake than. <laughs> or I could do the loading symbol too. I don't. I don't understand. JK, the base cancel does ten damage and the link does thirty five, and they both lead to disarm. Unless maybe if I do it super late on the easy cancel, I get to connect more hits. <laughs> Sounds like Avio's labbing. Swift as they are, these nasty primates are too small to carry the caravan's riches very far. The rear, guard, the rear guard seems to be defending a path to a mountain up ahead. Screaming warriors pour from the trees, attempting to slow your progress. There's only one answer to their challenge. Slay them all! Oh, this is gonna be so hard! Alright, two flying monkeys and three war monkeys. A banana peel lands on your head. That can only mean one thing. Flying monkeys! <laughs> uh. Alright, I'm gonna cold snap this flying monkey, I think. Quella and Chister, and we have Cornelius, Zyra, and Zayus. Oh, Zayus. Wait. Dr. Zayus. Dr. Zayus. Wait, is that a reference? Yeah, of course it is. What? You don't know that. It's not a coincidence, that's for sure. Acorn sling. Uh, What? That's not okay. Eight, ah. eight range seven ha ah, eight range seven damage? How Jeez. on earth is an acorn that powerful? Dr. Zeus, Dr. Zeus, Dr. Zeus, Dr. Zeus, Dr. Zeus. Let's see, should I run for the victory terrain? Oh, uh no mm, good question. I'm going for it. I think we need to kill these flying monkeys. These things are freaks. Okay, yeah, I'll go for the, the one that's already active then. Oh, oh! Oh no! He didn't have Oh, that's really bad! Yeah. Duck is... Huh. Okay. Just pass. We need... We need to end this. 
Okay. Uh, I'm going to leave another downward spiral for that. No worries. I hope, big hugs. I hope everything gets to feeling better. We'll see you later. Yeah. Those words. Is it possible to put them in a sentence in that order? <laughs> what words? Oh, the names? Like Cornelius, Zayas, Zyra? No, what Abia said. Oh. Yeah, Abia just did it. <laughs> good luck, Borb. Yeah, good luck. Oh, okay. That massive chop is pretty nice, but probably not very helpful in the long run. In actuality, I mean, Jesus. Should I just let you stab it? Yeah, should I fiery stab the monkey? I'm I'm in front of it. This is a problem. I meant the flying one. I should have let you fiery stab the flying one. Uh. Ugh. They can just fly anywhere they want. Mm -hmm. And they're ranged attackers with stinking acorns. What Karen was saying. Oh, the stir fry thing? <laughs> oh, yeah. That, uh, I don't know if it's legal, actually, to say that. Yeah. Um, I think Karen just broke the law, actually. <laughs> um,. All right, let's do this. I'm going to run up here, I think. All right. <laughs> Ouch. Yeah, should have kept the reliable hide. That's fine. I believe in you. I'm going to try for the massive chop. I hope it works. Yeah, yeah of course. That's fine. It is. And then I can powerful bludgeon him. I won't do any extra damage, though, and I mean, he might even armor it. Uh. Jesus, this is so nerve-wracking! No! Why didn't you hit the monkey? I'll show you. Okay. Oh. Mm. Hot spot him. I can actually no, I can't because it's difficult terrain. Um, I don't want to use my armor up. Yeah, that's fair. It's kind of interesting that he um, attacked you and not me. Oh, 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 Amadeus. Okay, we're, okay. I mean, only three. Oh. oh, armor, armor. Lightly used armor. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's see. I'm gonna go after the monkey. All right. Ugh. Oh. Good luck. So annoying. So annoying. At least he didn't take your card. Yeah. Oh, this is so nerve-wracking. Wait, why didn't you do anything? You're gonna die! It's not really anything to do. I'm kind of pinned in everywhere. <laughs> oh. Oh, gee, that did nothing because I didn't think about their armor. Okay, yeah, these step moves are awful because they actually have armor. Yeah. Hey, would you look at that? Oh my gosh, get on that terrain! Yeah, lunching. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh my god. Okay. Um. Okay, we can. Uh, <laughs> we might be able to do this. Okay. And it shouldn't be difficult anymore, yeah? Or unless. Is acid difficult terrain? Acid is difficult terrain, yes. Okay. <clears throat> oh my god, no way. Wait, don't... Oh, because you were behind him. I'm making him. sure to attack him only from behind. Good idea. Okay, this is really dangerous. 
<laughs> what happens? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Well, uh, they still won't win if... I hold die. on. If you die, it's they fine. still won't win. They'll have to push me off. And they don't have anything that pushes. They only have stuff that damages. So, oh, there we go. Yeah. Uh, we just pass. We win. Yeah. Pat, just pass yeah. and win. Turn around to face him, but don't oh. get off the drain. Right. <laughs> nice! Oh, okay. Block soldier? <laughs> it doesn't matter. They've used all oh, their pass. stuff. They can't do anything more. Just pass. Oh my god, yes! <laughs> Oh my god, we okay, did it! Okay, one more to go. <laughs> god, this is so scary! <laughs> These guys are so strong! <laughs> god, this is so tough! Okay! Oh. oh, these enemies are so difficult! Flying monkeys! Heavens! Now you really have seen it all! The monkeys' armor and weapons are impressive and their tactics advance! If they ever chose to leave their jungle habitat, they would pose a grave threat to Cardantria! Yeah, where did these yeah, guys even? Yeah, they would. <laughs> no joke. Where did these guys even come from? Do -do 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 -do. Oh, hey, that mushroom helmet. Oh, an earring that I can sell for forty gold. Ooh, that would have been nice. Scuttle team! I got two scuttle teams and an ill-fitting armor. That's eh. Oh. Um, Karen, I made these for you. I used Melvin's model glue, so I hope they don't fall apart, but... Wow! The 12 earrings, so they really is a use for 12-sided dice. Gary, you're the greatest. <laughs> <laughs> that is so true. Barbarian hit dice, and... I don't remember the other one. I believe in, D in 5th edition, I believe, D12s are literally only used for barbarian hit dice. <laughs> Gary learning to riz, right? Gary's learning to to woo the women. <laughs> Please, no more victory to rain. <laughs> I mean, I actually kind of like the victory train. It makes it a little bit easier. I, no, it makes it so much more. We have to hurry so much. Well, like if we had no victory terrain, we'd be able to be be play more defensively. Oh, I guess but that's we have true. to keep pushing through. So how was it in retrospect? Oh, the whole fight. Miserable. <laughs> very, very hard. <laughs> Difficult. The Those monkey flying monkeys very quickly established the fact that we were not allowed to attack them from the front. Mm -mm. The monkeys who have been pursuing pour into the mouth of an ancient temple. Guarding its entrance is an impressive specimen and his henchmen. Clearly more cunning and deadly than the monkeys you have bested so far, the brute raises his war staff and charges to defend his spoils. Oh, you mean because of the because of the duck? Yeah, I forgot they had two ducks. Thankfully, yeah. we never triggered them. Yeah, we met, the one time we attacked them from the front, they failed their rolls. Yeah, which and was then we made sure not to attack them from the front ever, ever again. Ever again. Let's go. Oh hey, it's Doctor it, Deus. Oh hey, it's Victory Terrain. We're supposed to roll a D12 to see if the flying monkeys surprise you, but I'm wearing them, so let's skip that. <laughs> 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 nice. I love Karen. <laughs> Me too, she's great. It is Dr. Zayas! Zayas got an upgrade! Let's see, I don't know. Like... Alright. Should we... We have to take the victory terrain. Yeah. But do. it's gonna be really hard because we can't block line of sight like we did with the other flying monkey, so they're just gonna be pelting us the whole time. Yeah. And they only we they only need they still need eight turns of victory terrain. So I think we can afford to split up and take out these small monkeys first, yeah? Yeah, I think you're probably right. Fine. That gives us eight turns. We're on a time limit. That's fine. I I worked with a tie with a more a more stressful time limit yesterday. In <laughs> SteamWorld Heist, so not as tight of a time limit, but more, but because of the essence of the game, because of the nature of the game, it felt scarier. Fire storm! Doctor Zayas, Doctor Zayas, Doctor Zayas, Doctor Zayas, Doctor Zayas, Doctor Zayas, oh, 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 Doctor Zayas, come on in, rock me, Doctor Zayas. Let's see, um. Shifty stab. 
You're not gonna touch me. Apparently you're gonna hit Brof. I'm really glad that armor roll failed so that I got to keep my aura. I should have I should have done my attacks sooner so that oh, I would yeah. make sure to be use my aura. Wait, why didn't you attack? I'm passing it to you so you can mempo. Why do I I don't wanna mempo this guy now? I wanna hold on to the mempo. Oh. I want to hold on to the mempo for a larger group of enemies. Well, then healing dash out of there then. Or uh, something. Yeah, I probably should have done that. Well, now you can hit him from behind. Except I don't think they have... Oh, right. Mempo's also armor. I mm -hmm. totally forgot about how great that card is. Mm -hmm. He's blocking my way out. I just need to draw my, my mighty hack. If I draw my mighty hack, I might be able to do this, but they are also going to be drawing cards, so... We'll see... Oh! Hmm. Nice, uh... Not so scary at the moment. Oh, Sundering Strike. Mm. Sundering, Sundering Strike is good. I'm trying to decide how I want to handle this. Mm. If you acid jet him or something, I can sun try to Sundering Strike him. It would also pin you in with a bunch of difficult acid terrain. Good point. It wouldn't be too bad because I could go, I could step onto the acid and then because these spots are open here, I can just jump past the terrain. It's, it's okay. I'm going to Sundering Strike him. Yeah. Yeah, he only He'll has one He'll die to burn. He'll huh? die to fiery stab now. So. Okay, well, all right, then go handle those other guys while I wait here for you to do that. <laughs> yeah, I'll give it my best. Wait, I can't reach them. I'm gonna have to toss a lot of cards, too. I'm gonna have to do this my way, then. They're too far away for me to get to with just my walks right now, so I'm gonna have to do something a bit... silly. Should I just use the Mempa, then? To put... to... get rid of him? I need to... I mean, you go. could use... if you... <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> My trait, Acid Leak. Whenever I use an Acid card, I put an yeah, Acid pool less, underneath less a random enemy. enemy. Wait, what? No way! Since I can't reach them with my attacks, I might and as hit well him try with the acid and spray, please. I can't. The range is all wrong. Okay. <laughs> Cowards! Bomb bomb. Pass it to me, please. Yep. <laughs> it's just that you know, you use that acid on a ran on just an empty square when you could have used it on the m the monkey that was blocking me in, so that I could have gone in and actually done something. He was gonna die to um, burn. To yeah, die to the burn. Yeah, but now I had to discard a bunch of good cards like Warcry that actually could have allowed me to maybe get rid of their ducks, so that we could have hit the flying monkey from in monkeys from in front. Sorry. <sighs> Doubt it. I'm moving. If I had used acid in your direction, you would have been stuck in there from acid to rain. I wouldn't have, because like I said, I do you see that it didn't take me? Did you see that it, it was one, two, three? I can hide, can diagonal hop around the terrain. I had a movement card that I could have used to move here, and then I could have used my other movement card to just hop around the lava. 
I was trying to, I explain. I thought I explained that. I guess I didn't explain it very well. All right. I'm going to um, end the round then, I guess. If I wanted it that badly, I could have just used the Mempo. So, whatever. Uh, Alright. Um, that's a lot of damage. Ooh. Ah, oh, that's not good. That's a lot yeah, of damage. That's one of the best cards in the game. Alarm Slash? Really? Yeah, it's very good. Armor 2 melee keep? Yeah, that seems pretty good. Reach for Spear with the power of an axe. And he is going to kill you with it, I'm pretty sure. It's fine. Oh, wait, Mimpo. If you use Mimpo on him, he won't be able to kill yeah, you. Yeah, I know. <laughs> and now they go. <laughs> I'm sorry. Mm, don't be. Well. Let's see. Um, well, they don't have much to work with, so. Yeah, and you'll still be alive and you have plenty of HP, so you'll be fine. Let's see. I'll use the massive shop. Okay, cool. Alright, go for it. Let's see. Um, yeah. I might as well. One good thing about Mimpo being technically armor is that it got destroyed by the acid terrain. True. Let's see. Um. Huh. Okay. Oh, I didn't know you could do that. That's wild. He had passed. I should have just ended the round. I'm sorry. It's okay. got this. You got two blocks in the reliable hide. You have to give up one of them. I don't know which one is better. But... Hmm. That's right, cowards. Flee from your betters. That's a tough choice. What do we do here? Um... If I can get in and actually kill the five health monkey, you can just jump onto the victory square and win the game and win win it. But he has duck. Yeah. So instead, I'm just going to do this. Ow. Should I... He cannot move. 
<laughs> Should I vicious thrust? No. Alright. You're right, they can't move. So go ahead and move on to the victory train then. Uh, I what? just realized that the six wouldn't be enough if the armor rolled. So oh, makes sense. Placed it with the eight makes absolute certain. Mm -hmm. And lock and party down. Haha! Yay! We won! We, we did it. it! We beat the monkeys. I can't believe we did it. Absolutely incredible. There was very little chance of us doing so, but we <laughs> pulled it off. You batted the monkeys into submission and secured the temple entrance. Zaius manages to drag himself into an escape tunnel before you were able to stop him. Though the day is yours, you must return to town for extra supplies before venturing to the monkey's temple. Yep. <laughs> And we gotta do a monkey temple. We made the monkeys and didn't get distracted by you, Gil. We didn't. You Gil. You Gil. You Gil. You Gil. Like Karen was saying something about that. I'm like, wait, Yu Gi Oh. What? <laughs> I thought be, you were reading Karen's dead. That would be pretty funny. Hefty golden nuggets sell for two gold. I got the amulet of inspiration. Oh, oh wait, nice. didn't I already have one? There. I saw it earlier. Yeah, you did. I got the muscle bound boots, which is two muscle throughs and a clumsy. That's weird. If it doesn't have an exclamation point, it means you already had one. Ah, cool. Uh, no, you didn't miss the end of the adventure board because that was the midpoint. That was the <laughs> midpoint, <laughs> baby. We made it into the temple, but next, the next half of it is actually <sighs> doing the temple. Woodsmen are reporting further war monkey atrocities. Find the source and eliminate them. Temple of Terror. Wait a minute. Don't and call it that. <laughs> it's Tombs of Terror. Okay, cool. Yeah, we're good. We're good. The War Monkeys are using an old temple hidden within the jungle as their base. Oh, my God. All right, we got this. No, it's We know the secret battles. of how to beat these guys now. Secret? Yes, secret. Uh, the War the Monkeys tunnel. Headquarters secret is hidden tunnel. inside... The War Monkeys Headquarters is hidden inside an ancient dilapidated temple. Inside lurks their horrid master, Zaius the Mandrel Lord. Only his death will end the War Monkeys' rampage. Storm the temple and end this conflict inside the Temple of Terror! Alright, let's go. Incorrect. Yeah. Incorrect. Are you ignoring the encumbrance rules, Gary? It should take several weeks to travel to the temple. Yeah, several weeks of in-game time, not real time, Melvin. Yeah, no <laughs> joke. You stand in the entrance of a decaying temple, home to a band of vicious war monkeys and their arachnid pets. Within its depths lies the plunder of helpless caravans beset by these heartless beasts. For the sake of the local villagers and the promise of treasure, you set forth into the Temple of Terror. Okay. I guess we're ready. Yep, let's do it. Spider? Hmm. Spiders. I think we're going to be doing Victory Terrain all the way through. Mm -hmm. <laughs> At least this one starts closer to us than it does with them. Try and stop me now, you joiks. <laughs> Those spiders are getting kind of awful close. <laughs> uh, no, this is nitpicking and inventing reasons to be mad at Gary at this point. Yep. Totally. You cracked the code. <laughs> <laughs> you did it. Oh, cool. Uh. Meh. They're scattering noise. Oof. They got like scary orange bits on their back. No! No! Poison! Poison tunnel! Poison, poison tunnel. tunnel! Through the poison. dead, boys! Poison, poison tunnel! Poison, poison, poison tunnel! It's a glass of spiders! Yeah! Oh my god, are we gonna fight the queen of spiders at the end of this? Let's see, um... 
pulling laser, I guess. If I roll a five or six. No, yeah, if I roll a five or six, it would kill him. But if I roll a one or two, I might end up really hurting myself. Because yeah. I don't have a move. So if I get, like, the, the lava thing, I'd be stuck in it. True. Ah. Hmm. Would have been nice if I had drawn my, uh... Might be worth abandoning the victory turn. <laughs> no, I got this! Care combo when I <laughs> No, it's okay, but I appreciate it. I'll take the care combo. Let's get up and we'll do some stretches real quick. I think I might need to make myself some tea as well. Alright, everybody, up off your seat! Stretch your fingers up to the ceiling! Dig your toes down to the floor! Twist and turn yourself all around. Get nice and limbered up. Oh, stretch out your arms, legs, head, neck, torso, whatever you got. Get all nice and stretchy. Mmm, baby. Twist and turn. Twist and turn. Twist and turn. Make sure you're treating your body properly. And as soon as you're ready, go ahead and slowly bend down and touch your toes. Really feel those calves and hamstrings opening up. Okay. Hydrate Redeem. I think after this Hydrate Redeem, I'm going to get up and walk around for just a few minutes. I'm going to take a quick break, I think. All right. Um, here it comes. All right, everybody. See you soon.
Lo-Fi is gone forever. She has abandoned me. She is afraid of the monkeys. Not yet, you're not, because uh, I have returned. <laughs> I have returned with delicious food. <laughs> oh. I have come to the conclusion. Welcome, back, you guys. Hi, hello. Uh, I have come to the conclusion that I, um, since I have not eaten all day, it is entirely possible that I'm just kind of well. I actually guess I ate like a snack few hours ago but i haven't eaten much all day so i might be getting a little bit hangry so i decided to fix me some delightful food and that food comes in the form of a delicious bowl of chicken soup cheese sandwich oh cheese sandwich would be good but i actually went with a delightful bowl of chim can soup which is kind of mm -hmm. Which is kind of adjacent to a cheese sandwich, if we're being honest. If you really think about it. It's also an extremely full bowl of chimkin soup for some reason. I don't know why. I don't remember it usually being this full when I make it. But, oh well. Slurp time. Mmm. Ah, that's delicious. The problem is I don't want to lift this off the table. <laughs> How you doing, bro? I don't want to lift this off the table because... It's so full, I don't want to spill it everywhere. Well, don't then. Well, that's why I'm having to disappear for a second every day. Okay. Well, it's just, I, it's just weird. I'm having to, like, bend down. <laughs> it's weird. Because my desk is super low. Alright. Okay, so what am I even doing? Hold on. I'm about to die, so... Um, I'm gonna attack soldier myself so I can kill the spider. Alright. Fantastic. Yeah. Alright, what do you want to do? Nothing. Nothing at yeah. all? Not you getting yet. tired? Are you getting tired? No, I'm just... I'm getting a little tired you're... myself. Maybe we should stop the stream. <laughs> Maybe you should try and not get killed by every spider and monkey in the temple. <laughs> well, that's what I'm doing. I'm lining them up for you to take care of. Now you're trapped. 
Oh, I'm not trapped, trapped. I can move like twice. I did stretch and hydrate, I thought. Maybe I didn't hydrate. I stretched, but I had to go get water for the hydration. All right. Uh, Let's see. I'm going to war cry the monkey. No. Uh, okay. <laughs> what? What do you want me to do then? Okay, let's follow your plans. What's you your master plan? Leave. You should get off the victory <laughs> terrain. Because you're going to die if you stay on it. If I stay on it for just a couple of more turns, you only have to kill two enemies. You won't survive a couple more turns. You're adjacent to three enemies. And with no blocks or armor. And you're poisoned. Is your bad opinion? No worries. Soup slurp. Mm. Noodles. Have fun. I will. Battery explosion. Ow. Ow. Well, really puts a new meaning in assault and battery. <laughs> it's so funny. It is truly the funniest thing in the it's world. Just yes. such a good joke. This soup isn't working, I'm still grumpy. <laughs> <laughs> Why isn't this soup doing its job? I'm just kidding, soup. You're doing a great job. <laughs> Sounds like somebody got poisoned. No. I mean, you were poisoned, but... Like they got poisoned as in like a verb, like the poison got to them. Oh, I see. And I remember to pay it. Oh, good point. I hadn't thought about that actually. All right, well. Ralph well, is certain I'm gonna die, so I might as well not even try. <laughs> No, you're not going to die anymore. You were going to die. Correlation. You, you were. Hmm. Um. Monkey punch. Not the honestly, best card. I didn't want that to land. <laughs> yeah, not the best card to steal, honestly. Definitely better. That's yeah. okay. I guess I should have been honest about my plans then. Oh, sorry. No, I didn't say anything. Oh, so... I should have. I should. I. I should have seen it. Yeah. Should have seen that. Yeah, that was my bad. Yeah. <laughs> um. No, oh, I no, I mean like I'm actually I'm actually not upset. I just I, I am a little upset with myself because I should have said something. <laughs> um but if you unload on that spider, he should die in to the fiery stab at least. True. So cool. Yeah. Go for it. <laughs> ah. The thing he didn't choose to move me and chase it to the other monkeys. <laughs> yeah, right? That was a bit of a weird choice. That would have run so faster. Wow, chicken, this, um, Campbell's chicken soup is a lot better when you add water to it. <laughs> it's not quite as salty. 
so bounty. <laughs> the ultimate uh, joke. Uh, Hold on, I didn't watch the clip. <laughs> Battery explosion! Oh, I thought that was the flavor text Ow. on the card. It just says really looks. puts a new meaning in a salt and battery. battery. <laughs> 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 All right, it's now so the real funny. question is, what do we do? It's so funny. <laughs> All right, it's I had to get the so clip. Funny. I had to finish the clip. Now what do we do? No idea. I think we give up. I think we just let them kill us. I don't think that's a good plan. No, I think they should, I think we should let them kill us. Apparently my strategies and plans aren't worth doing or anything, so we might as well just cut me out of the team entirely. We're like, we've got spiders and monkeys bearing down on us. <laughs> You're just like, is this really the time? <laughs> yes, this is the time. And yes, I am having a conversation with myself, by myself, and a fake you. Grr! Oh, and, then you would, and then you would be all like, <clears throat> Well, I don't think it's the time, and I think that you should learn to appreciate yourself more. And I'm like, I do appreciate myself more, and I think my plans are awesome. And you would be like, I don't. And I'd be like, oh, how dare you? <laughs> this particular plan was bad. That is <laughs> the extent of it. <laughs> Just go ahead and uh, die, you didn't, like, you didn't like the other one. <laughs> you didn't like the other one either. <laughs> I was trying to move out of the... Trying to get rid of a monkey and move out of the way of lava and that. No. And then Borb would say, Loaf always has awesome plans. And I would say, Oh, thank you, Borb. I know you're always there for me. Bro, doesn't though. Oh, this is really annoying. It is. But, um, I'm going to keep doing the bet because I think it's funny. Not what I meant, but also that is true. <laughs> You're so mean to me! And in case my voice sounds a little far away, I've got my mic moved away so I can use my soup. Also, the soup is uh, lower. <laughs> did you say use your soup? <laughs> yes, I did. <laughs> Hello, Hello, I did say use my soup. And then the spiders and monkeys would wonder how I got in there. But the thing is, I actually... Oh, you can teleport? So cool. You only need to kill one. Um. <clears throat> so if they don't move... This is a disaster. Oh, they moved. <sighs> broth is really delicious. I've got some broth I need to make something with. Anyway. Um... Do, 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 do. I, hate, I hate it when Acid Leak puts it under the person you are already targeting. <laughs> and nobody knows how I teleported, so I try to demonstrate, but I accidentally blow up the whole temple with everybody inside. Oh no! Well, I guess this is the end of our story. Yeah, all right, there we go. <laughs> Did you win? Yes, thank you for pointing out that I just needed to kill one of them because I was about to give up because I couldn't get that guy off the victory terrain in time. Ah, oh, they were about to win. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, I didn't even realize that's bad. But we won, so. The temple is a shrine to the great ape god in the sky. The walls are covered with depictions of the simian afterlife, a veritable cornucopia of bananas, mangoes, and other exotic fruits. Why do they have to specify in the sky? Wouldn't it just be the great ape gods? But thankfully I survived somehow. I'm not able to find Loaf or Brof. Oh, well, I... It's because we finished the map and mm -hmm. we moved on to a different one. Yeah, we moved on to a different stage. So that map ceases to exist. It's been exploded, but then it goes like... And it, like, disappears. Mm. Let's see. It gets absorbed back into the ether. Not that one. Um... All right, collect loot. The other one. I found a cheap idol I can sell for two gold, and I found Fey Insight, which has Fey Silversmith and two Elvish Insights, which I believe I already, I do not have it. But I'm pretty it's sure- It's a very bad car, bad item. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure I've seen it before too, so. Oh boy, the club reward is two, is the spinning top boots, which has two <laughs> spin arounds and a, and a charge. Yay. <laughs> oh boy. 
No, then you ever think the rules are there to make the game fun, not bring everyone down? <laughs> no. Why would that be the case? <laughs> what? Are you crazy? Get this woman out of my sight. <laughs> I'm sorry, get this female out of my sight. And then I realized there's nobody around to stop me from drinking all the swamp water and other delicious, nutritious beverages. I That's fair, honestly. I can't stop you anymore. You can drink all the swamp water you want. <laughs> Enjoy. Spinning top boots like Beyblades? Yeah, it could turn me into a Beyblade, but it could also turn me into a dead character because they're not very good. Um, no. And then answer me this. So without rules, how would we know who's a winner and who is a loser? I mean... <laughs> That's a very good point. It's a bad mindset because not all games are about winning and losing. They're about having fun. But um, I do understand the... Um, yeah, I do uh, uh, I do D&D isn't supposed to have losers and no, winners. No, it's not. That's not the kind of game it is. Exactly. Yeah, when you're talking about D&D, &D, yeah. See, but I do understand that a, a better argument, actually, a better argument is um, um, without rules, how do we know... Um, Without rules, there's no game. Uh, without without rules, it's just it's just make believe. Like with um, <clears throat> like where where on the playground you'd be like, well, I have an infinity plus two sword. Yeah, without rules, you 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 end up with um, no structure, no order to the game, and then everything goes out of control, and and it just becomes this like <clears throat> this like one upping contest where everybody tries to. Be better than the others if you're in a bad play group, of course. If you're in a good play group, without rules, you can basically just like try to tell a cooperative story and uh, be be friendly about it. But everybody knows that Brof and I can't do that because I always have to be better than him. <laughs> and then I chug several gallons of Red Bull, which absolutely never goes wrong. Yeah, yeah, never go for it. Even Calvin Ball has a rule. True, that's very true. Even Calvin Ball has a rule. Yeah, but Karen's not saying that we should have no rules. She's just saying that encumbrance is done. <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. I'm just, um... <clears throat> I am... playing a little bit of the devil's advocate. I fully agree with Karen, because I know what Karen's trying to say. But I was trying to come up with a better argument for what Melvin was trying to say. Because Melvin's argument is currently bad, but there is ground there. There is ground that you could find. He just stepped in a puddle. And a dark, deep puddle. You can't use the oh, same thing. Rules, right? is, Melvin doesn't want the rules for that purpose. True. He wants the rules so that he can be a winner and other people can be losers. Yeah. So he's making his argument as effectively and oh. directly as he can. Yeah, no, you're right. You're you're right. <laughs> I what I mean is yeah, I mean what I mean is his argument was made perfectly. This is exactly what he believes, and he he made it very eloquently. It's just the wrong arguments. It's just it's just in it's just a very, very awful stance to take because it's not fun it's not enjoyable let's let's see the early the glory of your early victory slowly turns to bitterness as you wander for what seems like days in the depths of this labyrinthine vault as you detect an upward slope and spy a light in the distance <laughs> excuse me the bone chilling howl of a war monkey splits the dank air furry warriors spill from the dark and battle is joined not the furry warriors <laughs> Telling me a furry built this warrior? <laughs> what? <laughs> you telling me a shrimp fried this rice? <laughs> Let's see. Uh oh, let's start with some damage. Why don't we? Four. Oh, arcane feedback. Whoops. Well, this enemy composition seems familiar. Oh God. Oh, this isn't fun. There's no victory train here either. Yeah, but we can use the terrain to our advantage, at least. Maybe you well. can, but I stink at this! <laughs> judging by way- judging by your- your words! I'm awful at this! I don't think I ever said that. Oh, you didn't? No. Okay, well, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to put words in your mouth. I'm great at this game, then. <laughs> I will fight you till the end of my days. <laughs> I believe that I am amazing, and that's all that matters. I believe in me. I've got to believe well, in the only one way to find out. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Take your turn. <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> do it. Come on. What are you waiting for? Come on. Good question. What am I waiting for? What am I waiting for? 
Let's see. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna play badly. Let's go. Come and get some Eggman. Egg <laughs> Thank you, Vorb. I know, I know you believe I in me. Really You're the wish best. These guys didn't have free move and fly. So I'm being annoying. A, I am being a sassy, gumpy sister today, but I know you believe in me. You're the best. You're awesome. And together we can defeat anything. Yeah, we can. Yay. <laughs> Although this monkey can see me now, which is very <gasps> Oh, God! <laughs> see no bro fi. <laughs> um. Well, if I jump. If I get in front, if I get next to him and punch him in the face, he will see me as a better target than you. I meant the flying monkey way far away. Huh? Which one? Oh, whoa! That's unexpected. Yeah. Wow, that's... Yeah. Uh... But you probably should move forward and try and yeah. fight that monkey, I guess. No! That's unfortunate. I don't... That's unfortunate. I do not like that application of that move. <laughs> I do not like that application of that move at all. I'm going around. I'm leaving. <laughs> Don't you ever talk to me or my hammer again. Unbelievable. Of course they kept it in hand. They're like, why would we get rid of this? It's really good. It's really good. <laughs> this is irrelevant, but one of you old, you can do your best. Mm -hmm. You're allowed to try, sure. I... Oh, powerful bludgeon! Wait, he's probably got the thing in hand. Mm, I'm gonna go for it anyway. Oh. Yay! Ow. That hurt. Alright, good luck. Uh. You can certainly try. Sure, let's pass. <laughs> Wait, did he actually just pass the turn? Yeah. Yeah. I have no complaints about this. Same. In 12 days, Shovel Knight will have first come out a decade ago? Wow! For real. So it came out in 20... It came out in 2014, huh? Interesting. I didn't- I feel like I didn't learn about it until a few years later. Maybe I did know about it. What system did it come out for? Was it the Switch? Wait, when did the Switch- the Switch didn't come out in 2014, did it? I thought the Switch came out in like 2016. Can you pass it to me? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm thinking. Oh. Alright, fine. Yeah. Just- just do I'm your just thing, making then. my desires known. Okay, you're right, you're right. You're right, yeah. Sure, sure, sure. sorry. Sorry. Because if I'm like, if I'm never yell at it, me. <laughs> if I never say it, you don't know that I want it passed to me. That's a good point. And, and you don't consider that in your options. <laughs> that is a good point. You're right. Also, Switch was 2017. Interesting. What? I thought Switch was 2015. 15? Nah, no way. I'm so bad with that somehow. Mm hmm. That's fair. Let's see. Um. What do you want to do this turn? Kill this monkey. The five one with your cooling laser? Yeah. Okay. Nice. Good job. That seems like a bit of overkill, but... And now I want to run from these monkeys. <laughs> That's fair. I will allow you to. Well, you can. You can sure. I mean, I don't know about running, but you sure can walk from them. <laughs> it's using oh, 2015 what, what, tech. Oh, no. oh, viral with the with the viral with the jugular strikes. Yeah, I don't know where to go though. These darn flying monkeys have got most of my avenues of escape covered with their line of sight. Uh oh, just head here. Yeah, now I'm gonna be pinned in though. That's fine. Um, that's not what I was expecting. You can't see me, funnily enough. Mm. Makes sense. You're in a corner. 
I'm gonna attack soldier myself. Yeah, go for it. I could also attack soldier gonna, you. It's just gonna re-energize, but didn't go for oh, it. Oh, that's a good point. No! Ah, throat bubble, sorry. No, I think it'll be totally fine. Oh, I can't believe these guys fly, have like a seven damage. Well, you were right, you didn't re-energize. <laughs> Um. Ugh, this monkey temple is tearing us apart. It just occurred to me. The curse of the monkey temple is <laughs> trying to destroy our relationship as the Let's... best team of fighters in the world. Yeah. You should probably healing dash away from that monkey. Yes, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> Ah. Yeah, I'm gonna say it. I'm just gonna say it. This adventure stinks. Yeah, these guys are real pain. Like it's I'm definitely not a fan. A, it's definitely not a, a fan. It's definitely a test of skill. But God, I'm so so tired of these things. I want to stay awake all night, but I think I'm too old to catch it. <laughs> See you later, Abio. <laughs> bye bye. Mm -hmm. Alright, this is pretty good here. Um Blech. This is still a little warm. Acid leak! Oh jeez, that's not good. Yeah, this is what I was worried about. Um <laughs> I'm sorry. No, no, it's not your fault. This is gonna happen no matter what I did. There was nowhere safe to move. We still haven't- we've only taken out one monkey! Yeah, these guys are really... troublesome. Uh, I'm not drawing well in the attack front, either. I am super tempted to... I think let him come to you. Yeah, I or guess. Or use shifty stab to try and bait out the block that he inevitably has. Hmm. Oh. Yeah, this is all right, Master Chop. Let's go. You don't have the block. You might have drawn. What? Oh, we drew into the armor, so you can use cards that you draw into. Interesting. Oh, that's evil. It looks all weird in his hands. Oh yeah, doll. Yeah, because it's all tiny now. <laughs> It's not super filling, but it is comfortable. All right, so I guess I'm on my way. I don't know where I'm going, but I'm on my way. Goodbye, Rosie. It hurts a lot. Oh no! Hi, <laughs> hello, boys. Are you ready for? A, you ready for? Uh, an extremely easy target. Or it's so dead. We are so dead. We're not gonna win this. <laughs> oh God. I already drew my own my one massive chop. Hmm. Well, that's handy. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Hmm. What do you take? Oh, he, he didn't, didn't take, take anything. anything. He just did a bunch of damage to you. What? Why does that not? Oh, that doesn't hit the. Oh man. Not line of sight. I could hit these two monkeys and I would stay alive at least, kind of. Yeah, that's probably for the best. <laughs> oh, I was like, why did they make that noise? And I forget that the mempo <laughs> makes that noise. Oh, yeah, yeah, it does. Uh, you could kill I the could six kill HP the six HP one with Vicious Thrust. Yeah. At the very least, even if he reactivates and draws a card, they can't use the card, because there's only one monkey left, and they only draw one card per turn now, so... There's a chance! It may be slim, but there's a chance! Why? Huh? What? <laughs> Okay, have fun. Let's I just pass and hope that he future. doesn't. Yeah, you predict that you did. Let's just pass and hope that. Yes! 
Okay, well maybe... <laughs> okay, maybe we could do something with this. I am a genius. You're a genius. I can't believe you just did that. <laughs> and he's facing away from me. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna it. fiery stab him. <laughs> Ooh. Um... Oh, no, no. You can silver bolt him. That's a big waste no, of I damage, can't. though. Why not? Oh, the three HP guy? Yeah, yeah good. But you could silver bolt me. I could also do that. I don't know why I would, but. Mm. We neither. Maybe um... we need to feed the dog and stuff. Have fun feeding dog. Probably what you want to do is just, like, move away from him. You could go, like, here. Ow. Lunging hack. Right, good point. Oh, you could lunging hack the monkey, hope that he has a duck, grabs the lunging hack with the duck, and no. then we his turn using that. No. Of no, no, I... No, there's no way. <laughs> There's no way you can't be you can't predict the future twice in a row. That's not allowed. I'm gonna give it a shot anyway because it would be so funny if it happens. Yeah. Ah. Oh my god. Okay, well we he know has, he has two, two ducks. ducks. Oh, oh, this is really unfortunate. This is um, really scary, actually. <laughs> if I don't, don't we have one more fight after this? Yeah. Uh, I only have 5 HP, but these guys are ranged attackers, so there's never really going to be an opportunity for me to attack them without dying. Mm -mm. So I'm just gonna... No! Wait! Ah! Uh, <laughs> gotta go! Trap! Epic this is, is terrible. terrible! Um. Good luck! Where are you going? Unless. No, don't unless. Don't do this. Don't do this to me. I can't handle these guys on my own. I mean, I might be able to. I'm try So, okay, so here's my thought process. Uh oh, I have one card in hand each that we can't see. Mm, true. If oh, but remember, monkey... you did this before and it was a problem. No, no, I trust you. I trust so you. If the war monkey has an attack, mm -hmm. you it die. does five or more damage. I die. Mm hmm. Well, the maybe. The same is true for the flying monkey. Maybe, because you have armor. But, um... So, my thought process is this. If yeah. I use Hotspot on the 8 HP... That's what I was thinking. Yeah. Monkey, mm -hmm. He will mm -hmm. die unless the last card in his hand is movement. Unless the last card in his hand is a movement. Okay, yeah. Sorry, you yeah. cut out a little bit. Sorry. Um, okay. But then, I could die if the last card in the monkey's hand is an attack. No, he's squeamish. <gasps> You're right! I squeamished him! <laughs> oh my god! Heck yeah, okay. okay <laughs> it's like, it turned a difficult, like, mathematical decision into the easiest <laughs> choice of my life. Getting rid of this weak chop, I don't need this run <laughs> either. Oh boy, and he's what gonna do die do? to the burn! Do do? Wait a minute, so he's gonna die yeah. to the burn, and he's gonna die to the lava! Oh my god! We have a chance! We and I can war cry his blocks out of his hand! True, yeah. But we don't have any attacks right now. Um... Reach him anyway. It doesn't matter, he only draws one card per turn. So, there's a chance that... So, like, even if he draws... We just need to get rid of those two blocks, and all he will have is a fly. Do this. No. Because now he Whoa. flew away from me. Yeah. Good. <sighs> but this is fine. This is fine. Check this out. You think you can beat him in one turn? Because I could run over him. I could run over no. here. <laughs> no, I literally cannot beat him in one turn. It's mathematically impossible. All right, sure. What are you doing? Are you gonna die on me? In theory, no. In possibility, maybe. Do you want, to, do you want me to pass it to you? Yes, please. No okay. way. What? No pass? Yeah. Ugh, terrain mage. Wait, what are you doing? I was, I was testing. 
Oh. I put a terrain underneath him to see if he would fly away or attack me. He didn't do either, so I don't know what the last card in his hand is, but it's not an attack. I'm guessing it's it's the um. I'm guessing it's like acrobatics or something. Yeah, it might have been a third duck or something. Might have been a third right. duck. Yeah, because you were behind him, so it didn't work. Um, I'm going to. I need the. Oh, I need the run. I think. So. I'm yeah, gonna keep you need the, the run. I'm gonna keep the war cry block soldiers. I mean, I'm just gonna I'm gonna go all in, baby. Let's just all do right. this. I'm gonna I'm gonna go on all in on like a run war cry situation. See if I can get rid of his do blocks. I have two runs, so I can. All right, pass it to me. Yeah, thank you. He's a he's a ranged attacker anyway, so it doesn't matter. Hold if on, I... Stay, go there, go there. Why? Because then you can Vicious Thrust, and he won't be able to see you before you use Vicious Thrust to guarantee that you get seven damage off on him. Well, I wanted to war cry him first because he has oh, I mean, two idiot. ducks! Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, well, you still have a lot of moves. It's fine. You still have a run and a shifty <laughs> Should stab. I shifty it's stab him? Armor. <laughs> if I shifty stab him and he steals it, it's like, what do I do with this? Yeah, do it. Do it. Oh, my God. Coward, he won't. <laughs> yeah, he won't. You won't. Oh, my God, he stole it. He passed anyway. <laughs> now you can war cry him. Yeah, now I can war cry him. There goes his other duck. I don't know what he has in hand. It wasn't. No, not shifty stab! Anything but that! Go <laughs> throw me into the briar bed. <laughs> no, throw me into the briar Oh, God, no. Um... <laughs> Alright, well. Sorry, he's not on lava anymore. Oh, wait, he never was. Wait, don't... Melt. Yay! Oh, what are you doing? You would have been fine. Better safe than sorry. Yeah, and he doesn't have any cards anyway. Oh my god, did we do it? Ugh, oh my god! One. Oh, this is really testing the- this is really testing our bonds as a team. Yeah, yeah our patience, our, our bonds, our skill, oh everything. Oh my god, this is the worst mission ever. How did we not have troubles with this when we played it? I, I feel like we probably did. I don't remember you having any- it from your memory. Uh, probably because you just told me what to do the whole time. Oh god. Oh, hey, I got another polar cane. Oh, neat. That's the thing with three frost jolts, two frozen cores, and a cold snap. Oh, yeah, that polar... Yeah, that one. Why can't I get one? She's just not cool enough. Bad I was eating my soup at the moment. How dare you? I was using Broke my soup. I has been banned. I was using my soup at the moment. How dare you? Brat banned. Bro, that is now banned. You can play with like, me. Like, here's the real question, though. Did you ban me because I said, because Welcome I insulted Orp. you, or did you ban me because of the pun? What pun? You're not cool enough to get the ice staff? Boom. <laughs> <laughs> banned. <laughs> We're leaving the Discord call. Let's see, um... I will see you in court. <laughs> I will see you in court. Brofi is now banned, just like Yu-Gi-Oh. Yeah, I need to set up a duplicate one that just says, Brofi has been banned! Let's see, it goes like the other direction. Crisscrosses across. <laughs> this temple is as ancient as the hills around. It's possible that it even predates the coming of humanity. Oh no, are we actually on the planet of the apes? <laughs> Let's see, um... No, this would be the planet of the humans, because the humans are in control and took over after the Age of the Apes. Mm. The planet of the Apes is when the Apes took control after the Age of the Humans, so... Mm. That sounds like the plot of Rise of the Vengeance of the Destruction of the Acquisition of the, of the Pain of, of the, the Rebirth of, the, of the, the Revenge of the Planet of the Apes. Yeah, I remember that one. <laughs> the twelfth movie they made. Um... I got accelerated thoughts on this quick mind spear. The tax that there is of each round target draws a card. I said, think fast. I said fast. <laughs> think fast. I said fast. <laughs> I love it. 
Um, nimble hatchet. Three chops, a strong chop, and two skillful strikes. Hold the phone. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's not bad for like... Even uh, for like a, like having a gold power token and a common, that's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, gold, blue, common. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Common weapon. That's pretty great. I don't want to look at club items. Mm -hmm. Karen, I don't think I even have it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Karen, don't think I haven't noticed you wearing Gary's 12-sided dice. Uh, uh, uh. How have you been checking for surprise attacks if you're wearing the very dice you should be rolling? It's kind of funny. It sounded like he was going to go in a different direction. <laughs> we don't need to roll. Flipple Dub has been using a 10-foot pole to check the branches for lucky monkeys. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. Oh. <laughs> oh. Well, I guess that could work. Excuse me while I check in the far fronds and foliage supplement. Oh my god, she's winning. She's beating <laughs> Melvin. I guess maybe he doesn't have as bad of an opinion of women as we thought. He's at least ta he's a uh, he's at least taking her opinions seriously for a little a little yeah. bit. That's better than those. You enter the it's final chain. A... <laughs> what? It's like he's apparently not a misogynist. He's just the worst. Awful. He's just, he's just awful. That's normally better. awful. <laughs> That's better. He's not a misogynist. He's just awful. Let's see. You enter the final chamber of the temple. Beyond the rickety rope bridge lies the treasure hoard shining in scintillating shafts of sunlight. <laughs> okay. Uh, between you and your goal stands the dread war marshal of the monkeys, but more shocking is the hell mantis. Okay. The cheddar is forward at his command. Whether the beast is a pet or an ally is unclear, but his intent is unmistakable. Guard yourselves for this final clash with the despicable no, monkey house. Why can't we just go in through the roof? I don't understand. Whenever there's like sunlight bathing treasure, why did we not just like look at the top of the building and then just go in from there? <laughs> I don't know. Honestly, I think it's just more fun this way. I mean, it. I'd be wrong, it but it clearly wasn't. It clearly, it clearly was wasn't. Oh wasn't my more fun. God! That's what a hell mantis looks like. Whoa! I that's, forgot about this guy. That's awesome! <laughs> oh my god! He's, be a problem. He's so cool! I don't know if we can beat something this cool. He's way think, too cool for us. You? I'm not sure. I assume terrain. If I have four terrains under him, he'll take damage from all of them. I hope so. Because otherwise, how would how would it decide which one damages him? Oh God! So. He doesn't hate all women. Just those cheerleaders who only like seeing his stupid jerks. He's a perfectly nice guy. Hashtag kill me. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Um. Let's go. Bomb bomb. Doctor Zayas is back again. Mm -hmm. Doctor Zayas. Doctor Zayas. <laughs> Oh, close. Yeah, I shouldn't have moved. That was my man. Well, that was lucky. Well, they don't have their thingy. They don't have their thingy. They only have two cards, so they only draw two per turn. True. But wait, these guys started with more. Oh, no way. Just end the turn. Just end it. Yeah, it's a little sad that I have to discard one of these three very good cards. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. Maybe I should have... No, I'm sorry. I should have no, left you open to saying something. It's just that I did not want him to move. Exactly. I felt the same way. <gasps> oh! Armor practice! <clears throat> Does not seem super great. What, armor practice? Yeah. Okay, I guess I'll just sorry. use a different helmet then. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. It's the Mimpo one. It's better than, it's better than Curse of Amnesia. So. Oh, it is a little bit better, isn't it? <laughs> He's too cool to be beaten in a fight? Don't worry, it's time for me to deploy the hugs! Oh, perfect! <laughs> hugs the giant monster. No, you hug him and he turns into a nice giant mantis, because all he was missing was love. And it becomes that kind of I story. I think all he's missing is the map to the Fallout universe. <laughs> I'm not sure he's in the right spot. <laughs> so true. Like, ah, uh, where? <laughs> which road do I have to take to get to Good Springs? I gave my doggo trouble. She still loves me. Aw. Doggo still love. 
<laughs> Let's see. Uh, I don't have to use our armor practice. So I'm going to use Thundering Strike on the 12 instead, I guess. All right. Yeah. Well, that was close. I think we just pass again. <laughs> yeah, same. I think we just pass. Oh and my if god. Gary is, if Gary's willing to end the round, I am willing to let those monkeys burn. Gary, <laughs> what are you doing? I'm. Mm, I already have armor. I'm going to get rid of armor practice. I'm going to get rid of... Goodbye, monkeys! Wow, that was the easiest monkeys we've ever had to deal with. Yeah, it really was. And the Hellmantis hasn't even moved yet. What's his name? No, no, he is not. Argalex? Uh, Argalex. It's actually a pretty great name. Can I call him... Lexi for short? <laughs> Let's I call, call him Dr. Zayas Jr. <laughs> Dr. Zayas Jr. I actually want to call him George. <laughs> Alright, in order to beat this this final mission of the adventure that has been tearing us apart, because this is so hard, we're going to need the power of the moon! Magical Mufi! Hey, do baby. Weedy, weedy, weedy. So, alright. Oh, ouch. That's going to hurt. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> the cadaver. <laughs> Let's see. Um... <laughs> I'm what just is gonna this? start shooting at this monkey. A ghoul. Um, okay, yeah, go for it. I was thinking about running over behind him, actually. Hold on. Yeah. Let I'm me gonna... cold snap him before we do anything oh. to prevent him from moving around so much. Good idea. Oh, cooling laser adds damage to cold attacks? That's so cool! Yes, yes it is. Literally, but that wasn't going for that! I had a feeling he was gonna do that! Oh. And now I'm not behind him anymore. I'm sorry. Oh, it doesn't seem to matter, though. First one, affected squares become acid terrain. The spider face around opponent discards all our- Oh! You're behind him again. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Oh, now I have to waste my vicious thrust. Yeah. You can hit him from this distance? Yeah. Oh my god. Bat explode! Imagine if I had actually walked into the lava instead. I want to keep my armor! <laughs> you're trying to view flash content, but... Shout, you're trying to view flash content, but you have no flash plugin installed. Alright. <clears throat> All right. Argalex? Sorry, I'm going to for just a second, but I am sure back. You are trying to view flash content, but you have no flash plugin installed! Hold on. I have my... <laughs> wait, 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 wait. That was... Bing! Unfortunate. Did I... Bing! <laughs> he has been vanquished! That was definitely the worst possible laser malfunction to have in that situation. What battery? Yeah, battery split. That makes my sense. My arcane aura boosted it and then rolled the armor, getting <laughs> eaten by it. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Okay. Um. um oh, you lost your no! I didn't. I forgot your arcane aura does that. Um. Yeah. yeah. I want to keep this Inquisitor Strike. Blind Rage, huh? That's fun. Freeze. Aha! Uh -huh. Ugh. That's a lot of acid down. I mean, if you can lure him into his own acid, he basically just dies. Hehehe. <laughs> Just don't get close to him. He's got blind rage on. Yeah, so he probably does like a ton of damage. I know it I'm might not be... seem fun, but I'm pretty sure the optimal thing here is to yeah. let me 1v1 him. <laughs> yeah, no, it's fine. I just want this to be over with, honestly. At least he's not a monkey. Fair. Let's be honest. Yeah, this is way that. This is way more fun. All of us I had forgotten what dealing with other monsters was like at this point. <laughs> True. And, and like He's to he's way more fun than dealing with monkeys. There's like six fights of nothing but monkeys. <laughs> it's God, it's been so miserable. <laughs> Even the gnomes were more fun than these things. The gnomes were a lot more fun. Uh, 
And then I guess just acid spray him. Yeah? Yeah. Hmm? This is risky, doing? but as long as he doesn't have... Oh. Acid spray is only two range, so I need to get a little bit closer. No. Oh, shame. Ah, uh, it's unfortunate. Ah, but he stepped into... To, he stepped in to make it so he's Even on three. Even more acid. Yeah. You know what? Change your plans. All in. Let's go. <laughs> Wait, with Inquisitor Strike? Beat a, yeah, beat him up. <laughs> oh my god. Wait. Kick his Tushi. I can actually move here. <laughs> Done, Sincotte. Oh, but I want to see the acid get him. All right. Yeah, pass then. Well, no, Inquisitor Strike is going to do like so much damage. Mm, yeah, all right. Ba boom. <laughs> he had two attacks in AM2. Oh, what were no! they? I didn't get a chance to see them before it was over. Me neither. They were green, though. Scary. Phone almost juiceless. <laughs> juiceless! This is juiceless to me! You are faded. You are faded. I'm just letting you know. Sorry. If you notice how bad the CPU is at playing the game, imagine how much harder that monkey adventure would be if Gary was trying. Oh my god. I don't want to. <laughs> yeah. I don't wanna. You can't make me. <laughs> you have no power over me. Fair enough. Uh, <laughs> it just made me work harder than you. That's such a good line. Anyway, ignore that. Phone almost useless. How are you guys doing? We're doing great. We're doing wonderful. My we brain. Beat the monkeys. We We're eat the free monkeys. from the monkey menace. We're free. We're free. Just as Never Vi again. As Viola Probably. always says, we're free. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. My brain is so fried from all of that. We need to do like a palate cleanser adventure, which is probably not going to happen because we're still high level. Yeah. Um. Okay. Collect the loot. Let's see what happens. Wait. 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 Ah! Oh, I gotta go. I gotta go pull up the old. Let me see. Hold on. Wait, can I just scroll up to see it again? What the? I can. The war monkeys are defeated and you've saved Card Huntry once again. However, you have many unanswered questions. What was a hell mantis doing here? Is that this a further sign of demonic subversion? I just got an achievement for finishing the campaign cooperatively. That was not the final mission of the campaign. Um... And also, you said that you had already got that achievement. Yeah. So why I did, did I just now get it? That's a good question. Yeah, I already have the I already have the campaign. Well, I don't know if I have the cooperatively one, but I do know that I already have the achievement for completing the campaign. How strange. Yeah, completing the campaign. Doesn't look like I got any new achievements, so. Okay, so I got two silvery nuggets that I can sell. I got a militiaman's pike, which is two impaling stabs, two puncturing stabs, and two stabs. Which that sounds really good. It is. It's a gold and a blue, though. So it's impaling still impaling pretty... stab is absurdly strong. It so. is. It is. It's very, very good. Quick foot robes, arcane aura, rushing aura, rushing aura. Those are fun. Oh, I got that too, actually. It's funny. You know, I can't help but like the impaling stab art is so goofy. I can't help but like feel it. Feel like that. Every time I look at it, it kind of feels like that sword is like a spine from his back. Like this is just him. Like he's just uh, hunched. Yeah. He's just hunched over. He's like, <laughs> he's like, this is me. me. I've always seen it as a spear tip going through him. I always thought it was a sword, which is it why it looks I... like it. Because if you look at the base, it goes way too deep to be yeah. a spear tip. So I guess it's just a really, but... really long spear. <laughs> which is, I mean, a thing that they have like long spears that have really. <laughs> but it's. It's probably meant to be a sword in the picture. Really long blades. Yeah, maybe. <clears throat> I leveled up too, so which means I got a third gold power token that I can't nice. really use. Um, because all my build right now is hindering. Sorry, hinging. <laughs> oh, we didn't get any new adventures, so we got to go to into the Black Forest. Yep, we're almost done. With with the campaign. Yeah. There's only. Let's see. I think there's only five more adventures in the campaign. Uh, oh. Well, then we can do, like, treasure, treasure hunt. Yeah, there's also, like, the side campaigns, like Mitternacht and the mm -hmm. I'm tempted and space one. Yeah, but also, there is another secret. 
that we will unlock when we beat the campaign. So, <gasps> is it just a that. worse version of Caverns of Chaos? No. <laughs> Thank goodness. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Sending video to of. Oh, my I dog thought, couldn't I, turn a fly. Man, this damn Muxedo's trying to buy cocoa, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. <laughs> the fun <laughs> never ends. Just the one clip, the one bit I got of it was him talking about the mosquito. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay, so I'll watch that later. I uh, don't remember literally anything about this adventure. About to, Into the Black Forest, really? Correct. The fun never Nothing. ends! Nothing Plus, a little bit. maybe, just maybe, we'll find a way to do some of the side adventures. Maybe it'll happen. Yeah. Who knows? Maybe we don't have to stop doing this. Because I definitely don't want... <laughs> like, we definitely can't end it with the monkeys. I don't want that no to be way, the end of this. No sure. And of, of the, course, even we're doing at stream. least one more stream while we to finish the campaign. Yeah, off, yeah, so. I, yeah. We can't, we can't finish it this stream because I, I am already yeah, so way too much. It's, I am already so tired. <laughs> like the yeah, monkeys. And it took us. We we actually did like a new record for number of uh, adventures completed, considering oh, how hard the adventures are. True, because we like, got I, we, riddle like, secrets. On our first stream, we did like four or five, mm. but they yeah, were easy they're... adventures. These mm -hmm. were hard, and we still managed to do four of them. They so. are, yeah. So we've already completed four. We'll probably get to do. I I'd say we'll we're, we'll probably get to do the fifth one too. I mean, obviously, oh, we're not going to fifth one. Huh? We're going to do into the Black Forest. I think so. Um, okay. I don't know. I am very tired. But yeah, that the what be... you were talking made me think that maybe we were calling it here. Yeah, I don't know. Let's let's look at the title page for it. All right. And see if you remember it, whether or not it would be a good palate cleanser for the last 30 minutes, or if it is somehow doubtful, going to be worse <laughs> than the monkeys. <laughs> Probably not worse than the monkeys. I too am tired. Fair enough. Life for oh, no intro from oh, right, because we haven't gone in yet. Only one thing can save the dying Baroness Heartwood from the malevolent oaken shade, King of the Black Forest. Quest into the shadowed wood, made perilous by the malign walking trees that make it their home. No. <laughs> no yeah, more. we're doing walking trees again. No more trees. We can call it here for today. What'd you say? We can call it here for today. Oh no. Made perilous by the malign walking trees that make it their home. Somewhere amidst the expanses of beech and maple trees is a square mile of oaks. It is there you will find King Oak and Shade. No. Well, hold on. There's one more Four thing we can do battles. if we want a palette cleanser. Four tree battles. What, wait, what is it? What are you thinking? Twilight Nice Pass. It goes back down to level nine, so it's going to be a lot easier. Oh, Twilight and East Pass. Yeah. Let's go do it. How many fights are in here? Hark. Don't know. Three. I checked. Hark. Remember Lord Stafford? He had a son, apparently. Oh, don't worry. The son's not mad at you. In fact, he's happy to be the new Lord Stafford. Anyway, it looks like he has a job for you. A sculptor he patron patronizes in the town of East Pass has gone missing. The whole town has gone silent. In fact, no merchants, couriers, nothing. Spooky. Lord Stafford II will reward you generously for investigating this oddity. Interesting. Mm -hmm. East Pass conspiracy adventure. Ooh. Shopping. Oh, no shopping. Nope, no shopping. Sorry. <laughs> <clears throat> New Lord Stafford. Oh, it's an hour and twenty minutes before the uh, store shifts over, so we're probably we're not gonna get to see the new daily deal in oh, the stream. Oh, I see. Okay. Probably. Let's see. <clears throat> East Pass is a quiet settlement on the edge of Stafford's domain, home to farmers and artists. Recently, traders and messengers headed to the town have gone missing. Lord Stafford, the second son of the late Lord Stafford, hires you to investigate the danger. The reward is great. But what is truly happening in East Pass? Looks like harpies. If I had mm -hmm. to guess. Yeah, it looks like harpies. One of your party is above the level range for this adventure and won't get any experience. The level will temporarily be reduced to 11. Whoops, wrong button. Let's begin yeah, the adventure. You could switch over to one of your lower level people, or we could just team with our team and you can have your bonus. Oh. Your 
Well, I could go to a lower account. level person. I could just go with my bonus stuff. Hmm. Hey, one or more of your heroes is too high level for this adventure. I'm going to have to temporarily reduce their level. Don't worry, they'll go back up after the adventure. I'm afraid you might have to change some equipment due to their reduced level, though. Okay. I have a level... S my highest other level is level 7. This is a level 9 adventure. That's yeah. potentially really dangerous. I've got good equipment, but I don't know if it's a good idea to try to use either. Yeah, let's just level down my, my uh, Flupeldorp. All right. All right, so easy fix already is the helmet back to norm, back to the original. Then I don't have any gold power tokens, so I'm going to need to switch back to... I'm going to need to switch back to the cursed gum shoes. And I need to go a one power token for the whirling flail. So what can I do for a one power token? I used, to, I used to use the Manhunter. I think Manhunter is pretty good for this. Let's go Manhunter. Or the Trogsbane. Trogsbane was always pretty good, but I'm not really liking the look of it anymore. Manhunter seems better. Let's go. Sorry, I need to get my team. So oh, I'm sorry. Team. I wasn't. I didn't mean it like that. It was supposed to be just like a like a let's go kind of, but it okay. sounded pushy. Well, fun better. You beat the monkeys and you'll have the power of explosions. True. Good night, I'm y'all. Phone battery low. Don't worry. Enjoy your juiceless phone. Mm -hmm. I hope you have a nice, a nice time at bed. It was great having you. Oh, approach. Let's see. Approaching East Pass, you immediately notice that the surrounding farm that is in disarray. Overturned. Holy. Sorry, I just found a weapon that I have that is, seems completely cracked. Ooh. Let me finish the intro and then we can talk about it. Overturned equipment is covered in cobwebs and food rots on the vine. Worst of all, you feel telltale tremors beneath your feet before a pack of vile burrowing on kegs burst from the ground. <clears throat> before a pack of vile burrowing on kegs burst from the ground. Not on kegs. <laughs> What's an on keg? On kegs are like giant. Uh, I believe they are men with beetle heads. Hmm. Or they are just giant beetles. They're beetles in some way. They're they're big beetle beetle somethings. On keg these it doesn't work that way. <laughs> Let me hold on. It doesn't work that way. <laughs> Call back. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Let's see. <laughs> We're waiting for Bofi, getting farther away, <laughs> getting farther away, and waiting for Bofi. Yeah, just give me, I need to find three more items to put on. Yeah, no worries. This is a significant, like, this is a significant downgrade, so I totally understand. Yeah, I had to make a, this is a blast from the past type build. I had to go way back to the curse gum shoes. To be fair, I was honestly kind of tempted to use the, um, to use that other, the old helmet anyway. The, the other Mempo helmet. I oh, have, yeah. I'm using the old <laughs> Mempo helmet. Mm. Because I was planning on switching back to that probably anyway, because of the amnesia, but, or because it's just like, gives me more tokens. Excuse me. Actually, no, I wasn't, because I don't have anything that needs, like, a gold power token. Uh, oh, wait. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. I actually could do, uh, there was a, I think there's a second weapon I could use now. Doesn't matter now, though. That'll be, that'll be important tomorrow, or next week. That'll be important next week. do <laughs> There we go. This is what I was looking for. I have to steal that from you for a little bit. Then I will 
for my last trick using Pride and Fruit. <gasps> yeah. Lycanthropy. <gasps> Lycanthropy! If you ever need a warrior slot item that doesn't need a power token, there's some pretty good ly lycanthropies that don't need power tokens. <laughs> Neat! This one's Lycanthropy, Nightling, and uh, Charge. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest, I'm a little... I am both excited and hesitant for Castle Midernox because... <laughs> I know you had so much trouble with a three-person party. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's hard. Ugh. Um, I'm ready now. Oh, sorry, I should have pressed battle to begin it's with. All right. Oh, this looks simple. Encounter. The farmland the outside East Pass trembles with the activity of burrowing on kegs. <laughs> Yikes, watch out if I like these things are vicious. Uh oh. Anton, Anton, Anton. What did you say? An Anthony Ban their names. No. Anthony, 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 and Anthony, and then and then Antoine, Bantoine, and Cantoine. I love this. I absolutely love this. This is hey, so we're funny. We're fiery stab twins. We are fiery stab twins. I don't know what to expect from these guys. Anthony and Dantoine, Yeah. Yeah, I love this elf warrior skin. It does not appear to be in the shop anymore. I don't oh. know where I got it from in the first place, but shame. I think it's, I guess I, it's like a limited edition. Thing. If I remember I correctly, I believe I saw it in the um the um the pack store. I believe it's it's a free. I believe it's a free skin you get when you buy one of the um expansions or the treasure hunts or something. I think it was because I'm pretty sure I bought this with my pizza for it as because it's the only skin that's accounted. Gantony and Stanley, ha! <laughs> you did it. You or you had. surprised me, huh? <laughs> uh, or had anyway. I got I bought more recently. But... Bum bum trip. I don't like how slow these guys are. Since you're part of a team, you can click next player to let your teammate play. Once everyone in your team has had an opportunity to play, you can either pass or end round. Yeah, Gary, I know. We've been doing this for a long time. <laughs> that's the best. I thought you were getting on to me. The very, 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 like, fraction of a second, I thought you were getting on to me. I was like, <laughs> no, Gary decided to give me a tutorial on how co-op works for some reason. What the... Okay, do these guys yeah, have like Gary, we've been doing this all day. <laughs> do these guys just have a card that kills an enemy next to them? Like what is going on? They I know this is girl. level I know this is level nine, oh. but Whoa. Oh, oh, suddenly. Okay. The Onkag nymph disappears into the ice before emerging nearby in a spray of rubble and loose dirt. Oh. That makes sense. Anthony Burroughs. Teleport. Anthony Anthony the... Burroughs. And it's a free action. Huh. That's a little terrifying. I'm gonna let you handle that. What does forest foraging say? Forest foraging? Oh, 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 oh. It says, number one, nothing but bark. Wait, can I not? I thought I could zoom in. Okay, so you find one, uh, one, uh, one is nothing but bark, then you have a pitfall trap, cursed remains, Sour, sour limes, a bubbling brook, cherry berries, suspicious mushrooms, volcano quail, potion, poison, poison oak patch, where, where rabbit, where rabbit, abandoned iron rations, and he hex bear den, hawk bear, hawk bear den, oh, like an owl bear, gotcha. Oh, hello. Um, you want to finish him off? You can't finish him off. I'm going to fire stab this one then. Sorry. Um, I think this is Cantuan. Sorry, Bantuan. Sorry, Bantuan. Oh. Come and get some, Canthony. What'd you say? Come and get some, Canthony. <laughs> I'm going to be perfectly honest. I'm not... 
Extr I, this is a good palate cleanser. This is a good yeah, palate cleanser. I'm not cleanser. particularly intimidated. Not, yeah, I was gonna say, I'm not particularly threatened by these guys. <laughs> <laughs> now, it could get really bad, but I mean, we have so much health, and we're both warriors, and these guys just do not do much. Hogbear dead, and it has the Queen of Spiders in it! Oh no! God, this is such a breath of fresh air. This was a good idea. Thank you, bro. This was a great <laughs> idea. Yes, it turns out it was. It, it could have been bad, but it, it turned been. out to not be. Yeah. Yes. It reminds Whoa. me that this game is actually fun. <laughs> 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 like, I was starting to forget why I liked this game in the first place. It says here that oncakes don't really have stomachs, so they secrete digestive acids from their mandibles. Well, then where do they... I think I'd block that, because that would have hurt. Acid bite. Oh! Yeah. It's also been confirmed there are talks with Alex Hirsch about a continue. No way! Yeah, where did Queen of Spiders even cut? Regular show is back, which is great. That's also been confirmed. Okay, fun. I didn't realize regular show had stopped. Let's see. Um, I'm going to arcane feedback. Antoine. I'm just gonna handle I'm just gonna handle the the Antoines and you can handle the Anthony's. Alright. Seems like it's really not that big of a deal to do so. Ta-da! Excuse me. Burro. Oh, I'm sorry. Didn't even realize it was my turn. The Queen of Spiders came for me showing how versatile surprise is. Oh, did it? <laughs> Wait, I think I do remember now because I was talking about the whole um, glass of spur, the whole like spiders. Oh, spiders? What do you mean? It's like, what an excellent choice, sir. Let's see. We offer cheese. We offer cheese, wine, cake, spiders, pie, spiders. What an excellent choice, sir! One round of spiders coming right up. Uh. Mad dog. It's not as good as Sally's mad dog, but still pretty good. Yeah, we didn't draw like any attacks this turn. Yeah. Uh. You sly dog, you got me monologuing! <laughs> got the clip? Oh, perfect. <gasps> Phineas and Ferb as well, huh? Just because there are talks about it doesn't mean it will happen. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course, I'm aware. I mean, Phineas and Ferb got like a Milo, uh, Milo Murphy's Law is kind of like a sequel series to it, so. Right, I heard it, I heard that Milo Murphy's Law wasn't as well received, which I guess is not hard to do because Phineas well, I've heard it was really good you did okay I heard yeah. I don't know where I heard I don't know where I heard it was bad then from I um I, I should watch it someday then ah! burst sound effect is so loud oh. mighty charge ah uh, you're trying to set up something there yeah. oh that's unfortunate oh that is that is real rough. It's fine. I'm not particularly intimidated still. Same. I'm feeling good. I'm having a great time. Why did you just burrow where you were? <laughs> Ooh, what should I discard? I have no idea. It really matters a lot. Oh, the rest is gone too. Oh, oh no. no! What happened? Whoa, tricky stab. That's cool. Yeah. I'm not drawing a lot of good... I'm not drawing a lot of good attacks. Or a lot of attacks at all. I should be. He's vulnerable, so... True. On him. Need help over there? <laughs> Don't make me ban you. <laughs> Um, we were having such a good time. Why do you have to go and ruin it? 
I do appreciate the help, though. The help. <laughs> Bro, I has been banned. <laughs> Did the clipling show up on my end? Uh, no. Where did you put it? Found any memes? No. <laughs> oh, I get it. I get it. That's great. <laughs> there's a there's a board posted something in funny memes. It's how to be polite and show respect. In the old days of feudal Japan, a samurai warrior would shout and underneath you are trying to view flash content, but you have no <laughs> flash plug in it. <laughs> <laughs> That's so great. I get why it happened too. That's what makes it even better. Uh, it's so silly. It is. Ah, uh, you know what? Go for it. Let me finish him off. Wait, no, this is mine. Hold on, wait. This is my guy. I'm gonna finish him off. No. <laughs> Yeah, pass it to me, pass it to me! Please. Thank you. Ka Bram! <laughs> the Queen of Spiders, they did. Uh, An unexpected treasure chest! <gasps> Queen Double Kill! <gasps> the Queen of Spiders! <laughs> the Queen of Spiders. <laughs> the Queen of Spiders. Oh right, I remember, and then I that's when I mentioned the that's when I mentioned the spiders, um, the ordering spiders Ugh. thing in response to your queen of spiders thing. The knights of unity are pulling their punches, I see. Your foes thus far would be classified best as trash mobs. Yes, and I like it that way, Melvin! Shut up! Oh. It says in the Game Master's Guide to East Pass that the goal is to ease the player into the new adventure. Oh, he did like a hoo but he said definitely seems confident. It says in the Game Master's Guide to East Pass that the goal is to ease the player into the new adventures. Oh. Blue Manchu provided the same frames of reasoning when they made all their low-level adventures easier. What do you mean? They're low-level adventures. Oh man. They're level 1 and I can't throw 37 blue dragons at them? <sighs> what is- How am I supposed to have fun? The DM is mm -hmm. supposed to have fun too. Is this a <laughs> roguelite deck builder? No, it's actually got a story. Um, and, uh, yeah, it's it's not a roguelite. It's not a roguelite, but it um, is a deck builder. It is a deck builder, sort mm -hmm. of. It's you, you use items that have cards yeah. attached to them instead of individual cards. Here, hello, Siloon. Let's show you. Mm -hmm. Today's players um, are coddled. They know nothing of the obstacles we overcame in the early days. Uh, yes, Melvin, whatever you say. Now uh, I can give, now can I give Lo-Fi Lady their loot? To, yes. <laughs> Hold on. Ah, but it's still a deck. It has a card in its name. It's not a roguelite deck builder. Interesting. It's still a deck builder. But I think Kaitos is a non-roguelite deck builder. Ah, is yeah, it? Yeah, it's, um, it's more like a... It's more like a standard can you, RPG. Can you let me... I, I, wanna, I, wanna, I want to give you a visual aid for your explanation, but I gotta get through the aftermath real quick. Give me a second. Never. Come on. You gotta cooperate. We're almost through. We got this. <laughs> All is silent as you wipe the Himalim from your blades in the weed-invested fields and turn your attention townward. The utter absence of farmers suggests it might be oh it might okay to salvage a few useful trinkets from the occasional farmhouse you pass. Okay, so this is how it works, Silun. It's a deck builder, but your the items in your deck are provided by items that go in various slots that you up that you unlock as you level up. So for instance, this manhunter provides me with this manhunter provides me with all of these subtle parries, standing th startling strikes, lunging thrusts, stuff like that. And uh, if I don't have a weapon, you can see that it provides just a bunch of really awful trash cards. So you want to equip something. So you start it, so, uh, and you collect a lot of loot. There's lots of stuff that you get access to. Different skills. Also, your race determines a certain type of skill that you can, un that you can equip that has certain uh, ideas to it. Yeah, it's a super cool game. I'm going to see what loot I got. All right. Sorry, bro. You can. I thought you were going to keep talking. Sorry. Right, no, no, that's going. it. Mm -hmm. I got the gorilla skin mask, which I remember that being pretty decent. Thick hide I armor, think. reliable hide armor, quick reactions. Yeah, that's pretty good. It's blue, it's only a blue. Kind of has quick reactions is nice. Yeah, and there's only a blue power token too, so that's not bad, I'd say. 
Oval shield, two desperate blocks, and a super. Oh, I just don't like superstitious. I just yeah. really don't like superstitious. Especially uh, not for a blue power token. There's so many good shields for a blue power token. There are no joke. If it was a, I mean, that would be that would be pretty okay for a non blue a non power token shield. Yeah, you arrive I in might be willing to tolerate it if it had no power token attached. Mm -hmm. Agreed. You arrive in town. The streets are empty. Roll a listening check. What's that? You got a little fire lady? One? Okay, let's see. Quiet. Two. Quiet. I don't understand why this is even an option. We both know there's going to be a battle. <laughs> <laughs> the town of East Pass appears as abandoned as its farms. They're searching for clues near the general store when a blood-curdling war cry emanates from the rooftops. In a flutter of feathers and flash of talons, a pack of harpies descends upon you. Before you can beat them off, the ground quakes with the mighty bulk of the Onkeg's mother, intent on revenge for the death of her brood. Um, it's supposed to be you, I guess. <laughs> ah, you're so mean. Here we go. Harpies. What? Harpies have taken up residence in the abandoned buildings of East Pass, and they don't seem friendly. Okay, I was. they're all separate groups, though. Well, no, they're not. They're two separate groups. So, the doors have health? Why are there doors... Yeah, doors are an enemy type that's showing up in um, the Melva... Um, Morvan adventure. <gasps> right! They kept this out of Morvan's room. Hostile well, doors! Three buildings that just don't have anything in them, but are still closed by doors. Weird. Well, you think we were playing the Case of Madness or whatever it's called. Mm -hmm. I guess uh, it's possible. Maybe the Harpies are programmed to run into those <gasps> or something. Oh my god. The Harpy Queen is also is named Anton. What the? Well, not Antoine. Anton. Oh, the the Ankeg Queen, you mean? Yeah. What did they say? You said Harpy Queen. I'm uh, like, oh, the Harpies are also named Anton. <laughs> that would be great. Now the Harpies are uh, Floriara, Elephas, Illinor, Illinor, and Gwendolyn. These are good names for Harpies. Okay, I'm going to. I'm a little unnerved that they only have 10 HP, but again. It's probably fine because this is a lower level adventure. If it was a, like yeah. a real, if it was a, if we had gone to the monkeys area and something had ten HP, I would have been <laughs> really nervous. Yeah. Um, I'm just gonna kind of move in a little. Found a fright. Drop They're guard. They have so many. They're ten that HP enemies with fright and drop guard. Mass immovable. That's fun. Mass immovable. Oh, that's. No, oh, that's great. Okay. Um. Well, I mean, if you can't attack. <laughs> ba bomb. Wait, why did that not do damage? It wasn't charge. It was you should have used brutal charge. You were a straight line away from angle. him. No, I wasn't. I was. I was off diagonally. Oh. Hmm. I wouldn't have ended up hitting them with it. Okay. Um, I'm going to step in for a... No, I'm not, because I need to... Yeah, I guess I am. I'm going to step in and hit you. Shifty step. Oh! Imagine the infrastructure you could build if you could tame one of these things! Anton Tunnel. Did you hear it? When the little terrain appeared, it was like doing little bells. It was like... Doo, 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 doo. That was super cute. Oh, yeah, there we go. I, I was still on the... Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What if I almost said Melvin? No, uh, well, yeah, because it was, well, yeah, it was a mistake. Simple mistake, because it wasn't Melvin, it was Morvin. We all know it yeah. wasn't Melvin, it was Morvin. But I wanted to charge there. <gasps> I'm sorry, that makes a lot more sense. I should have, <laughs> I should have, uh, I'm sorry. Uh oh, I hope you have you good armor, good armor. Little lady. These harpies can be really annoying. Step four, fly after attacking. Move three, free move. What? Well, okay, yeah, I see. Oh, that's, that's, that's pretty annoying. really annoying. <laughs> 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 well, I'm glad these things don't. These things are and like. That is why the doors are there. Is I guess they're meant to take cover behind the doors after hitting you. Maybe. Oh, yeah, more of a definitely. I'm yeah, not definitely. Sure. I'm really it feels difficult to convince the AI to do it properly. <laughs> mm -hmm. Honestly, I'm just really glad these things are built like tissue paper. 
Because otherwise they would be really obnoxious. And it yeah. only does like three damage too. Magical move fight. If Morphin isn't based on based on Melvin at all, say nothing. Well, you heard her. Mm -hmm. Clear as day. She said something. So, unfortunately, I guess Morvin is based on Melvin. Weird. <laughs> Let's see, I'm going to- oh, Fiery Stab is such a way- well, I could Arcane Feedback. I could double Arcane Feedback. Yeah. Oh! Ooh! Spoiled for choice! One of them's burning and the other one is not. I have no choice at all! <laughs> It says here that full-grown on kegs can spray their acid up to 25 feet away. <laughs> That's not so impressive. With the power of the Postal Service, Melvin's vitriol can reach Poland. <laughs> That's amazing. Nice. That's like the best line in the whole game. Um, <laughs> let's see. I'm going to run over and fiery stab her. You can do the same. Well, I mean, you could. <laughs> in a certain branching timeline. Yeah, uh, I think I'm just going to... I'm a little nervous about the Onkai Queen, but honestly, I think we've got this. This is just, I'm, I am getting a little overconfident for sure, but it just feels so nice. It yeah. just feels so nice. I, those monkeys were the worst thing ever conceived. Yeah. God, I like I didn't realize how bad it was until I, I realized it felt like there was a weight on my chest the whole time we were playing that fight. God. Hey. Yay! Oh wait. Yay? What or Not hey? Hey. Hey, what about? They, they took my block. They no, warped no, 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 no. me. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't realize. Uh oh! Resistant hide! <laughs> <laughs> nope. What in Scabrous? Wait, Scabrous skin. Let me look at that. What was that all about? No. Oh, three plus like armor, three keep. Armor. Oh, it is. Yeah. Okay, so. Yeah. Faster than me before this harpy gets away. Sure, sure. sure. Sure, sure, sure. The best line yeah, in the like whole that. game. Gets away like that. <laughs> yeah, sorry. No, I mean, I got her. I got the hit in, so. Oh, right. And the fiery stab does what? Three damage? Okay. Um. All you gotta do is shifty stab her for her to go down. But. All right. Yeah, you should probably get out of there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I just needed to make sure that she would die next turn to the burning. She won't. She's immune to fire damage. Oh, because of resistant hide. Dang it. Yeah. Right, because she blocked the scabber skin first. Man. Oh, no, it would have. She just failed to roll. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Master of Strategy Plus from, like. Hold on. Oh, isometric battle. I want to make a Magic the Gathering deck, but with roguelike deck builder cards added in it. Oh, that would be fun. Like, give anyone Magic the Gathering, give anyone's Magic the Gathering deck, Master of Strategy Plus from Slay the Spire, zero mana, draw four cards! <laughs> yes, please! That sounds like such a goofy time. Goodbye! So yeah, I mean, I guess we were actually close to dying on that one, but it certainly didn't really feel like it. Yeah. Um, onward! Oh no. So this adventure is supposed to be a mystery, but there aren't many clues. The townsfolk are just missing. With your assailant's dispatch, you resume your invent- That's kind of... Actually, I think I should redo that delivery. So this adventure is supposed to be a mystery, but there aren't many clues. The townsfolk are just missing. Hold on. I played the dun 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 thing. Nah. Give me, give me, give me some bones! Uh, with your assailant's dispatch, you resume your investigation. The general store has no clues as to where the townsfolk might be, but you were able to help yourself to some supplies. 
Wherever the inhabitants of East Pass are, they do not pack all of their belongings. Uh-oh, this is creepy. What's going on? Monsters have moved in. Nobody's here. Bruiser. <laughs> Bruiser and two simple bashes and then two runs and a rushing aura. Oh, well, that's actually pretty good because it's got bashes in with the bruiser. So the print is bashing. That's I mean, that's I've seen worse. All right. Now that our energy is waning, let's do one last one last fight and see if we can do this. Brophy there. Yes. Cool. <sighs> As you approach the central plaza, you finally smell the scent of death. You know you are not alone. The beating of harpy wings betrays them, but something more sinister is here. Carrion scuttlers. These horrible scavengers infest mass graves, but you have yet to find more than a couple bodies. They approach with uncharacteristic vim, starving and ready to prey on your living flesh. Nah. I nah, win. it's fine. <laughs> it is not by my hand that I am once again given oh. flesh. Sorry about the carrion scuttlers, love my lady. They're a reprint from Secret of the Elder Mind, and that's a level 18 adventure! I wanted to swap them out for something more level appropriate, like cockroaches. Uh, and Melvin says we have to play the adventure by the book in order to properly judge the Knights of Unity. So this is a new... Oh. Oh, those do, those do look tough. Dun dun. Oh. Wow, that's a really unfortunate You have dropped guard? Yeah. It's worth it because the shield also has two shield blocks on it. Mm, gotcha. It is not by my oh, g gave me gave me some bones. Right, it's from the the bones thing that I posted in funny meme. It but, is not by my flesh it, that I am once again given hand. <laughs> <laughs> Where do all these hands come from? It is not by my bones that I am once again given bones. <laughs> All right, I guess we team up on this one first. Yeah, it seems like a pretty good idea. And then where's the other one? Oh, in inside. Worm oh! and Blippy. Look at him from behind. You've got big old eyes. <laughs> <laughs> They're so cute. What are they named? Glurm and you said Glurm and Glippy. Oh, I love Glurm and Glippy. Are you bone certified? I am definitely bone certified. Absolutely. Um, I'm going to just arcane feedback it. Attack soldier yourself, by the way, because I'm wimpy. <laughs> right. Good point. Well, that's interesting. Oh, so they can't. He also drew a bane cards. Made him discard everything. Oh. <laughs> Okay, so there are two carrion scuttlers. Yeah, the red one is not doing great. Glip Glurm's not doing great, but Glippy is still hale and hearty. Um. Yeah, Glurm drew the bane that makes you discard all your attacks. Gotcha. Oh, thank you, Glurm. Very snap time. Oh. Yeah, you can do that too. Jesus, strong bludgeon at level nine, eleven, level eleven. Yeah. yeah. Ow. Oh, look at him! He's like, <laughs> <laughs> I love his face. Ugrand Ford in a nasty poison bite. <laughs> oh, here they come. <laughs> he owes me. I think that's just dead. Yay! Goodbye, Glurm! Have a nice day! I just leave. I, I escort Glurm out of the building. That's what happened. <laughs> Glurm goes on his day. He's He was all angry and he hadn't eaten in a while, so I gave him a big old raw steak and then just escorted him out of the building. It looks more like he ate my legs, judging by Verilic poison. <laughs> well, I mean, sometimes he nibbles. Sometimes he nibbles. It's I fine. Nine damage off of this poison card. It's totally fine. He doesn't know his own strength. But... Did he? Oh, I had Mempo. I'm like, did she just Mempo me? <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine a level nine adventure where the enemies have Mempo? Let's see. Um. <sighs> oh no. Well, all right. 
Did you hear that? I think it was what? supposed to be a bird. There was like a sound effect. It was like, I can't even do it. It was like this high pitched like scream call. It sounded like it could either be a call or just a strange choice. I'll let you have this one then. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, that's Glitch. right. Glipple is Glippy still in the building. Uh, pass it to you. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Gotta get rid of these harpies. God, this is so nice. I missed this it's level. Free. Oh no, Glippy's feet's free. Yeah. Probably shouldn't have done that. But... I'm like, why does he have wood armor? <laughs> it was the door. <laughs> Why? Why is the worm made of wood? <laughs> why is the worm made of wood? He's like Jar Jar Pink. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> Incorrect. <laughs> so intense. It's hard to it's hard to make out, but when it happens, it's like so scary. I I appreciate. Oh. Uh oh. I can be you got in the way of my mighty charge. Here, let me see if I can lure Glippy away. Nope. I don't want to do any of this. Well, attach frenzy to keep. Oh, wait. If you end this move, Jason, turn to me. Attach it to yourself. Duration two. Hmm. That's pretty cool. Yeah. That was a good... No! Oh. Who had war cry? The harpies. I just got war cried! Yeah, they did that to me last fight, too. Oof, I didn't even notice. It's fine, I was probably gonna have to discard them anyway. Purely for loaf to view, we'll delete. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh, you're in trouble. <laughs> Wait, hold on, is this the... I don't think you can delete Twitch clips, can you? You can. No, oh, no. Okay. Well, all right. Did you hear that? I think it what? was supposed to be a bird. There was like a sound effect. It was like, I can't even do it. It was like this high pitched like scream call. It sounded like it could either be a call or just a. OK, so it did catch the scream call. Yeah, it's really it. Okay, so it was audible. Thank you. I appreciate that. Okay, sorry. I'll go back. Oh, no, Glippy! Um, it's like I'm reading a magazine. <laughs> like, I'm checking my phone. <laughs> you can't. I'm like, I'm checking my phone. I was like, oh, thank you, everybody. Whoa! Worm! Hey, buddy! Um, <laughs> God, so funny. <laughs> I guess it's supposed to be a scream because there's horses whinnying, too. <laughs> You are almost dead. Yes. Maybe I need to take this a little bit more seriously. Yeah, that's not a call. That's definitely somebody screaming. Yeah, oh um, no, this one! <laughs> Welcome to the club. Glippy ate your legs. No, <laughs> my legs! Glippy! No biting! A little late for that. Ugh. Glippy! Gonna I'm gonna die. You're dead, actually. You're already dead. Wait, I am? Yeah. No way. You got way too much poison on you. What do you mean? I only have six poison. You have five health left, and you're going to take nine more poison damage before those cards roar off. Well, yeah, but I can at least do some damage, I guess. You're right. I think we lost. Yeah, I got too confident. The, the I should have been more careful around Glippy. 
This is what you get when you hear, these are from a level 18 adventure and treat them like pets. <laughs> they are pets! <laughs> They're my babies! <laughs> Thank you. Okay, good, 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 good. You're doing great, thank you. <laughs> Focus your efforts on Glippy. <laughs> oh, okay. Probably a good idea, sorry. Um. Oh, nice. He, no, has no, yeah. he has no attacks, he has no cards. He has no cards. Everything's fine. Um, should I go for Glippy or the Harpy? I'm yes, gonna go for Glippy. I, that was not a yes or no question. <laughs> uh, let's see. Bye -bye. See you later. <laughs> bye bye. I'm actually super. I think I I know you can do this. But it's gonna be rough. Oh. oh. <gasps> <Gah>! <laughs> Don't scare me like that. The harpy can hit you at a distance, Glippy cannot. Yeah, but the harpy can't do more than three damage. My oh, monster's really? hide makes me immune. Okay. God, you're scaring me. <laughs> okay, I didn't realize she was burned. Bum bum. Come get me, Glippy. Come on, Glippy. You need to leave. Why did you not use fainting? Oh. Right. The one range. Goodbye, Glippy. We did it! Okay, yeah, I'm sorry. I got a little caught. I got a little overconfident there. I was starting to... I was starting to get... I was starting to feel nice and relaxed, and I just wasn't thinking about the fact that they would probably make it a little difficult, at least. Adventure complete! Yay! Wow, you did it! The scavengers in Hamming East Pass have been vanquished. Now let's see here. In a modest abode off the central plaza, you finally encounter another person. He's a middle-aged man, a sculptor by trade, his back bent by years of his craft. Adventurer! Oh, praise and oaks! Help is finally here! And he's got his thumb on the... That's awesome. The man grovels at your feet and begs you to save his fellow townsfolk. They just left one day. Had at least wordlessly. I don't know why and I don't know how I managed to stay. The man is in fact the sculptor Lord Stafford II mentioned. He's barely lucid and offers no further clues. Ooh. No, oh, surviving alone in this town overrun with harpies and oncakes seems to have taken a toll on him. Yeah, I would imagine it would. I don't know how he did that, unless he's, like, actually a traitor of some kind. He's meant to lead he can people. Actually... So this is interesting. That sculptor icon, there is, uh, the, the, um, the card shifting block. Yeah. After you use it, it attaches a random form card to you, and one of the forms is sculptor form, and it's that guy. <laughs> what the? <laughs> and it that gives guy. you a bunch of like geomancy <laughs> abilities, like turning stuff into difficult terrain and things like that. That's awesome. I love the way you said that too. With the last of these passes, invasive scavengers dispatched. You turn the town upside down for clues. Hundreds of townsfolk seem to have vanished into thin air until one among you notices tracks heading further east. The search for the townsfolk will lead you on into the untamed wilds beyond Stafford's domain. But first, you take everything of value lest more harpies come to loot the town. <laughs> Yay! We did it! We cleared the, the adventure! He is quite the scope physique. Yeah. physique. yeah, this is pretty, pretty on par for the level, for level 9. That's all okay stuff. Oh my goodness, the Grasping Grove. A trail of the missing villagers leads you into the Eastern Wilderness. Well, that's a level 11 adventure, which is going to let us be a little bit higher level. This is neat. Yeah. I didn't know this whole East Pass thing was here. We should have been doing this the whole time. Um. Oh man, that was fun. 
I'm glad we got yeah, a little bit, little bit of a palate cleanser. So, uh, and it, 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 you know what? It's only fitting that I drag you down at the very last. <laughs> <laughs> Just like normal. I mean, I helped. I helped, but yeah, yeah sorry. I got, I got really, I got a little distracted, and I forgot that he. I was not paying attention to what paralytic poison actually did and how much damage Flippy was actually capable of doing. Because we, um, uh, we beat Glorm. We beat Glorm, the other one, so quickly. Then I was yeah. like, ah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. We got this. But partially it was because he also drew cowardly on turn one, so he had no attacks. Right, right. That's a good point. So we got to unload on him very quickly, but You're all good, Vorp. Thank you for coming. No problem at all. Oh my goodness. So yeah, I guess that'll be it for today. I am exhausted. That was so draining and I'm still yeah, still kinda hungry. The soup kinda helped. The soup kinda helped. But yeah, I am. Oh my goodness, that was that monkey. I can see, I can see why that monkey mission is a huge sticking point for people. That that was brutal. That was probably the hard. That was probably the hardest thing we've ever done on this on this stream. That was on, pretty brutal. In the series, I mean. Yeah, glad I was able to turn. Yeah, me too. I'm glad I was able to turn things around too. We are good, happy now. So. Dungeon of the Swamp King is already there, but it's level 17. Yeah, I'll take a big hug. Group hug for everybody! Group hug! Group hug! Yeah! So, um, I think that'll be it for today. So thank you everybody for coming tomorrow. Thank you, Brofi, for joining me in this adventure. Um, <laughs> Dungeon of the Swamp King. Uh, yeah, I guess so. Does he have swamp water? Perhaps. Let's see. Excuse me. Let's see. So um, next stream, we right. might be finishing the campaign or we might not. It depends on how many adventures and how hard they are. I mean, yeah. But uh, odds are not great that we do all five next stream, but okay. it's possible. Okay. Well, um, <laughs> we did manage to clear. We did manage to clear five adventures. This stream, and yes. they were very difficult. Most of them were very difficult. Two of them were normal difficulty. Mm -hmm. Two of them were really difficult, and one of them was super easy. Yeah. So, because I mean, we had better equipment too for the for the twi What is it called? Twilight and East Pass. Yeah. Yeah. Oh goodness. So yeah, tomorrow we're gonna be doing Retro Saturday. Retro Saturday is a super fun segment where we put old ret put uh, not necessarily old, but definitely retro games definably retro games on a wheel and we um spin that wheel and play whatever we land on so it'll be super great you should totally come check it out and for anybody who doesn't know maybe in the phantom audience i have a discord server i um it's a wonderful place where you can get access to my schedule as well as times when i go live and hang out with me and other low fans it's awesome tacular super fun you should totally come check it out because we talk about a lot of fun stuff like kayaks for and, some reason. Yeah, for some reason. Yeah, it's, it's just the natural order of things. It just makes sense, obviously. Kayaks are, uh, are a human's natural predator, so we would need to be aware of them. And monkeys. I guess we do talk about some monkeys. Do we talk about monkeys? I, I don't, don't want to even so. think about monkeys. I don't even know. We do not have a monkey channel. I'm not making a monkey channel. I will make an anti-monkey channel before I make a monkey channel. No more What's monkeys. What's a monkey? Huh? What's a monkey? What's a monkey? Yeah, I don't even know. I've never a, heard I, of it before. Never heard of it. Never heard of it in my Is it life. Tasty? <laughs> <laughs> no, but they might. Can they I sound it? annoying. <laughs> what did you say? Can I eat it? Can I eat it? Oh god. But yeah. Um. I had a well. Yeah. I had a great. I hope you guys had fun because I know I did. I had a great time hanging out with Brof. It's always fun to do do fun stuff with Brof. And um, yeah. Again, thank you, bro, for showing up, for um, dealing with my my tardiness. <laughs> I really appreciate uh, you. No problem. Being understanding. Come on and see the anti. No anti monkey channel. <laughs> no, nothing to do with monkeys. <laughs> Let's see. Um, and yeah, I love each and every one of you, and I hope you all have a wonderful, amazing, stupendous, wonderful, amazing, rest of your day. And I'll see all of you guys. Tomorrow. Next time. <laughs> Bye. Bye.